and ahoy, my friends. It's your friend streamer, occasional lover, Sabaton Leem here, back again in what seems like forever. Today we are playing a brand new game that just came out, even though it won't seem like a brand new game. It is a retro point and click game titled Chronicles of Insmith Mountains of Madness, which is based, of course, on Lovecraft's first book, At the Mountains of Madness. Can't wait to play this. It is going to be amazing. And to join me in this lovely, lovely adventure, we have Mr. Dale. Ah, boah! 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 How are we doing today, Dale? Oh, I've just been working off in my tool shed, but I'm fine. Dear God. <laughs> <laughs> and before we start, a big fat ahoy to Mel and Mr. Hello, Fogger. Mel. Awkward I want to play in Spagnolo. Spag... I'm sorry, what? Spagnolo. It sounds like pa a type of pasta, so I want to play in Spagnolo. <laughs> On the game? <laughs> <laughs> okay. Okay, I get you now. I get you. <laughs> Mel, I did not call you fat. God damn it, Mel. Stop it. Stop it. Bad Bell. I prefer chunky but funky. <laughs> yes. Love it. Okay. Now I kinda wanna play in Spagnolo. That, that, describes, <laughs> that describes Louis Armstrong pretty well. It chunky does. But funky. <laughs> oh, this is gonna be good. Alright. Now I can't wait to see what Innsmouth has to do with the mountains of madness. We shall see. Turn down the add a little bit. Normal text Normal and old text style or... text. Well we want old style text. We want the real old experience. Yeah. Text and voice though. Text and voice. Yep. Well I had a fun thing that happened to me in a D, &D game. What happened to you in your D, &D game? And let's get started into the mountains of madness. Antarctica, 1921. Mr. Tonic University, Lake Expedition, 4203. 4203. God, I love these games so much. There's something you must come see immediately. Slow down. Tell me everything. Slowly and clearly. <sighs> Professor. Professor. Found a good breath. An entrance. An entrance into the mountain. Oh. Yes, I would like to take the tutorial. Please select a dialogue option. A dialogue option. Certain <laughs> dialogue choices need to further dialogue option. <laughs> Investigate the dialogue options thoroughly. This may give All you right. more facts about the mysteries of your fate. Make sure you roll spot hidden to investigate <laughs> each of those three <laughs> options. I should get my dice out. <laughs> <laughs> Play using the flame speed in an ancient unclean brick sewer about 200 years old. Can I only imagine what happened then? Lots of fire. <laughs> Lots of fire. Uh, where is it located precisely? It located precisely? Precisely on the northeast side of the cliff. Unfortunately, it is covered by a thick layer of ice, probably formed over centuries, if not millennia, in laser. Oh, that actually sounds like a robot. I know. An unprecedented discovery. Oh no, me go infiltrator. Oh shit. Yes, Professor. Exactly where the findings we discovered indicated. Incredibly, we were able to decipher the coordinates. It was not easy, I can tell you. When was this discovered? Yesterday morning, Professor. The radio was unusable from there due to the strange magnetism present. I immediately... Luna, my dear, thank you so much for the lurk, and also welcome. Welcome, welcome. Big hearts for you, Luna. Uh, you pretty much killed over 150 people that were hiding in the sewer. The 200 guns that were on the other end almost killed himself, and... Holy shit, cunt! <laughs> Naruto, well, uh, you ba- <laughs> you... That, uh... That definitely outdoes Bobbit blowing up all those Kenku in that store. Wow, Naruto gifting all the subs, holy shit! Naruto, you madman, what have we got? Naruto is gifting five subs, holy shit! Oh, wow! Massive hearts to you, my friend, holy crap! 
Wow! Oh my god, that's... What a way to start a goddamn stream! Holy shit! That is amazing! <laughs> Thank you! I will drink my heartiest Red Bull to you, sir. Holy shit! Brattles! Holy fuck! <laughs> Ahoy, buddy! Welcome! And Dragon83, welcome, buddy. Getting everyone here. This is amazing. Thank you so very much. We haven't even started properly streaming. <laughs> I like the point. <laughs> and Brattles, thank you so much for the sub as well. Oh, my God. Oh. It's, it's, holy shit, this is amazing! You guys are fucking nuts, thank you! Holy fuck! Thank you for making these podcast cast past couple days amazing. You guys are fucking awesome. Let's get back to the game. <laughs> holy shit. The frozen findings discovered near the camp with an advanced board. Wow. They led to a specific place on the side of the gigantic hill. There we discovered an entrance, completely frozen over, but as natural formation. Fuck! I've got absolutely no words. So, I left him. Yeah, that's amazing. Oh my god! Prepare for it. Amazing. That is my god. That's a so awesome. Professor, thank you. And Johnson. Yes, Johnson. Dynamite. My name is Ryan. <laughs> My name is Ryan. <laughs> uh, and he's doing what I like to do in Call of Cthulhu, pack lots of dynamite. Yep. But if it was dynamite, <laughs> if it was D and D, it would be a jar of bees. Yeah, D and D. I still don't know what you plan to do with those bloody bees, but if it's Call of Cthulhu, dynamite. Yep. <laughs> I will find a use to those bees. Never you worry. Bring all the explosives to bear. God, I, I really have to step up our game now. All the subs just happened, I really have to... Bah. Hi guys! Ah! Oh, Brattles gifting the, gift the sub to Toe Jam. Holy shit, wait, we've got a hype train? Yep. Holy shit! My god, you guys are fucking awesome! Holy shit! Level 3 hype train has arrived. <gasps> toot toot! Oh my god. Gentlemen. Holy shit! Wow. <laughs> Brattles with the 69 biddies. <laughs> Oh, sp have them speaking of them about, about making a sensual discovery. So, Dale, did, have you read At the Mountains of Madness? I have. I have read At the Mountains of Madness. So you'll, you'll be like, nope, that's wrong, that's wrong, okay, that's right. It depends how closely they stick to the story, but I will also not correct it too much because I do want to run a campaign about the mountains of madness yes so I don't want to I don't want to give you too much knowledge about it of course of course perfect it contains the detonator for the explosives he kind of sounds like Peter Dinklage a bit. He does. The layer of ice that is if he was a bit more of a robot. <laughs> yes. There is a so, when he was in, um, oh shit, what's, what's the game where you play the robot? Destiny. Oh yeah, he was in Destiny, yeah, but they ended up replacing him with someone else. They did because he sounded too robotic. He sounded so boring, yeah. Try left clicking the crowbar to pick it up. 
We now have a Krupa! So, I'm going to inventory, move the mouse cursor to the top of the screen. King Salmon. Krupa! Pick up the crowbar to use it. Um, these crates? Yes! I've done it. Everything needed to make the detonator is contained inside. Very well, let's blow this shit out of this mountain. Yeah, that, that seems like a fantastic idea. <laughs> Unseal the elder things that no doubt live in there. Now all that's left is to make that dynamite do its thing. <laughs> now let the controls the game. You need to continue playing the game. One last thing. Pressing the mouse wheel or the tab key will highlight clickable object. Oh, okay. Oh, I like well, that. That's gonna be that's gonna be so useful. It's not gonna be any of that pixel hunting. I really like that. Everything is in place. Stay back. Stay back. Oh, the other things are out now. Yep, they're they're gonna come out now. We did well, shit. Go inside, Frog redeem stretch well, stretch time. In for a penny, in for a pound, you've already blown the thing open, you may as well go inside. Just keep adding those bad decisions. Yep. It's gonna be Smithy and Insanity all over again. Yep. <laughs> yep, if anyone's gonna go insane in the mountains, it's Vanus. Yep. Oh! Naruto with the 500 bitty cheers! Holy shit! Thank you, dude! You've, you've done holy. You've done enough! My god, you are awesome, sir! Take this bro fist, my good sir! You are fucking amazing! Holy shit! Wow! But thank you so very much! It is definitely the second largest kill count. Come see. The largest is close to 2,000 in my D&D &D game world. Wow, 2,000 kill count. Holy shit. Well, you see, I want to go murder Hobo, but Dale won't let me. And, and the party won't let me. Professor. Yes, Atwood. Do you know Pabodi from the engineering department? Yes. I think I remember him. I mean, hell, if we ever go back to uh, Nomingard, I think... um. That village may, may be wiped off the map. <laughs> yep, that's why you're never gonna come. <laughs> <laughs> there's, there's two elder things in the ice there. Oh, shit. Wasn't exactly Mur Murder Hobo two mages with a real broad idea. Oh, oh speaking of mages with a broad idea, um, our old mage in the last campaign had. Fantastic ideas! <laughs> yep. Yeah, I imagine this campaign's got some interesting ideas as well, like... I'm sorry, it's... Buy a bomber shop. It's not gonna be as good as Operation Pizza Oven. No, not as good as Operation Pizza Oven. <laughs> Definitely not. Luna, you did miss the hot train. The hot train was amazing. You guys are amazing, and oh shit, and yep, yep, they've woken up. This is bad. Shit. You know, that's actually the first hop train I've ever gotten. Wow, well, well done. You guys. It came through with doot doot. Where do we go now? How would he escape from that hellish town? Innsmouth. Oh, we are going to Innsmouth. Okay. It's it's Innsmouth. I I thought it was Innsmouth. Yeah, I've always heard it. I think this game is wrong. I've always heard it pronounced ah. Innsmouth. I'm still alive. And missing a few body parts. <laughs> yep. Oh my god. Well, my friends, welcome to the Mountains of Madness. 
Okay. Getting a lovely sneak peek of the next Call of Cthulhu campaign, where we're going to be going to Innsmouth and spending the whole campaign there. This this is a good week for horror games. It is. Like we've got Lost from Beyond, which technically came out last week. Um, Arkham Horror, which I just found out has turn-based combat. It does have turn-based combat, yes. And this, it's, it's, yes, and this. It, it's it's a good time to be a Cthulhu fan. It is. Give us more. Yes. Uh, I'd be more more happy with more point and click games. Yeah, it's a dead jo it's a dead genre, so it's nice to see see one when it pops up. Oh, we got a uh, yeah one one um mage said that start. Hey, yeah. transmute rock it's to mud. Exactly the other mage, screw it. Have been through. Screw it, dig, collapse, and the whole mountain on itself. <laughs> oh, oh, I collapsed the entire mountain on itself. <laughs> Murdering an entire city of dwarves and dropping a frost giant castle. I actually have no idea how many bodies were actually there. As a DM, I just ran it up to 2,000 and stopped. <laughs> <laughs> Ain't no genocide like mage genocide. <laughs> <laughs> oh my <Fantastic>. god. <laughs> wow, don't tell him to. <laughs> no. So many dead dwarfs. Yes. <laughs> okay, he said Innsmouth. Yep. So we got one character in Innsmouth and one in Antarctica. Soul survivor on that fellow missionary priest. Still alive. Fools. I'm liking the artwork. It, it's cartoony, but no, it, it's cool it's not it like actually reminds cartoony. me of the artwork in Call of Cthulhu Adventure books. They have artwork that basically looks like that. In the end, I came to believe his tale. Like the Escape from Innsmouth book that I'm going to run in the next campaign. This is what oh, artwork looks like. A horror beyond description. That's a shock off. That is a shock off. Oh. The priest managed to get away. Of course the priest got away. <laughs> yep. I was not quite so lucky. I thought you got eaten by a shock off, did you? Okay. Well, but here I stand. Able to tell you all of this. And it's from this point on that I want you to hear my story. Can do. Oh, okay, he's got all his limbs back, okay. <clears throat> Pardon me? Just got eaten by a shot. Oh, yeah. No, nothing much, nothing much. I'm still really um, impressed and surprised and love the fact you press tab and uh, uh, interactable items show up. That, yeah, that is... That's really cool in a game like this. I'm still in one piece. Because... To the older generation, aka me and you, Dale, since you make games like this as well, you can re really appreciate it because sometimes it gets really, yeah. really frustrating trying to find something. Yes, when you're trying to click just that one spot to pick something up. Yeah. Like, oh. There we go, look, there's lots of things to check out. Just gonna look at Innsmouth. The infamous town of Innsmouth, guarding the secrets that will kill to keep. I got it. Only by the skin of my teeth. Looks like a from a broken crate. I'd say, knowing what goes on around here, the crate was most likely thrown overboard in a scramble to avoid official scrutiny. Mm. Ideas forming in my mind about how to get myself over to really lost summer. water effects. Yeah, I know. I can't even swim in shallows, let alone on the open sea. Oh, of course, because you're an adventure game Plank of character. Wood washed up on the shore. It looks quite sturdy. Plank of wood. I can't carry two at the same time. Oh shit! We're gonna build a. We're gonna try to get that crate. Some strong looking weeds. Oh! Oh, we're building we're a raft. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. So that's what we're doing. So we'll probably need the crate to finish building this. I don't think the planks are enough to support me yet. Hmm. I need to get the crate out somehow. Well, what, what crate? 
the one that's floating in the water there. Oh, the plank of wood. Oh, that plank of wood, yeah. Let's give this a try. You said it was a crate, but... <gasps> ah! There we go. Alright, so now, with all three, I think that should be enough to make the raft. Can't carry. So I suppose, how do you... I suppose you put all three of them I down in the, the same spot? And from my previous game, they still wanted to. They have about twenty thousand gold piece bounty on them. <laughs> Is this <laughs> loosely based off the Sierra games? Yes, yes, it does appear to be based off um the old, you know, Sierra and LucasArts style games. Which is a genre you don't see a lot of these days. There we go, so you stack, yeah, stack them all up uh, and then you should be able to... Oh, yep. I see, I see, I see, I see. You can use no, I mean, the Sierra Call of Cthulhu games. Oh, the Chaosium Call of Cthulhu games. Ah, uh, yeah, yes. Um, like, uh, Prisoner of Ice and Shadow of the Comet. Yes. Um, well, they're both based on Lovecraft, obviously, but I don't think this will be directly based on those because no. those are Chaosium licensed games that are based on the tabletop game and this is based off the book The Mountains of Madness and yeah, Papa Agron based... hold... oh my god we're getting raided holy shit oh, but also Papa Agron ahoy you big beautiful bastard and Kins Kinserpai Kinserpai I hope that is how I pronounced it but it is a hashtag day day raid over on YouTube Holy shit! Wow, this is... This is holy shit! Wow, what the hell? <laughs> Finally, the hype trade was still here. And here is the man himself, Day Day Legend and Water Buffalo. Welcome, my dear friends. I toast you with a Red Bull. Dale, do you <laughs> have anything to toast with? Do you have a Dr. Pepper or something? Why, do you... Is it Dr. Pepper? No, Mountain Dew. I drink... I, I drink... Dr. Pepper, I drink Mountain Dew, but I have right here a can of Dr. Pepper with creaming soda, so I will just toast everyone with that. Okay, and Naruto Wolf, welcome my friends, thank you so much for the amazing raid, I am your host, Sabaton Liam, the disembodied voice you're hearing is one of my good mates, Dale, who also is our Dungeon Master and Keeper of Arcane Knowledge, over, yep, over on the Dungeons and Dagons channel. Which I suggest, strongly suggest you go find if you are fans of D and D and Call of Cthulhu. We stream there every D and D every week. Call of Cthulhu every second week. Second week, yep. And we got both this week. <laughs> we do. And Naruto Shad is part of that raid as well. Thank you, Naruto. Sh you guys are amazing. Holy shit! You two be in my comments. <laughs> no, no. I saw you, Papa. I said hello. Don't you call me out like that. And Pop Papa just went, Dale! Papa! Vector! Payment up front. The party missed Vector, but his legacy was felt. Yeah. Payment up front became a permanent rule of the party. <laughs> Alright, um, does... Can one of my mods please get Day Day's... Day Day... The, the, Day Day Man's... Thank you, I got it. Uh, his link in the chat. Spam that shit. Go to his channel. Go give him a sub. Thank you so very much. You guys are awesome. Uh, hey, shout out. I finally get to see one of your comments. <laughs> on YouTube, so I'll handle that. Thank you, Master Dale. Oh my god. We're not even... 10 minutes in this game and this has gone completely fucking nuts. Yes. Stay out of sight. Shush. Make the slightest sound, please. Rest at ease. You're lucky you ran into me first. Yeah, that doesn't sound like it. One in town you can trust. Yeah. Just want to get out of here. Thank you, Papa Agron. Find an old abandoned railway that He's reminded me of the drunk guy from the Dagon movie. <laughs> he is. Well, see this. 
I think, I think, I can't remember, because it's been a long time since I've read Shadow Over Innismith, but I'm pretty sure there is a drunk sort of sailor guy in it, and I think this character is based on him, and it's the same character in Dagon would be based on him. Do you have any whiskey for the good Zadok? Oh, Zadok! Zadok. Why do we even let this smelly old trap Okay, what the hell is wrong with the people? Well, they're... They've got the instrument tank. Like oh, oh, okay, you go, you're gonna have to share some um, knowledge with me. What what's that? Well, they've got deep they've got deep one blood in them. Oh. Because most of the people who live in Innsmouth are descended from deep ones. Oh. Okay. Even though they're not even though they're not deep ones themselves. They have deep one blood. That's why the town is so secretive. Oh, okay. And they don't like outsiders because, you know, they don't want outsiders to learn the secret that most of the town is descended from deep ones. Alright, so I'm this little guy here and I'm assuming we don't want to run into these people walking around. Yeah, I would assume that's what we're supposed to do. But I have no idea where I'm meant to go. I assume we're trying to get to the train tracks? To get out of the town? I really, really don't know. I can't even press tab because there's... Well, I can press tab, but nothing's showing. Oh, yeah, well, we so I go. would assume we're trying to get to the train station. Or to just walk along the tracks to get out of the town. Ah, there we go, there we go, there we go. Uh, we've got 16 and people watching. Holy fuck, balls. Yeah, that's, a, that's, that's well done. <gasps> Achievement unlocked. Yeah, Woo! Get to the train station. <laughs> he traveled in seclusion out of fear that they were following him. To the gates of hell! As we may cut away <laughs> to heaven! Kinso Pie and Day Day Man, thank you for the follow on Twitch, guys, and welcome to the Twitch side. Of the metal crew. Welcome aboard, my friends. Oh, Jesus fucking Christ. This, this stream, holy shit. This, I, I've, I've really needed something like this today. Honestly. Yes, and it's good. It happened. And I have a message from Papa on Discord. So we've escaped from Innsmouth now, and... Let's grab some shut -eye. Oh, and here we have the bots in Twitch. Uh, of course. Can you deal you with know, that, please, always... Dale? Yeah, seven, if they're on Twitch. I don't know if I'm a moderator on Twitch. Oh, um, uh, you should be. I think, yeah, but I'm locked in as Dungeons and Dagon. So <laughs> oh, okay, well, uh, just yeah. type in there and I'll give you a mo mod status. Yep. Mod man. Uh, no, not time. I'll kill the bots. Uh, there we go. Ah, thank you, Nubruto. Uh, you lovely. Now let's get rid of these. And also our mod status for Mr. Naruto. Let's get rid of these bots. Okay. Hello there, you. Mod is a Naruto. You have done fantastic work. Um. Not only beating my streams a lot, but also the last two streams. Holy shit, your generosity. My fucking god, man. You are amazing. Thank you so very much. As I said, I need it today. You guys have made made this fucking amazing. I have not been doing well over the past few days, and you guys have boosted me above and beyond. Oh! Oh! Naruto, you crazy bastard, just gifting another sub to Day Day Man. Holy. But we will remedy that. Continue. Yes. My fucking god. Bots destroyed. Naruto has gifted 12 subs in my channel. Holy shit. Nobody has ever survived a sugar. I have! <laughs> yeah, you have. 
Oh. We're no longer we're no longer in um Innsmouth, but we will be seeing much more of Innsmouth in the next Call of Cthulhu campaign. <laughs> yeah, we will. Uh, I'm interested and excited and nervous how I'm going to play a child. Yeah, well, that's going to be fun because I know exactly how to tie that child in. But I'm trying to work work on a, um, a voice as well. <laughs> I'm pretty sure the book even has specific rules on how to make a child. Like it tells you which which stats to modify and how much to take and add and stuff. This is not the time to analyze these old cases. I have to call on the touch. You have a lot of stuff in your office, buddy. There's no time now. You must call on No, I want to explore. Mm. M2 stuff. will be playing as Mayor Mike. <laughs> That's gonna be amazing. <laughs> Running for mayoral office in like Arkham. And just using the stuff happening in nearby Innsmouth as what right he now. thinks is his stepping stone to becoming place. mayor of Arkham. <laughs> we we have to throw in a Resident Evil reference somewhere in there. <laughs> oh yes. M2's already got it sorted. <laughs> <laughs> Brilliant. <laughs> He's oh. already thought of the reference he's gonna make. Mm, lamp. Lamp. Oh, that's probably not a good idea. Oh, where is Papa Inking? Um, I suggest Papa is still lurking on uh, the YouTube's. Papa's in, yeah. Papa's on YouTube. He, that's what he does best. He does a lurk. He does a lurk. Yes. And I still appreciate the looks. I really honestly do. I appreciate any activity. I've been waiting on news from you for weeks. Beside myself with worry. Weeks? Yes. 33 days to be precise. Oh my. Enough with the paddling. Have you found my brother? I'd rather talk about it in person. When can I meet you at Miskatonic? Immediately. I'll see you shortly then. Alright, now we're called Armitage, now we can have a look around. I have no time to analyze these old cases. Oh my god, seriously? <laughs> no time. Ah yes, Melvin Books. Melvin Books. Hi Mickey. Hi hello. I haven't seen you around in a while. I've been working here and there. I see. Take care, Lo. Ah, uh, see. Well, take care. Take care, buddy. Hey, <laughs> <Ailey> Pete. <laughs> if I ever want to redecorate my office, I'll think about grabbing. No time for that. Armitage's multitude of books. Multitude of books. <laughs> Papa <laughs> joined Twitch side very quick. No time for that. I will take your fruit, thank you. Some fruit! Some fruit! saturated fats. Yeah! I only eat saturated fats. <laughs> exactly, I don't like fruit. Too healthy. Manlio, how you doing? No, been a while. Been a month or more than I'd see ya. Yeah, I was busy. How's your mom doing? Oh, but still going strong. Good to be here. See you soon. Stop by whenever you like. That is not a creepy voice whatsoever. Yeah, the fruit seller sounds really <laughs> creepy. <laughs> Percy Naughty Ariet is fruit seller! Do you want to buy some fruit? <laughs> oh, okay, what have we got? Well, I guess we're going to Miskatonic University. I don't want to, bad shit happens there. No, yep. Mel, I am not a hentai. Not yet. That's in my private time. Good morning. <laughs> Good work. Thanks. Same right back at you. But if you'll excuse me, I'm a bit busy here. Of course. Sorry. Okay, I don't know if they're yeah, doing... I'm just doing the garden. <laughs> I don't know if they're doing this on purpose, but it sounds like... like it I... sounds like in's mouth. Um, uh, I was more getting it. Um, Pointy click... Uh, games back in the 90s when they first actually started doing voice, they all sound, yeah. sounded like this. I'm not sure yeah, if it's on only purpose. Had, they only had like two or three actors that like played every character, so yeah, maybe maybe it's a throwback. What can we do for you? I'm gonna 
gonna just assume it's a throwback because it is fucking amazing. Yes. Yes. Doctorates of medicine. I mean, hell, when no, I no, made no, a no. when I made yes. a Lovecraft game, of the I voiced Ooh, all of yeah. the characters myself. Oh, and it ended up sounding like an old point and click game. Oh, that's awesome. Look, when, when you actually make a game and add voices in, include me in M2. Yes, of course. The fuck is this? The fuck? Oh, Dark Death, ahoy, my friend. Welcome to the stream. This is Chronicles of Innsmouth Mountains of Madness, which is based off the HP Lovecraft book. Uh, at the Mountains of Madness. Uh, and just... also Shadow Over Innsmouth. Yes, and Shadows Over Innsmouth. Just came out today. I was originally going to stream Arkham Horror Mothers Embrace or Lost, Lost from Beyond, but we decided on doing this. And no you regrets. You know, Liam, he has a softness for point-and-click games. I do. I really do. It's always going to be this. But everyone calls me But, Dark, you have missed an amazing opening to the stream. Naruto, yeah, yeah, hype train and everything. Naruto, the sexy bastard he is, has gifted so many goddamn subs. Uh, Brad gave me 69 biddies. <laughs> Naruto also gave me 500 biddies. It's been amazing. <laughs> oh, you guys are so awesome. Okay, uh, how do I get out of this? How do I get out of this? Oh, shit. And to... And to make it... <laughs> make it the perfect stream, it had to be on a Lovecraft point click game. And Brad just... <laughs> thank you so much for the 69 biddies again, Brad. <laughs> <laughs> oh. oh, Brad is actually one of my uh, in real life friends from Ballarat. He used to um, work at the local Guff, but years ago when I was in high school, he used to work at the Drag Dragon's Lair, which was an old video games rental shop. Oh, lovely. And Brad is one of the nicest guys you will ever meet. He is also a streamer. So... Ooh. We'll have to check him out. I recommend that everyone on the Twitch side go to Technospawn's channel and check him out. He is really funny. Oh. So he used to work at Guff, so I take it he's really into magic and... <laughs> and Naruto, <laughs> thank you so much for gifting Dark Death a sub. <laughs> Oh, you crazy bastard. Okay, okay, I'll be back. This calls for something harder. Naruto, this is for you. Cracking open a Captain Morgan. Cheers. Yeah. Oh, that's some good shit. Okay, okay. So we talk to these people. How do we stop? Until next time. Henry Armitage. Yes, he's the curator of the library. A true gentleman. A true gentleman. Oh, until, until next, next time. time. Good day. Is there anything else? Um. Miskatonic University Library. I have not had the pleasure of sending you guys there yet. Keyword yet. And I'm assuming there'll be a reanimated reference. Oh, I'm assuming there'll be a reanimated reference there. After all, that's where um that's where Herbert West got all these materials from. I can't reach it. Portrait. Disturbing. The landscape. Vibrant. <laughs> Excuse me. Excuse me. Oh. See that we're engaged in a vital discussion. Some space, please. Oh, jeez. I just wanted to look at the painting. As if you could even understand. <laughs> it forced me to challenge you to a <laughs> away. <laughs> Sometimes ignoring the enemy can be the best strategy. Fair enough. <laughs> Previous position was as a member of staff in Armitage's office. It seems he's been demoted. I've not had a drink in a few days, not feeling so hot. So if I'm in and out, so. Oh, gee. That is quite alright, Doc. That is quite alright, buddy. His previous position was as a member of staff in Armitage's office. 
It seems he's been demoted. Go on in. Armitage is waiting for you. Thanks. I'm pretty sure in the Innsmouth campaign we might actually get a chance to go to Miskatonic University. Oh, Armitage. brilliant. Because Arkham is right He's next coming. to Innsmouth, and when you're not in Innsmouth, you're going to be living your lives in Arkham, so... As either visitors or patients. Oh, I was just yes. <laughs> around studying some texts. You look well. I have some bad news for you. <sighs> Go on. Your brother didn't make it. I'm sorry. How did it happen? I'm not sure you want to know the details right now. <sighs> oh, it's what I paid you for. I found him in the tunnels that run under Innsmouth. I didn't make it inside. Who did this? Who? It seems the laws of civilized society mean nothing, Innsmouth. Apparently your brother and Elliot stuck their noses somewhere they shouldn't have. This Elliot you speak of was dead too? Sure, why not? He's still alive oh, right okay, never mind. We both escaped with our lives by a hair. An impossible creature attacked us. I still have no idea how I managed to survive the attacks. <laughs> yeah, that one is a bit, I don't know where bit suspicious. <laughs> Yeah. Yeah. To make some yeah. I will get back to you soon. In the meantime, try getting in touch with one of my contacts. No. A man by the name of William Blanco. He writes for those cheap pulp magazines, but is also an expert on the occult. He often comes by here. He simply devours the rare texts that only we possess. Sadly, I do not know his address or even a telephone number. But I'm sure, for a detective of your reputation, finding him will be but a trivial matter. Discuss with him everything you have discovered, and I'm sure he will get back to me. I'll see you later then, I guess. Alright, uh, okay. Let's... What? We're getting an M1 tomorrow? You can't tell what kind of books they are from here. Wait, what? Can't tell what kind of books they are from here. Cold fucked up and didn't put him on on D&D. Kind of oh, brilliant! Here. Oh, I got achievement. Make love, not craft. Oh, it's a picture of Lovecraft. <laughs> yeah, that. Yeah. Well, I mean, it's still a disturbing portrait. Have you Some seen? Physics. Have you seen the man look creepy? He looks like he's. Uh, I love the meme. Each picture of him looks like he's got a bird in his mouth. Oh yep. <laughs> Organic chemistry. Geography. Parapsychology. I have no idea what parapsychology is. Pedagogy. So, parapsychology is like in the 1920s and 30s, it's what they basically called, you know, people who study like psychic powers and stuff like that. Right ah! Well, so, like, go. if you were a parapsychologist, <clears throat> then you were basically like an occult researcher. Oh, like Max. Yes, yes, like Max. <clears throat> or like Agent Ambrose. Some space, please. No, okay, fuck you. Okay, I'm backing off. Downright rude. Damn right. Fuck you. Alright, where are we going? Should have really been paying attention. <laughs> Uh, university... Ah, I'm assuming back to the office. Maybe make a phone call? The mailman must have been by while I was out. Strange. He's mail gone more man. than a month and there's no mail waiting. And the moment I'm home, there's some is. Yeah, ain't that how it always works out? You order a bunch of things from Amazon, so they don't come cases. and then they all come on it's one day. Red Hook. What's red? Is Red Hook anything that I should know about? Or is... I've never heard of it. Okay. Oh wait, Red Hook is a Red Hook is a district of Arkham. I remember this because in the first episode of the next campaign, you specifically have to go to Red Hook to investigate something. Ah. Oh, there's the mail. And Red Hook is like it's the dodgy part of Arkham, where like all the Criminals hang out and where you get mugged if you walk there at night time and stuff. Letter. Long. I've been trying to get in touch with you for days. I absolutely need you to look into a case I'm working on. 
I'm as soon as you came to the crime scene on Walton Street. Hey, Logan. Oh, man. I haven't heard from him. Not the since. Logan. A Logan. Yeah, a Logan. Alright, so we are going to the station. That's cool that it highlights um, <clears throat> the new places to go. That is good, yes. I do like that it's got like this little map thing because, you know, in the, in an old adventure game... Holy fuck, like, okay. Yeah, that's... Sorry, go on. I was going to say, in an old adventure game, you'd probably have to like walk across the whole town. Yeah. Whereas this one's just a map. Holy fuck. Yeah. He's uh, missing his <clears throat> bottom... I guess it's there on the bed. This is some... Well, of course, Lovecraft shit, but... A Hellraiser shit right here. Yes. Well, Hellraiser is part of the Lovecraft mythos anyway, so... I'm sorry, what? Yeah, Hellraiser's part of the Lovecraft mythos. Holy shit, I had no idea! That is fucking awesome! Clive... Yeah, um, yeah, um, a lot of 80s horror is actually, like I'm sure everyone knows Evil Dead is part of the Lovecraft mythos. Oh, and, and, um, <coughs> Friday the 13th is part of the Lovecraft, uh, not Lovecraft, Evil Dead, it was actually... Yeah, so by extension, Friday the 13th is part of the Lovecraft mythos. Oh my god. Ritual Homicide? Bud, fill my friend in on this whole gruesome affair. Certainly, Captain. Certainly! The landlady called the station this morning to report that she had found Mr. Gillum hanging, mutilated, here in his Oh, that's a woman on the bed. Sarah Rupert disemboweled oh. in the bed. Did the lady in question have access to the victim's room? That has yet to be established. I spoke with her earlier. Apparently, she found the door ajar. I doubt she was lying, given the state of shock she was in. It's unlikely she has the stomach for such a macabre act. We had to call an ambulance to tend to her. She was fainting at my feet. The corpses were gutted. Liver and pancreas have both have been removed. Mmm, tasty Even pancreas. His eyes and mouth Goes well with the Nascente. Besides the fact that his lower half is still yet to be found. Records show that the girl over there, Sarah Rupert, not reside here. There you go, um, Naruto. Papa's got YouTube and Twitch open. The victim was a student of parapsychology. He's just Miskatonic University. Being a good boy, just lurking. Just lurking in the shadows, staring at my booty, working the shaft. Yeah, if, if we ever make a campaign with Max Power in it again, that's what his his job will be parapsychology. I, I thought we were. I thought we were doing a prequel campaign. Well, we were, yeah, but I don't know how far down on the list it is. Yeah. Because it was going to be a, it was going to be about the length of No Man's Land, so I was kind of saving it for an in-person one. Horrible. Who could do Horrible. such a thing? Horrible. Uh, I don't want to touch that. Yes, you do. Touch it. Good for you. you touch, touch it. it. Touch it. Touch your hand and insert your you hand inside the bottom of his torso. <laughs> Treat him like a puppet. It's like some drink from it. Ew. Oh, girl. A blank piece of paper. Take it. Alone, please don't touch anything. Ah, fuck you. Scene photographer is on his way. Sure. Nope. Well, I hope the photographer's not being played by M1. Prime scene photographer. <laughs> sure. Because otherwise he'll screw up all the photos. Alan? Yes. How's it going? Good, Lon. A lot has changed since you left. My promotion up the ranks has been quite stressful. Yeah, congratulations. I hadn't heard. Thanks. About the Zilletto. I'd like to know who sent that letter in your name. I have no idea how to look into that any further. But it weighs heavily on my mind, too. They know who both you and I are. Yep. Yep. It's not the nicest of neighborhoods, if I remember correctly. Right. No. But it is not unheard of to find decent people of lesser means living here for the rock bottom rent. Well, I mean, the campaign I've got planned has some pretty 
fucked up stuff going on in the neighborhood of Red Book, but nothing like this. <laughs> Can't wait. Thanks, Lone. That's going to be the next campaign, isn't it? That's the one after we finish Dalton Remember Green. We're going details? and doing Innsmouth. No, Innsmouth. I would say no. Remember well, I call it Innsmouth, I... but you're going to be spending just as much time in Arkham because it's the town right next to it. And it's not really safe to research stuff in Innsmouth. So you have to do your research it. in Arkham. Yeah. But touch, touch her. It. Her skin's purple. Touch her. Touch it. I want to Open touch her it. eyes. See what they I look like. Kiss her. Put your finger in her mouth. <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Third Eye, ahoy buddy. Welcome to the YouTube side of the stream. I certainly hope you're going well, my friend. And please, enjoy. Enjoy the mountains of madness. Alright. Uh. Lone, please don't. The crime scene. Sure. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I get no, no, stop. Integral part of the crime. A very laborious ritual. Probably the lair of some rodents. Please do not touch it. The crime scene. For oh, god damn it! I want to touch things. Let me touch things. What sort of detective do you think I am? Sure. Well, I can't. I... <laughs> so I need to touch nice things to get room. clues. I don't know how you policemen do your job. But in my world, I touch things, and that's how I get also clues. Some on Probably doubled as his dining table. Uh, I really don't know what to do now. Leave. Is there anywhere else to go? Uh, Plans office. And the university. University and slum. So this is where we already are. Oh no, talk to Ah. Uh, remember any No. No fashion cut. Look at that thing, that little crank there near the bed. Lone fleet right. Sure. Ah, he so won't let you yeah, to block, out the sun. block out the sun. Yeah, so the uh -huh. So they were blocking the sun when they killed him. A strange mechanism to block out the sun. Lone, please don't crime. Sure. Alan? Yes. Watch that. Let's know if I find. Thanks, Lone. Uh. There's gonna be something here. Why, me? Also, some problem. One piece of paper. Lone, please crime. Sure. Uh, do, 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 do. I don't want to touch that. It sends a shiver on my victim's blood is weird residue lay around. Hmm. hmm. Well, what about hole in the there's a hole in the wall next to the door there. And they still told told me not to do not touch anything. Oh. The crime scene oh, wow, he's getting sure. very aggravated. <laughs> Please don't touch anything. Uh, let's go back to the university. Guard you enter the crime scene, what would you like to do? Yeah, I'd like to investigate it. Okay, make a roll hidden check. <laughs> yeah. I passed. Don't touch okay. anything, but I passed. As you, as you, yeah, as you, as you see something interesting, you go up to get a closer look, and the detective barks, Don't touch it! Photographer's on his way, but I, but I passed it, I got it, I got a, I got a heart. Don't touch it! Armitage, please, love. I need some time. Alright. God damn. Okay. They won't let me talk to them because they're rude ass hats. Yep. Oh, third eye, you're having a cocktail. What are you having, buddy? I've got some lovely Caps Morgan here. I thought it was appropriate that I have a celebratory drink with the amazing generosity all of you guys have shown me today. I'm I'm still in fucking all of um Techno Spawn and Naruto. You guys are fucking amazing. Did you know this game is a sequel? Good morning. It is? Oh, to nice what? Sir. There's a game that's just called Chronicle of Innsmouth, and it's also a point and click. I live next door. Okay, I have to get that. Nope. No delivery yet. 
I'll send Thanks. you the link to that. Oh, fantastic. Oh, yes, the novels. <laughs> My Super Spider-Man first edition comic book. Hence the name. Nice to meet you, pal. Maybe you can help me out. Of course, his name's Melvin. Publishes them hack horror stories. Something like weird tales? Yeah, exactly. I'm afraid we're having stuff. Vodka straight button. Tales is a theme of love problems for a Neruda, oh, Papa, holy shit, Neruda just gifted a sub to Papa, that makes 14 subs you've gifted. He's on a roll. Holy shit. And I love what uh, Third Eye put, uh, vodka's straight but I'm not. <laughs> oh, Third Eye, I would cheers to that, buddy. That's definitely Naruto. Holy shit. Thank you so very much. I can't say thank you enough. Do you work in this building? Yeah. I've been living it to be honest. What's that? What I'm gonna get from the Twitch payout is more than I'll get in a week from from work. Well, you just a small bastard. Tread lightly alone. It's either this or a trip to Boston. Oh no not Boston! Boston! Jack Water! <laughs> I really hope Kiosk can make another game. I really do. Well, apparently the people who made the Sinking City are trying to get licensing from Chaosium to do a actual Call of Cthulhu game. Yes, Papa, definitely Pog. Shadow is definitely Pog is right, the, right here. <laughs> Water Buffalo, can we make it 15? <laughs> oh, look, I, I'm, speaking of Secret City, I really want to get into playing it, but I just... It, it's just too clunky. Yeah, it is. It's just... Yeah, it's just just a little bit too unpolished. Yeah, and I should have been shutting up while this guy while these guys are talking. about Jesus Christ! <laughs> oh my fucking god, Naruto! <laughs> oh, he's doing it again. Oh fuck me! <laughs> You've broken me! Oh. Thank you so much, buddy. My god. What are you made of money? Holy fuck. He's oh. Jeff Bezos. He just that doesn't want anyone to know. <laughs> Naruto, seriously, thank you so fucking much. Oh my god. Arrogant little scumbag. If I convinced you a bit more forceful, like roll, like an alarm going off, <laughs> roll intimidation <laughs> check. You round, little blackmailer. The end justifies the means. Oh, I really should have been listening to all that. This makes me want to make a point and click game. Do it. Physics My check got deposit. Oh. Magazines on current affairs and science. Novels and smut books. Ooh, give me. I have no time to read right now. Give me a smut Aww. book, damn it! Give it to me! I, no I can't see what those are from here. Holy crap, Ivy! Welcome! Holy shit! Welcome, Ivy. Liam Dale, chat. How are you, my lovely human beings? I am doing fantastic. Oh, I'm a human being. <laughs> I am doing fantastic. The generosity of Naruto and everyone else in the stream has been fucking amazing. I've got a constant 15 people watching at the moment, which is fucking amazing. Holy shit. She but thinks I'm a human being. Concentration <laughs> is complete. <laughs> fucking Migo. Uh, 
Jeez, I wouldn't damage it just by taking a small peek. Impossible. Except <laughs> in certain special cases. Like that favor I asked of you. I really sh yeah, should have been listening. What this game needs is a journal. That's what it needs. Why is Are we Dale sure it doesn't have a journal? <laughs> Why is upset Dale upset about being a human being? Uh, no, it doesn't no. have a journal. I'm saying, I'm saying, <gasps> you, mean, you called me a human being, so that means my infiltration of your planet is going off without a hitch. And Naruto just gifted Ivy a sub. Naruto, you crazy <laughs> bastard! Oh my god, yeah, I'm gonna fucking tear up soon. <laughs> Jesus fucking Christ. Thank you so much. Like, it's, it's, it's not only that, it's just the fact that you're here for the streams and you, you enjoy the streams as well. It's like, seriously, thank you so fucking, fucking much to all you guys as well. I really can't thank you enough. Like, holy shit. I'm, I'm just going to keep playing. That's what you're here for. Just, just gameplay. Play the dang game. Liam, shut up and start playing the goddamn game. <laughs> Look, but don't touch. That's what is written. Uh. <laughs> There's no one I need to. I really don't know what to do. I feel at home in the shadow. Oh, okay. <laughs> this for a day <laughs> offering Naruto the crown just for a day though just for a day I really think king. I'm missing something but I think we are I, I, we must be missing something here can you move the bed sheet I want to touch it oh no Sarah Rupert Surgical work. The internal organs have been removed. What kind of maniac would do this? I don't want to touch. A it. maniac who eats organs. Nobody could say this isn't a nice, bright room. Well, yeah, they, they can. Yeah, out the sun when they killed him for some reason. Oh, girl. Bane. Integral part of the crime. A very laborious ritual. Fashion. Remember any old no, no, fashion cap? Don't mind me, I just be sitting here with me, pen and paper. Making a D and D character. Old friend, Alan? Yes. Can you tell me anything more about the victim. We've already given you all the information we have so far. I get a feeling this is gonna be a rough one. But luck sent you here, right? Yeah, sure. <laughs> yep, luck. How's it going? Good, Long. A lot has changed since you left. My promotion up the ranks has been... Yeah, congrats. Thanks. All right, already heard that. Let you know, thanks. <sighs> Jesus Christ. Remember it? No. <sighs> Horrible. Who could do so? Uh, God damn it. <laughs> okay, um... See? See, this is the problem is when we get stuck like this, if it was an older game, we would just look at a walkthrough. This game just came out today. There's no walkthrough. We have to use our brain. Although, if it did come out, like, hours and hours ago, there probably would be a walkthrough already. I just checked I on like Steam, and people work. have not put anything up. Although, I suppose someone on YouTube might have. Usual mess. I think he's... Spare set of lockpicks. Oh, fine. Lost my last pair on Innsmouth. Oh, okay. Okay. Uh, okay. Yes. Yep. This could come in handy. I like. I like. I like. I'm not wearing. I never take off the coat wrap. What else would it be? Uh, okay, so we got a set of lockpicks. No way, 
could we use that? Hello, Mr. Carter. Where are we with the list? I'm working on it. Shit, what? Screw you and your list. Do I need to give more subs? <laughs> Naruto, my god. You are too kind, buddy. You are too kind. Jesus Christ. <laughs> oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Okay, um... Naruto... Alright, Naruto redeemed... Wear the helmet. Uh, sorry, I just saw it. I just saw it. I'm so sorry. I'll get... Alright, go put your helmet on. Okay, where do I put it? Ugh. Holy shit, we're getting another fucking raid? Oh my god! Okay, yeah. Well, I mean, this game did just come out today, so people don't want to see it. Alright. Now, with, with this helmet on, I'm not going to be able to hear anything. And without the glasses, <laughs> I won't be able to see anything. <laughs> but it was redeemed, and Naruto, Naruto is poggers at the moment. Uh, okay, who we got? Um, uh, <laughs> uh, sorry, I really can't see without my glasses at the moment, but, uh, Sha Boinky Boink. <laughs> Love the name. <laughs> Monique, oh, uh, Fior, and Fulfill Your Destiny. Moment. Welcome, my dear friends. I am your host, Boba Fett. <laughs> 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 and the man himself, Jax. Thank you so much for the amazing raid. I'm Sabaton Liam. The disembodied voice you hear is my good friend Dale, and we're currently playing Chronicle of sorry, uh, Shadows Mountain Chronicles of Innsmouth, Mountains of Madness, which is based off the HP Lovecraft book at the Mountains of Madness and Shadow Over. The stream has been asked madness at the moment. <laughs> yes, yeah, it's been a stream uh, of madness. The helmet is so badass. <laughs> Well, I just did get a new helmet today. Yeah, he got a Darth Vader one today. Alright, Naruto, I will give you a choice. You can have me in this helmet, or the other helmet I just uh, got in the mail today. Uh, uh, Monique, the game just came out today. So, yep. Naruto, you it can have of, this helmet, or this other helmet that today. I just got. Which is a pretty good helmet. Pretty good helmet. <laughs> oh! Blue... <laughs> Naruto, thank you for gifting Blue Collar Gamer a sub, man. You... 17 subs you've gifted. Holy shit. You are fucking amazing, my man. You are amazing. Okay, that... This calls for the new helmet. This calls... For the new helmet. Ugh. Right. I'll be back in a second. This helmet actually, uh, this is on PC. This helmet actually takes a bit to get on. Give me a second, guys. I'm sorry. <laughs> yeah, get on your bastard. one part of it. <laughs> Oh, 
Oh, this helmet is so hard to get on. I haven't got the helmet on fully, but here's pretty much where it is. It's a very intricate helmet. <laughs> okay, I can't see anything. <laughs> oh my god. There's, there's a lot to go with this Darth Vader helmet. <laughs> oh, it's god, very complicated. <laughs> oh, shit. Ah. Oh, Whew. Okay, it is. It is good to see you again. Okay, what <laughs> uh, Lucky you, I can't see anything even with my glasses on at the moment. <laughs> Probably the same helmet. Uh, if you've been loyal, my friend. I've a storm. Oh, Jack says a storm hill. Uh, uh, storm trooper helmet coming. Black one. Nice. Uh, That's cool. Good, just us. <gasps> the tip is falling off. Story of my life. Story of my life. With the medical transplant. <laughs> oh, okay, okay. Back to the game now. Naruto. <laughs> thank you so very much. <laughs> oh, welcome, guys. Oh my god, we've almost got 20 people watching. Holy fuck! Wow. This is the best stream I've had in my three, four years streaming. The Boba Hel Helmet uh, is badass though. Oh god, yes, I fucking love it. Okay, we need to figure out what to do. I really wish I was paying attention to what this guy was saying. I really so don't. So I've gathered he's got a book that we want. He's got a book and he wants us to get something to let us look at the book. But we have lock, uh, lock picks now, so that could yep. hopefully come That's in good. handy. That's good, we can go pick we something. We gotta find something to pick, but... There's nothing I want to... Okay, why isn't tab working anymore? Oh, no wait, it's not working. Huh. Maybe, maybe it'll work once we get... Better go for... Still not... It, no. Bed... Bar... Bed... Alright. We accidentally turn it off somehow. Let me load the game. No, it's not working anymore. What the hell? Alright, save game. Maybe save game and restart the game. Alright, so guys, just need to restart the game. I apologise. Don't know what's going on. Yes, because the tab stopped <clears throat> working for some reason. I only have one helmet. I'll wear it every day. <laughs> oh, you guys... Yep. Um, okay, it's not letting me do anything. What the hell? Ah. And you need to stream it in Discord again, because I can't see. <laughs> yep. Uh boo 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 boo. Hmm, take a look on Steam and see if anyone has uh... Oh there we go, there we go. There we go. Okay. Right, let's load the game and see if tap. There we yeah. go. We've got it working again. We've got our handicap back. Oh, Naruto banned a real life word, and he banned Naruto and Shadow. All right, we can't right. say Naruto and Shadow. Oh shit! Can't I just said it. Name. Spare set of lock picks. Okay, I won't say, say it anymore. Lost my last pair in Innsmouth. She'll call him. She'll call him Sasuke Darkness from now on. <laughs> All right. 
now we have to figure out what we can do now. Oh, uh, can't go anywhere else. There's nothing else highlighted. That's Sloan's office, slums. Loan, please don't touch anything. The crime scene. Sure. Well, where is this goddamn? How about I put my lockpick in your eye? Will you care then? He won't be able to see me touch things then. <laughs> yeah. Alan? Yes. Tell me anything more. We've already. I got a feel. But luck. <laughs> yep. Luck. I'll let you know if I find out anything. Thanks. Sarah Roop. Surgical work. Internal organ. What kind of main. No. What the bloody hell am I meant to do? <laughs> uh, I'm so lost. I'm just gonna take a quick look to the stain. Hi guys. Hiya. What can we do? Hi there. Did you check behind the door? Fruit. It looks like a Sherlock Holmes game. Uh, it Until next time. pretty much is like a Sherlock Holmes game. Yeah, because, <clears throat> you know, it's the same sort of same sort of thing. A lot of Lovecraft stuff is about detectives trying to solve yes. mysteries. The gardener's I doubt it. Yeah, uh, Lovecraft is very investigation heavy. With, um, uh, yep. it, it gets investigation, then it gets to the action. Yep. It's just that usually yeah, the investigation that. leads you to something you can't comprehend, whereas Sherlock Holmes ties up his cases in a neat little bow. I do wish some smooth Okay, can I piss him off? I'm going. I'm oh my god, I got an achievement for that. <laughs> I'm going. I'm going, I'm going. Oh, shit. I can... Oh, did he want books? Oh, shit, 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 shit. It'd be rude to go behind the counter. I can't tell what kind of... Judging by the spines, they appear to be history books. I don't have time. Books on physics. Books on... I don't feel like we... This is not the right... Philosophy. Philosophy, how boring. I've got other things that... Organic can... I got so things I should be doing. Won't let me behind the counter. See if I can oh my it. god, it's an M1. I don't feel like hey, M1! Psychology. How you going, buddy? Welcome to the stream, my friend. Psychology. I don't have time. He's very happy because Coles is actually is letting him Staying out of the enough. supermarket. Oh. Fuck me. Um... Have no walk through. I should have been lost this this quickly. <laughs> I mean, they've really I focused on making it old school style. Oh god, yeah. Including getting stuck. Okay, there are some walkthroughs on YouTube. Oh yeah. Do that, do that, do that. I have no reason to work. Monly, legendary figure in them, spends his days doing nothing. Mickey, he's been here on the street pedal. He's really nice. I don't need to climb up there whenever a bulb in my office burns out. Lamp post. Lamp post. Lamp. Lamp. <clears throat> 
multitude of look, but that's what is written. Look, but don't touch. That's what is written. Lose blood. Okay, let's see. Hello, Mr. Carter. Where are we? I'm working on. Here he is fit. I never paid much attention in science club. I do remember being zapped by static electricity. It seemed like a kind of magic. Oh, ho, 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 it's magic. Provided that the right material is rubbed on it. You know, never believe it's not I so. No time to read right now. It's magic. I have no time to read. I can't see what. Books for girls, though. Not for you. Oh. <laughs> Books for girls. Foreman's list. Okay, so you need to find the his, his rival's Easy. list, and where we get that is well. There's some chemistry equipment in your office that you can take, oh. which you've already got. No, I just have lockpicks. Oh, you got. There's also a, some chemistry equipment there. Uh... Oh, oh, it's in your here. office. It's in your I'm office. The thing you need. Go to go home to your office. Move the um, yes, the chemistry set is in the cupboard to the right. It's in that cabinet. Oh, open you can door. open multiple things. Okay. Yep. So Some one of them has a. In here. Yep. So you need Certainly that. Well in the Kreutzer case. So to keep for later, because assuming it's going to be handy. useful. But the notice board There's on the left, inside. you can actually move it, and you can spy on. The shop next door to you. Board is a hole that looks, that's the list, the, oh. the list that the guy needs. This is the list that the bookseller needs. That seems to be what I'm looking for. I can see Foreman's desk from here. Over there is the list I need. I can't get there. I'll have to come up with something else. I can see Foreman's desk over there is. My arm's not so long enough. Now to we have to. So many. Okay, so he's gonna poke something through the. You gotta poke something. Through <gasps> oh, through the broom! The broom, yes. An old broom. An old broom. An old broom. Up. Oh. An old broom. That's oh, not letting me pick it up. Coat, Coat rack. That's what. I'm not wearing it. I never. Apparently, it is the broom because that's what the person in the walkthrough is using. Oh, now it's letting me pick it up. Oh, now it's letting you pick it up. Oh, 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 oh. Yeah, put the oh. whole broom in. Object. It will probably end up being of some use eventually. Where the f More so than fuck did he just put it? Put it. Put it I know. <laughs> boss the Mad Boss, ahoy buddy. Welcome to the stream, my friend. I hope you are doing very well. There we go, we get the list and we can take it to the bookseller. Dun -dun. Dun -dun. <laughs> yeah, I don't know why I found that so funny. <laughs> oh, oh, oh! I know, I know. It's long enough to reach the lip that has. We put the um, lockpicks on the broom. On the end of it. Oh, okay, you think that would do it? The test tube. Nick, my friend, how the fuck are you going, buddy? I'm doing fantastic. Good luck. Perfect fit. Okay, now there's a test tube on it. And that doesn't look like a test tube no, anymore. Like <laughs> <laughs> I did it. Did have a hard, hard day, so I'm a bit tired. Well, buddy, come here and relax, mate. We've had a fantastic time so far. Come join the fun. It has no way to grab it. So now what do we do? Would serve no. Ah, we have to charge it with static electricity. <gasps> oh, yes! Like on the carpet! On the... Yes. <laughs> God. Seems to be charged. And that just looks like a battle axe. <laughs> yep. <laughs> and we're back up to 19 people watching. Holy shit. There but, we go. But Mad Boss and Nick, you missed a hype yeah. train and a half. Yeah, Naruto has gifted over 15 subs tonight on Twitch. Like the mad lad he is. Foreman's list to be delivered to that worm, Calvin. 
and I am hyped as boss for the new Sabaton album. I have, oh, yes. I have a friend of mine who, uh, since <clears throat> Australia is on the banned list for uh, Nuclear Blast, I had to unfortunately get a refund of, um, shut up, I'm talking. Um, <laughs> Nate, Nate, uh, Napalm, Napalm Blast had to refund me for my Marvel vinyl edition of, um, uh, the Royal Guard. But luckily I have a friend in, uh, I have a friend who has a friend in America who pre-ordered the yellow vinyl album for me, and she's gifting it to me. How <laughs> nice. Oh, no, Ivy, it's been long enough, I can say never in a shadow. Very much. <laughs> the name of the publisher. Now. Sure, sure. Don't get flustered. Duralift some press. Good. Is the telephone number mentioned at all? Zero zero five six seven two. Perfect. As I see things, you still owe me a favor. That wasn't the deal. As you saw, I altered the deal. Pray I don't alter it any further. Perhaps I could even take <laughs> some scissors to that little collection of yours. Ivy, re uh, redeem watch. stretch. Peace by peace. And hydrate. Ah. Still owe you a favor. Well said. Don't you forget. <coughs> Pardon me. So to the office to call that number. I am vaping, Nick. I have. Vape. I've been very good on the smoking, although I did smoke a bit uh, last good Friday morning. when I was um out at a gig. I'm after some after information. information. Go on, sir. I need the address of one of your collaborators, William Blanco. You cannot disclose private details. Yes, you can. Yes. It's very important. Uh, it is Strawberry Nick. Henry Armitage, curator of the Miskatonic University Library. Hello, Dr. Armitage. I'm Susie Betchler. Do you remember me? I mean, come on. What were the chances? Uh, right, Susie. How are you? Your voice seems a tad off. Yeah, I caught a cold. I shall give for now. Help a guy out. I've been redeemed. Activate goggles. Okay, I have to Your remember where I put them. The university performance. Where are the goggles? In what sense? Disappointing. When you told me I was your favorite student, you lied. You bastard. Oh. Oh. Okay. Oh my God! Where are my goggles? This approach is not working. <laughs> the approach is not working. The goggles, they do nothing. Alright, hold on a sec, guy. <laughs> Where the hell did I put them? They were originally on my computer. Uh, no, they didn't fall behind my computer. Oh, found them. Alright, Ivy, what message would you like on the goggles? <laughs> And of course, this is going to be another thing where I can't see. <laughs> but at least I can still hear. Alright, let me open the app. Naruto is a legend. I can certainly do that. On with the glasses and gone with the game. Here we go. Naruto is a legend. Uh, okay, okay. Um, God, these are so hard to see through. How can I help you? I'm after some information. Go on, sir. I need the address of one of your collaborators, uh, William Blanco. We cannot disclose this time guy is heading to sleep. Please. Thank you so much for the amazing I'm raid, Jags. You have a good one, and you are awesome. Thank you so very much. You have a great sleep, buddy. Uh, to be honest, so... 
would want to see the old the last stand with tracks plus bonus tracks like all guns blazing come on I have that CD <laughs> wait you have this shirt does that mean no I wasn't at Sabaton open air it was um uh, a gift that um my friend friend bought when they went to Sabaton open air uh, John Smith tax agent oh god taxes 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 in my dark water Sound nervous. Calm down. No, is that really? I take a deep breath and calm down. I'm very calm now. You need to talk to Blanco. Blanco. To something. Uh. We have seen some irregularities. Fortunately, I can't help you over the phone. Try calling back when the boss is in. Good day. <sighs> Oh, that Ugh. Work. She hung up. I'll have to be a lot more threatening than that if I want to get anywhere. All right, let's try the or, the you're going to jail one. Yeah. That Sunday. sounds like a scam. Can I <laughs> <laughs> I'm after some information. Go on. I need the ad. You cannot disclose. Please, John Smith. Go on. Let's get right. I'll be needing William. Bl but really, I can't. You have a big problem. But I you better ask my boss. Now he's not here. Just give me the address. And I'll leave you in peace. There we go. Yeah, but you all go to jail. Sure. Hold the line while I see yes. You. I'm here. <laughs> I don't want you. We'll make sure you all end up in the slammer. Give me the address now. Oh. Um. I guess I went too far. She must. Whoop. Oh God damn it! God damn it! We are on the right path. Journalists and friends. Good morning. I'm after some. Go on. I need the ad. Please. John Smith. Go on. Let's get right. I'll be needing. But I can't. You have a. But I. You better ask. Just give me the ad. You're all going. Sure. Hold the. I'm here. Uh. We'll make sure. Give me the ad. Oh. Oh crap! Have... No, that was wrong. I'm not concentrating properly with the goggles on. Damn it. The goggles. Oh. They ruined the situation. Your lips and breath. Good morning. How can I help you? Oh, that's so much better. <laughs> Go on. I need the app, please. John Smith. Go on. Let's get ready. But I can't. You have a. But I. You better now. We just give me the. You're all going. Sure. Hold the. I'm here. Avoid. I should. I should talk to you. Just the imagine. Boss. I just imagine this girl picking up the phone and being like, "Is it you again? <laughs> give me the fucking address." Good morning. How can I help you? I'm after some. Go on. I need the app, please. John Smith. Go on. Let's get right. But I can't. You have a. But I better now. Just should. give me the. You're all going. Hold the line. I'm here. I wouldn't want to. I. You won't be fired. You'll be promoted. There we go. You will save your company there so much trouble. Okay. Hold for a moment, please. <sighs> Hope it works out. Here's the address. 27 Pikmin Avenue. Fantastic. Good day to you. Pinkman Avenue. And I'm going to assume that's where the lockpicks come into play. Yep. You're probably going to have to break into a house or something. The last stand in Heroes both have 16 tracks. I do remember Heroes, um... They do a cover of Battle Beasts Out of Control. And I believe there was something else. My poor brother. I can't stop thinking about him. Maybe if I just go home for the night and take some time to reflect on all this. Tell you what, I'm really love. Arg! Arg! Fortunately, he never had to. I really, really love this guy. 
I hope you guys in the chat are really liking it as well. I, I really like it. Time to take a look at. Coming. Come in. Oh, hello. Hi there. I'm Lone Carter, private investigator. Uh, pleasure to meet you, Lone. How did you find me? For whom the bell tolls, that's right. That was the other one. Dr. Armitage told me how to get in touch with you. He said you could shed some light on certain things that have happened to me. That depends. What are we talking about? But please, go on. And call me William. Okay, William. I was hired by Armitage himself. I see. Come in. Don't just stand there in the doorway. So. A bunch of really bizarre stuff went down in Innsmouth. There's one last thing I just can't come to grips with. Go on. I was attacked by a seething mass with thousands of eyes and teeth. A shaga? Hmm. So it's all true. They actually exist. Tell them down the enthusiasm, do. please. We'll be back to your party on my end. I'm sorry. I'm a scholar of the occult. And any information, however horrible for most, arouses my curiosity. Oh, Riri. Go on. There he is. I remember waking up, barely alive, missing an arm and a leg. And I passed out. When I woke up, I felt perfectly fine, and my missing limbs were... Goddamn meager. Amazing. Yep, meager tick. <laughs> Lone, I wish to perform a small experiment on you. Will you permit me? Ow. What the hell was that for? It's just a little prick. Oh, okay, no. Oh, oh. oh. yeah, definitely Mega Tech. Yep. I'm testing a theory, which is confirmed, it seems. Look at your arm. It's already healed. Without even a scar. You oh, my arm hurts. I'm just watching that. Your it was literally consuming you, but apparently some of its cells invaded your body. They now seem to repair any physical damage you take. Oh, you have I don't know what the long-term implications are. Ah, neat. It seems you're practically immortal. Amazing. Nani? You might not know much, but this seems unlikely to end well. Don't Anything know much, but I know I love you. But do you really want me to? With such power, you could make a real difference. I'm not interested in being some kind of hero. Besides, we have no idea how this thing might further evolve. If I were to turn into one of those things here in the city... You've actually got a point. Lone, do you know Professor Wilmot? Yes. He hired me for an extremely strange case. And not as strange as all this. Talking to him could prove valuable indeed. His knowledge in this field is vast. Sounds like a plan. How can we get in touch with him? If you have his address. I'll write him a letter explaining the situation. Fantastic. Good. Lovely. Let's meet at Miskatonic with Armitage in three days' time. Good day, William. I really gotta go grab some shut eye. I don't have a think about who left this letter for me. Turning to the crime scene might be a good idea. Hopefully, I can investigate unimpeded next time. Yeah, we have to things. Well, these weird people again. Hello there. Yeah, small time detective. I hope I won't regret asking for help from that miserable creature. Fairly interesting. Imagine all the bonus tracks off the last stand on one city. Oh yeah, that would be sick. Alright, back to the slum. Ah. There we go. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, everything's gone. Oh, maybe I can pick it's up this squad. blank piece of paper. The bodies are gone. Everything important is gone. I have no reason to climb up on. I have no reason to climb up. There's a pen here as well. I'll just grab them both. Excellent. You never know when you might need a pen. I don't want to touch sends a shiver up. The victim's blood or residue layer. Probably the layer. Probably the oh. layers. Certainly won't be putting. Can you put the pen in there? Is he Brown Jenkin? I I don't get that achievement. I don't understand it. Let's 
stuck. Oh, we are stuck. How can we fix it? Yes, shut the door. Uh, let's see. How do we fix it? Doesn't look very useful. Looks like they cleaned up the room. Except for all the blood on the floor, yes. No, that's not why you do that. I can't reach the. Wonder how the killer managed to. It's stuck. Hmm. I'm gonna guess out of a hunch, just because I know know it's something I would normally actually investigate myself and normally ha happen. The you close the blinds and some I'm gonna guess maybe an elder sign would appear. Yeah, something like that. <clears throat> but the thing that closes the blinds doesn't appear to work. Would serve no purpose. Okay, maybe. Ah. Nope, apparently you can fix it. Ah! You have to climb up on the desk with the door shut. Ah! Now you can climb up on the desk and fit in and pull. Because you didn't want to do it with the door open. A bit embarrassed. There you go. Now no, you should be able to shut it. Ha! Oh, Whoa! Well, take a look. Weird symbol, visible only in the dark, drawn with who knows what. And more to the point, who knows what it means. I can't take it. It's drawn on the door. But you can make a copy of it with an impression. You should be able to jot it down this way. Excellent. Whatever that's worth. if William has seen anything. There we go, so now we can show that to the professor later. Hello, hey, Blanco. Huh? William, I'd like to ask you about something. Sure. Helping a friend out with a case. It looks like a ritual murder. Copied this symbol from the door there. Interesting. It's been a long time since I've seen it. So you recognize it? Yes, but it shouldn't be there. Tell me everything you know about it. Sit, love. No! I'll recount a story. I will stand. You'll probably have some trouble believing it. Given what I've gone through, I highly doubt that. I am a student of the occult, as you may have heard. What I'm about to tell you, however, does not come from mere book study. As you may know, Arkham, much like Salem, is a city of mysteries. Here, over the centuries, many have acted in ways that I... No, I have not noticed that it is on Spotify. I don't have to doubt that. Interesting. Though. Interesting. you all my life, I've never heard of any obscure ancient claptrap. Well, that so sucks. expected, love. The people involved in all this keep as low a profile as possible. I only learned of it because my old Miskatonic colleague, Daniel Up. I always play on YouTube, so I never noticed. Getting caught up in the whole affair. I see. He asked for my help, but his request arrived too late. I received this telegram from him. William, I need your help. Stop. I have confirmed that dissidents exist. Stop. I have found one. Stop. Ephraim waits. Stop. Dissidents. Hello. I must impress upon you that Daniel and I, through our studies, came across this term more than once. There seems to be an extensive organization operating in the shadows, harboring secret knowledge, to which only its members have access. That symbol, that symbol, belongs to the late Ephraim Wade. That is what I managed to learn from the only comprehensible mutterings from what once had been my dear friend, Daniel Upton. What else can you tell me about Ephraim Waits? 
He must have been a very powerful magician <clears throat> if he was actually affiliated with these distants. My subsequent research led no one. Dissidents. This led me to think that my Magic friend's mental health was thing. indeed no. Until now. Then you showed me that symbol. Hmm. Well, why involve me? I have to look into this further. It would be best to gather information about this weight person. The municipal archive would be a good starting point. A friend of mine manages it. What happened to Upton? As I told you, I didn't make it in time. All I know is that he went mad and killed a friend of his. I don't know who that friend was. We had been out of touch for some time. He is now locked up in an asylum, but is no longer the Daniel I once knew. Can I meet him? If you want to try, I'll come to Silo, I reckon. I'll contact the clinic yeah. and ask them to let you in. There we go. Go way back. We are well acquainted. Oh my. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> See you later, William. See you later. I wish I could go with you, but I have a pressing deadline bearing down on me. Don't worry. I can handle things for now. So we can go to Arkham Asylum, or we can go to the City Up Archives, apparently. Hmm. I reckon... Let's go to... Reckon let's go to the Mental Hospital. Well, let's go! Oh! Oh! Down. What the hell is going on? Leave me alone! The sea! The sea calls me! Father Dagon! Uh, back to his room with him. Hey, don't hurt him. Mind your business. He's out of sight. Just let it hey. <laughs> Just let it happen. What? You treat all your patients this way? Everyone is well cared for here. Patients try to break out now and then. Yeah, right. Name's Long Carter. I'm expected. Let me just look you up. Ah, here you are. You are cleared to enter. Excellent. Who was that man? Oh, he's always trying to get out. I heard he's from Innsmouth. Always oh. raving ah. about getting back. Of the course. Sea. There's no sea around here. I guess in his mind, he's still in that godforsaken town. Innsmouth, you say? What do you know about Innsmouth? I know my brother-in-law lost his job because he to make deliveries there. And he was a hard worker. What do you want to do with your life? Oh, D. Snyder, and that's burning hell. Children and all. I see. I'm sorry to hear that. Thanks a lot. Good job. Hope everything You're gonna burn out. in hell. I can't believe all the things I've done wrong in my life. Without even trying. Yep. Yeah. Thanks, boss. Now I've got got it in my head. How'd you know who I am? <laughs> Reddits! Description was accurate to the lesson. M 2s approval. <laughs> but no, he's not here because he's going on a trip to Adelaide. <laughs> Bastard. His stories are splendid. They deserve better than to appear in those cheap tabloids. I'm here to see someone, Rose. It's a matter of some urgency. Sure. You will find Upton in the last room in the corridor to your left. We can't allow you into the room, though. Please speak to him through the bolt hole. He can become quite mm, violent. Bolt hole. Tell me about Upton. There's not much to say. He pleaded insanity after the murder, and for good reason. He spent all his time since then babbling and drawing odd symbols, like this one. Thanks, Rose. Anything else? I can tell you that he has a wife and daughter, but they've never come to visit him. William has visited him before, but not even he stops by much lately. Anyway, he speaks only in thrones. He eats little. I don't know how to help you any further, Lou. Thanks all the same, Rose. Same symbol that was drawn on the victim's yep, door. Yeah, would have been the same one. Told me. Tell me about the man they dragged away. Screaming. All I know is that he came from Innsmouth and has been incarcerated since before I worked here. He always tries to escape. I noticed. But he couldn't be on the loose. He can be very, very aggressive. His walks are always overseen by maximum security guards, but all too often they end up as you saw here today. Thanks, Rose. Tell me about the other patients. There is little to say, Lone. Once you get used to the hellish moans, it's a pretty quiet job. These oh, people probably oh, don't oh, oh, as much as you can. Propane! <laughs> yeah, right. What? That sounds right, I said. That sounds about right. Oh, speaking of propane, um, had a woman coming last night asking for um, some butane uh, refills. It was like, 
Don't do it, Liam. Don't do it. Don't do it. And soon. Guild Pine is the best. Yeah. Bye, Liam. Give my regards to you. You've ruined me, Dale. Sure. <laughs> That's the devil's gas. Lone, that stuff. Hello? Oh! Oh! Cthulhu Fatagan! Fatulu? Oh, dear oh. God! Whoa! Yeah, there I go. The lambs, Clarice. <laughs> right. <laughs> Daniel Upton? The fathers, it's a. <laughs> 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 Well, <laughs> well, this is now complicated. It would serve no. Try give him the telegram. Oh, it would serve no. Or the telegram. It would serve no. Okay, so nope. Do you know we from wait. <laughs> Calm down. Lone, please don't get him. Can you I, shut your mouth. Can bitch. I let him out? Ah, fine. The cell appears. Oh, this one's empty. Mind if I take a quick nap? Seven prone doesn't do covers that often, to be honest. Oh, oh dear God. Oh, they've, they've, they've done a couple. No, uh, covers. Covers. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> Uh, it seems, uh, each of the albums they have at least two covers. Hello there. Yes. Hey, are you alright? Did they hurt you? They can't hurt me. Me? Feel pain. I had a stroke. Oh. oh. From Innsmouth, right? Innsmouth, yes. Innsmouth. Rain's mouth, the sea, the under the sea. To get back there, I must Blah. get back there. Help me, help me. I doubt he'll be of much use to. Me. All right, so Upton is completely batshit crazy. Oh, hero there. Oh dear God. <laughs> Are you all right in there? Of course. Everything that the divine light shines upon is perfect. Come here, my son. Come. Try closer. Hell awaits you. Oh. Dear God. Unclean. 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 They think he didn't try to cast a spell on you. He thinks he's a fallen angel. Come back tomorrow to meet him as Napoleon Bonaparte. Can I please come back tomorrow? Is that is that an option? That would be amazing. If he come back and he's Napoleon. Dear 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 The truth is a lightning which rips the dark. The truth is a lightning! So strong to blind whoever sees it. The enlightened ones will lose themselves in the blackness. Are you willing to follow that path? Sure. Okay. Why not? <laughs> it says. No, that's. The cell. All right. I guess off to the archives. Yep. Off to the archives. No worries. Fulfill your destiny. Thank you so much. For coming in my friend you have yourself an awesome one and i hopefully will see and talk to you again soon but until then i shall cheese you with a red bull ah tasty good morning Should at least unlock Sunny. before barging in. How rude! 
So are those dudes look like Samuel Taylor from Game of Thrones. Oh my god, yes! <laughs> oh wow. I didn't mean to intrude on you. You won't get away with being rude to me. I wasn't born yesterday. Have a good one, Destiny. No, evidently not. You were born many, many centuries. Why are you yelling? Cause you're an old fuck. Yes, great. I need some information. Please go on. <laughs> oh, this game ticks all the right boxes. Yep. Oh, I'm looking for information on I need it for an investigation. What do you want to know? originally from Arkham. I'll have to go look that up. In the meantime, you may browse the shelves at your leisure. Ah, I'm an old bat. I have to. There are many construction you have documents. to shout. There's nothing I know of. There are many construction. Ah, here it is. Oh shit, that was fast. He was a native of Innsmouth. Oh, fun. Can you repeat where he was from originally? <laughs> he was a native of Innsmouth. So I, ha I had to. Can you repeat where he was from originally? <laughs> Did he have any family? I'll have to go look that up. In the meantime, you may... Hmm. Got a feeling there's actually something to do what she's looking at. Like collections of new Yeah, I think yeah. I need a date. There's way too much material. Maybe the archivist can shed more light on them. I need a date. Maybe the Yeah. She she's probably She'll probably tell you off if you try to look while she's And once again, one pressing one tabs not doing anything. Never seen it. They live together. I don't know. Can you repeat? He was. Where did. I'll have to. In the meantime. Wait. That name sounds familiar to me. Countless books and doc, but also a bit. I need to pare down. There's way too much. Oh! Ah. So yes. this guy and his daughter are going to appear in the campaign that I'm gonna read. <laughs> oh, nice! His last known residence was 27. Let's talk. I'll take a look. You can find everything you need to know about beehives on the shelves to your right. Oh. Oh, there we go. Now it's letting me do stuff. Here's the house was demolished in 1917 to build a department store. Well, I guess so today there is I a contest to get us up. Yes, stuff. boss, I did see that contest, and of course I've entered the contest. It would be better if I asked the archivist lady about it. I need a date. Maybe the. I need a date. Maybe. Ask her about the the blueprints that you just found. Oh yeah. Regarding it's one of the two, I think. I need to low down. He was accused of murder some years ago. What do you want to know? Do you know anything about the murder? I bloody love that he has the shout. Yeah. No, to be honest. It's rather difficult. The only thing I might be able to do is look up his name. Wait. In the meantime, you may browse the shelves at your leisure. I don't think you have anything to look up while she does that, so. Yeah, during all this, it's not letting me do tab. Hmm, not much to go on, but Upton has been in a mental hospital since 1915. Yep, we just met him. Did he have any family? Did he have any? Wait, in the meantime, you. Oh, and yet this is just his daughter. No, no, that was the other guy. Oh, Ephraim you... White. Ah. We still need to ask her about um Ephraim White's house. That's right. His wife and son, but they no longer reside in Arkham. Oh, God, has been that in means a mental hospital since released the most recent album on your birthday. Nice! Although, I did not like the new album, Aelstorm's new album. 
Anything else on Upton? I'm sorry, Sonny. I know nothing. All right, so let's talk about something else. Now ask about Ephraim White. I need more information on Ephraim Waits. What do you want to know? Could you uh, tell me when he died? I'll have to go look that up. In the meantime, you may browse. There we go. She'll tell. Television. She'll tell. Tell you when he died, so you'll have a date that you can help look up. And I'm gonna guess we're gonna go to the cemetery at some point. Yes, probably. Okay. It's not a place we want to go, but. Five years ago. Okay. So can you repeat the name of his daughter? Can you Just repeat the name of his daughter? A senior. I don't know. Alright, there we go. Um, so now we have enough we can search the archives. What? See you. You too, Sonny. <laughs> Fucked with an anchor is uh, definitely a mood. Wait. Yep. Prominent figure and well known philanthropist from Arkham passed away. Prominent figure. I wonder what he actually did for a living. According to my campaign notes, he cast spells. Oh, are he looking through everything as we're as we're playing? Order of a certain ED, as someone identified only as DU. Could this be the connection between them? Carry from White in 1915 section. There's no mention dun, of Ephraim Wade's dun, passing dun, in the obituaries dun. for October 28th, 1915. That's strange. Hmm. Hmm. Is there anything else to search? It's a top shelf as well. It appears the house was... So his house is demolished. Oh, that's the same shelf. Hmm. Seems like we got everything. Yeah, we got everything. So what do we do now? Let me see what is to be done. I'm going to go back to this solemn and see if there's any more yeah, dialogue I think, options. I think that might be a good idea. Can I stop? Uh, options. Can I do the walking speed? No, damn. No, no, resume. Actually, no, save. Oh, you can ask the, um, you can ask the archivist about what his occupation was, and she'll give a lot of information. Daniel Upton. That is. <laughs> Alright, so back to the archive. Yep, and then, yep, and we'll get more information. So ask her what Ephraim <clears throat> waits occupation was. I need what do you <laughs> I need more ah, there what, we go. Was his what was his occupation look young man I heard things about him back in the day I heard he spent his life <gasps> oh my god Rizzy hello Welcome to the stream! <laughs> oh yeah, Burning Hell is a great song. Burning Hell is a fantastic song. But Rezzy! Hello and welcome! Back then, I was quite the hotsy totsy. The hotsy totsy? Hotsy totsy? But naturally, I can turn down the offer. Oh, that yep, cemetery, there we go. Yep. Yeah. Razzy, missed your face too. It's been too long. So now, now we can go look for Let's him in the 1913 section. I've never been. What? I have never been to the Christchurch Cemetery. Why are you yelling so hard? <laughs> <laughs> in the southeast section of the city. So now we know where it is. It has lost much of its charm. But at least now there's not as much risk of taking a quick to the head or being swallowed up by the earth. 
Fair enough. Mr. Wait buried there? Most likely. He renovated it after all. But let me go check the records. Yeah, there's gonna be some grave digging. Yep. Well, this is strange. There are no oh. burial records concerning Mr. Wait. This is very Ooh, odd. That's certainly too. very odd. I wonder where he ended up. We question what time is it for you? It is 9.39 in the p.m., Mr. Blue Collar Gamer. Yes, now we can search for his name in... There's no mention of Ethan. That's strange. So the other shelf might have him in the 1913 section. Uh, there we go. 1913, let's see what we get. There's an article about Mr. Wade here. Put all these library use scrolls. Yeah. <laughs> finances renovation of ancient Christchurch cemetery. The article has a photo of him. Could come in handy. Excellent. Okay, so we got a photo of him, and I guess we guess now we got everything we can get here. So now we have to go to either the cemetery, or I wonder if we could show the photo of him to the guy <gasps> in the asylum and see if he'll react. To oh, it. that's a good idea. See if he will go. Ah! Oh, no, I remember that man. Ah! Ah! My sanity is drawing ever closer. Ah! I, I don't know. <laughs> At this point, I'm just stringing words together. Oh, I read about you. Did you kill that man? What was his name? <laughs> <laughs> I fucking love this. <laughs> no, that's it. Ah, oh, crap, I have to go through dialogue. Okay. Off to the cemetery! Off to the cemetery we go! See I we found find a there. grave and I'm digging a hole. Ha! Ah, my cabbages! <laughs> my cabbages! Was there any bonus tracks on the Great War? Um. I'm actually not sure. Just let me look that up. Uh, doo -doo -doo. Doo -doo -doo. The Great War bonus tracks. Doo -doo -doo. Uh, no, I'm not finding any bonus tracks for the Great War. Oh, that's a shame, because if there was, I would have liked to have heard them. It was a great war. Right, to the cemetery. Oh, finally, that Off work, up to 14 hours. Nice! Oh, let's actually no, we're gonna save, then I wanna go to the forest. It's probably a bad yes. idea, but I'm yes, gonna do it anyway. <laughs> That's why we're saving. That's why we're saving. We're gonna get lost. Oh, oh god. Foggier and foggier. Yeah, this was, this was a bad idea, but uh, I I it don't, was, but we saved. I don't. So we're fine. I don't regret it. Exit. No, we don't. Oh, hello. There. I don't think I will be able to open it. I imagine it would be hard even with tool. It would serve no purpose. Building. It seems almost like the entrance to some temple. Buried. Okay. Interesting. Actually, when Dale and M2 were streaming on Dungeons and Dragons, I was flipping burgers. Oh, well, there you go. BCG was ah. flipping burgers. While we was playing the Pokemans. The Pokemans. The Poke and the man, the man come out of the thing. Alright, so this first leads to some weird place. Now we have to try to find ourselves 
ourselves a way out. Ah, there we go. Easy done! Excuse me, madam. Hello, young man. Hello. Can I ask you what you're doing here? I'm here to visit my husband, Sonny. Not much else for me to do with what's left of my life but drag my old bones out here and have a chat with him. I see. Please excuse me for having bothered you. Not at all. It's always nice to chat with someone who can chat with Yes. Well, good day to you. Thank you. Yeah. So happy I finally have the complete collection of the Lovecraft Country campaign books. I don't like messing around. Oh, noise. Disrespectful. Remember I showed you picture and I've got the Kingsport one and the Arkham one and the Dunwich one? M1. And I've got the... Yep, and the Miskatonic University one. And one's just said, with that curse on the screen, thought it was Duck Hunt. Duck Hunt, yeah. Oh, M1, you silly bugger. Sungala. After all, it's always the others who die. I don't have time to dig up corpses. Yes, you do. But, but... Cream cups. That's why we're the most here. merciful thing in the world is the inability of the human mind to correlate all its Cream cups. Exhuming a random body makes no sense. Cream cups. Martin okay. Ottawa's. Why do I have this overwhelming desire to dig? There seems to be no trace of Ephraim's grave. Well, this is where he is. Luca and Kiara. Realize Luca and Kiara. Don't worry. They're just catching up on their sleep. <laughs> Strange force urges me to raid tombs. But I must resist. No. Raid the tombs. Raid them all. Ixitus est Marcus Novatorum, sit mihi terra levis, quis quis vic tumulo posuit ardentum lucem, ilius cineris. I don't like messing around with graves. It's all Greek to me. It says, burned wolf. The reports of my death were greatly exaggerated. <laughs> random body makes no sense. <laughs> That is amazing. I love it. It is. It says, here lies Pontus Leonge, a great fool and an even greater defender of humanity. Assuming a random body makes no sense. I want to use the guy's voice over acting for Vince friend. and Lucian. <laughs> it says, H. Phoenix, haunted by his parents. A strange force urges me. I wish Demonic 79. Loot. What the hell kind of name is this? It says, how dare you? I created you and I can destroy you. Disturbing. Strange force. Okay, I'm going to assume with a name like that, that was a backer of the game. I'm gonna guess, yeah. It says, Martin Predator. Oh, yeah, I'm gonna yeah, assume yeah, most of these are backers. Assuming a random body. It says, Edward Derby, son and poet. Your spirit will always be by a strange force. It says, Alphabet. Not bad for my first time. It didn't hurt. I don't like messing around with this. <laughs> <laughs> Not bad for my first time. Says Arno Bellucci. He can't be wanted. Agitated, he passed. <laughs> time to do it. Yeah. Says TK. Notre vie est un voyage. Checked every grave. There's no trace of I don't like messing Achievement or Tim Stalker. Ah, so that's what we get. It says Federico died of an indescribable and nameless horror. In the house overlooking the sea, illuminated by a color come from space. Oh! Assuming a random Ooh. body makes no sense. Oh my. A color out of space. Hello. Greetings. What do you do around here? Oh, checking on the dead. Wouldn't want them running around. <laughs> oh, checking on the dead. The dead. Did you tell me anything about the church? I'm not very religious. I think Dale be amused with my Team Rocket comments. Team Rocket, you always fuck, fucking me, poke. Team Rocket, you always fucking me, Pokemon. If you want to poke me, you're your bad. You don't want to fucking steal me, fucking Pokemon, Team Rocket. What? You don't want to steal me, fucking lot of Pokemon. Why don't you go to server because you don't for gun, you spend my money on Pokeboys and charge port. Who does the forest path leave? I don't know. I never go there. I heard that someone got lost in there. 
But I came back. Yep, no he walked in there and he came back. Anything else you know? That place gives me the chills. I don't want to talk about no. it. No. It's Louis. Oh, no. yeah. It is. Your lasso tape. You let the firmly team. attached to the bench. It has three dash one and great. Three dash one. It has eh? Seven. Seven. It has seven engraved on it. It has three engraved. It has five engraved. Has four and has four. As a child, I was very much such a minor place of worship. It sure to wait spared no ex. Such a minor place. Wait, huh. Okay, there's nothing there. A telegram sent by Upton to William. I have confirmed that I have found one. He from Waits. Quite similar to intriguing. It says, Philanthropy never dies. Arkham Tycoon. Oh, uh, next time could have been a real. Turned out to be an asshole. <laughs> 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 I loved Max. Well, BCG, wait to hear what uh, we've got cooking for the rest of the Delta Green campaign. Yep. That's gonna blow your mind. Oh, oh like propane. Zooming around. Okay, so we couldn't find. I'm going to assume it's under that barrel chain, uh, chamber we found, but there's no yeah, way we I'm can goodness. get into it. Yes, how do we get it? So let's go to Blanco's house. Are they alone? Smithy, you sexy motherfucker! Hello, Smithy. It seems you know the nurse at the asylum quite well. Yes. Welcome we to the stream. Been. You've missed. You found me slightly unforgettable. unforgettable. <laughs> You've missed a hell of a fucking night, man. Hell of a night. Quite the woman, that was. What happened, up to As I told you, I didn't make it in time. All I know is that he went mad and killed a friend of his. I don't know. He is now locked up in. Yeah, okay, we well, See you later. We'll see you later. I wish I could. Don't worry. I can handle Hmm. Oh, yeah, I, I suggest we should. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Lock, pick, and take yeah, some of the tools. Finally. finally, the lock, pick come in handy. Brown, brown. You still got it, Lon. No. Ah, oh, poop. There's a shovel. Uh, I'll grab it. Can't use it again. Oh no, my vape's uh, my vape's gone. We oh, shit. I only got uh, got this yesterday. I've already had um 800 puffs of this thing. Okay. Well, I suppose it's better than smoking. Oh yes. Hold on one 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 second. I will be back in shortly. Don't you be touching them graves. Only Skelly Pete's supposed to touch them graves then couple now. I think I found one that still has some juice in it. 
So we got a shovel. Kill. No, Carter. How may I be of assistance? I'm here to see Armitage. He is not here. I do not know when he will be back. Thanks anyway. Can we still go into the library? Mr. Carter and Tolly, I can't. You're right. Damn Excuse it. Me. Okay. Jesus. Sir, I'm sorry. He should be here. I don't. It's strange. He... I see. Hmm. Can I talk to these buttheads again? Uh, nope. You. I'm gone. Hmm. Hi guys. Hi. Yeah. What can we do for? You soon off. We haven't seen him since yesterday. Strange. Gotcha. <clears throat> Until next. Good day. It's against the law, at least in broad daylight. Yeah. Alright, let's see if we can um, do something with the thing we found. <clears throat> yes, we shall see. Walk faster, you bastard. Walk faster. All right, shuffle. Would serve no purpose. Ah, you slimy son. Building. It seems buried. Okay. Um. What do we do now then? So we can't find his grave. Yeah, we don't know where it is. No records or anything. Hmm. Oh, hello. Panel, huh? What's that? What strange symbols? Okay, this must be okay. Okay, Dale, you're going to puzzle. You're going to look this up. <laughs> I am looking it up. Let's see. Because I doubt we're meant meant to be dealing with this at the moment. <laughs> I doubt it. But this is apparently where we're supposed to be. Um, oh, it is. Well, uh. Ah, go to Lawn. Go to go to um go to what's his Oh Lawn's places. office. Yeah. Oh wait, no, something to do. Wait, I know what to do. I'm going to Okay, so we used the lock picks and they broke. Grab it. Then we went then Then he goes to the asylum and shows the photo of Ephraim to Daniel Upton. Which is says Edward Darby. It had to be done, it was just a container. And yet to be sedated. Oh, okay, well, we haven't done that. Yeah, well, let's go do that. Because apparently there's, um... Yeah. I thought I did show the photo to him. Yep, but apparently... Um, it didn't do anything before, but now it will, because we saw the name Edward Darby on a grave. Okay... So we uh, show him the newspaper clipping? Nope, the photo. The photo. Well, I haven't got a photo. 
that's happened. Ah, uh, just talk to him, talk to him. And then you will have an option in the dialogue. Daniel Upton. Daniel Upton. <laughs> ah, okay. Say, I read about you. I read about you. Did you kill him? What was his name? Yes. Slow down, take a deep breath. Um, no? Ah, okay. So I have to figure out what you've missed that the person in the walkthrough has not. Let's see. So they go to... Stone family, ahoy buddy. Welcome to the stream, my friend. We are doing very well. And I'm so glad you're here. Went in the church. About the forest, about the church. I never go there. Corpses every day. Let's keep her. Okay, so they didn't even go in the forest. They... No read one. all of the graves and read the name Edward Darby on a grave, which we must have missed. But how did they get a photo? Um, it was in the archives. It was in, um, the 1913 section. There was an article with a photo of, um... In the cemetery. The article has a photo of him, which I'm pretty sure we, we took that. Yeah, we have. And uh... We did. So what we have to do is, apparently there's a gravestone we have we missed somewhere that has the name Edward Darby on it. And then... I don't like messing around. It says, May I bark that in due? Shovel in here, I'll grab it. Okay, we have the shovel for later. Marco soon got after up. Cream cut, most cream cut, most. Did I do these two? It says burned wool. Reports of my death. It says realized pot. It says H Phoenix. Okay, so somewhere here. You can see two. Let's see that one. Luca and Chilla. Chira. Did you go in the church? I think we've been inside yeah, the church. Yeah, went inside the, the church. Yeah. We spoke to the groundskeeper. Martin Ottowitz. Martin Ottowitz. Harmonix. Oh! I could have sworn that there was Ugh. something written there. Something before. written there. Harmonix 70. I could have sworn that huh. there was something Okay. Before. That's a back at thing I'm gonna guess. It says Martin Pred. Oh, yeah. It's good. That one it says Edward Derby. Seven there it is. Spirit so Yeah, yeah, I read Spirit. that one. Yep. So now, um, we should be able to go go to go to um go to William's office because he might have something to say as well. Hmm. Got the name Edward uh, Edward Derby. Go to Blanco's house. See if he has anything. Hey, uh, what else can you? I don't know. I'm sorry. Ah, sir. What happened? To... As I told, all I, know, I don't know who that friend was. He is now locked up in an asylum. Okay. So yeah, what are we missing? Oh, jeez. We've got the name. Awkward. Thank you so much for the follow on Twitch, buddy. Welcome to the metal crew, my friend. This one for you, and also a cheers with a Red Bull. Okay, go back to the asylum and ask um. See you later, Will. See you ask later. him, ask oh. Upton about the man I wish that he killed. Don't worry, I can. Has Rose got? Oh, Does Rose have anything to say? No, she doesn't. So we didn't quite do it in the same order, but we should be able to see Daniel Upton. Daniel yeah, Upton. click try both of them. <laughs> Alright, show him I read about you. I read about you. did you kill what was his name? <laughs> Slow down, take a deep that so that's when he's supposed to say Edward Darby. Show him the article about it, Frame. See if he does any says anything. Oh, now it's doing something. Ah, there we go. 
There we go. That's what we needed. Wait, what did you just say? <laughs> did you just say Edward Derby? Dead to be done. Dead oh. to be done. He is not dead gray. He is just the container. What have you done? It had to be done. Sedate him. Get out, please. Get him. He'll end up getting hurt. Edward, this has got to be the name of the guy up to murder. The same name was on a grave at the center one restored by Ephraim. In which he is not buried, at least not in an accessible place. He is not in his grave. It had to be. What is that man? Under cover of night, I will go have a look. I need some help with all this, though. He seems to be the type yeah. to. Now we go to William. Do that. Oh, yeah, it's some stuff. I need to go there anymore. Hey, buddy. You mean loan? What do you know about. Edward you know Derby. Edward Derby by any chance? No. Never heard of him. It's the name of the guy Upton killed. How did you find this out? Upton told me. You managed to make him talk? But how? I showed him a photo of Ephraim. Interesting. Upton said he was just a vessel. And what he did had to be done. I think there's a connection. I found Derby's grave at the cemetery. There's no trace of Ephraim's. This does nothing but confirm my hypothesis. I might need some help tonight. Help me in, loan. Do you have the necessary tools? I have a shovel. The tomb is covered by a marble slab. Don't worry. I can Yay, Kruba! Meet up Lovely. Right there. Now we're gonna go dig up some graves. So return to your return to your own oh. office, because you have to rest before night. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. No, not archive, you silly twat. <gasps> Pardon me. I can't think of anything else I have to do. Maybe I should just go lie down. We better yep, rest. Go to sleep and then finish the investigation at night time. Let's go. Let's do the investigation. Oh. Oh. It's not open. I don't need to climb up whenever a bulb in my office burns out. To the cemetery. No. Evening, William. Got the shovel on you? Yes. yes. Let's get to work. Let's start digging. Okay. We're gonna find inside. I'm gonna dig up this random person. Dig up all the yeah, the backer grave. Dig up all the Kickstarter backers. Oh, it's not letting Aww. me. He doesn't want to dig up the. I could have. Doesn't want to dig up Kickstarter backers. Come on, William. Almost, almost there. Put ye back into it, lad. Get ready for your sand check. This is quite the chore. <sighs> We're almost there. Ah, what a stench. Look, look. He has something in his hands. Daniel was right. He can't be evil. Oh my. Sudden check. Holding, holding something that doesn't look like you should touch it. Oh, but we're gonna touch it anyway. Yep, we're gonna touch it anyway. <laughs> he has a damn firm grip for such an old fella. <laughs> Help me, William. One, two, three. <laughs> it looks like some sort of key. To 
fit what kind of lock. We gotta put everything back as it was before we get caught. We'll figure the key out later. The last thing I want is to end up in the newspaper as a grave robber. Well, actually, to tell you the truth, that would give my stories a huge boost in readership. <laughs> Jeez, William, stop kidding around. <laughs> Done. The sun's coming up. Grounds keep low. I hear someone coming. Yeah, I do too. Split up. Let's meet up later at my place. See you later, Lone. And good luck. Arthur, work twice the effort. Yep. The sun was already rising high when Lone arrived. Dead inside! Ahoy, buddy! Welcome to the stream, my friend! The magnitude of pleasure the to have you aboard. Looted him. Innsmouth, Ephraim, and Upton. The tomb of Derby, a weird object found. All looked like pieces of a jigsaw puzzle to which he'd thrown away the complete box art. Motherfucker! He fell asleep almost immediately. With these thoughts whirling in his head. I've never felt this depth of. Oh, sorry, 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 sorry. Give me a second. Uh, ba -ba 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 -ba. Just have to quickly do something I just remembered. Uh, no. Okay. Oh, oh, uh. Sorry, there we go. <clears throat> father passed, well, everything changed. My mother, our poverty. Father and I shared little common ground. I am doing fantastic at Dead Inside. This has been an amazing stream. We've got some new followers. Thanks to the generosity of Naruto, we've got 16 new subs. It's, it's, it's been an amazing night. seems to have lost the root on its way to my lungs. If only he were still here with me, to enlighten me, for guidance. Oh, grandfather. Oh, my grandfather. Howard, aren't you done yet? Howard! I'll be right over. It falls upon me to preserve the items of my grandfather's estate that are the most crucial. We're playing as now. With such a downpouring, a section of grandfather's library is far beyond my field of expertise. Travel chronicles and general geog. I shall put volumes concerning art and painting. The opportune moment to peruse. But how are you going to insight? The brink with the tales of my grandfather. It was always as if snowbound peaks. Rainforests infested with every manner of dangers, splendid cities where the meek are preyed upon. Such place air born. Yeah, 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 yeah. Upon a command, I could steer them as I wish. Let's see. Oh. This globe has buttons set in many specific locales around the world. I have a vivid childhood recollection of grandfather pressing them to open an odd concealed mechanism. Oh. His fingers moved too fast for my young eyes to catch. Perhaps an undiscovered clue awaits me elsewhere. Okay. And these are the locations you visit in Masks of Neil Atherton. <gasps> awesome! So I don't know what significance that has. I'll obtain one for... My current mood is... A portrait of my mother as a young woman. How beautiful she was then. Oh that shit, dead in sight. Sorry to hear about that. That sucks! Out into the world. This would have been back. Let me see. Oh. There seems to be something inscribed on the back. I should discover some method to disengage it from the frame. I feel no desire to lug the picture, frame it Well, off. I know the order you press them in, so... Aha! This means should provoke the intended ends. The pen has been rendered utterly useless. Howard! Nothing worth anything in this. On the underside of the canvas lurks an enigma. 
Okay. Yep. O equals number two. A showcase brimming with bric a brac. I do not wish to turn it off. Ah, oh, good now it's. Oh shit! There's a lot of stuff to check. Various treats. I feel me. the opportune. Mo that looks like I believe I look during the spring. Who even knows to how may have I? Oh, a journal, a travel brand, journal, various small things. Generic, my current these are far beyond treatises. These per so I guess we're supposed to read the travel journal. We left at the first light of dawn. We had the automaton with us. Automaton, what does that mean? We all met in the basement on the outskirts of Boston. It was almost West. like entering a church, long since deserted. Planted all around a pentacle painted upon the granny flagstones were candles. Wax frozen in mid-drip. There was no point mid wasting drip. time here. No Respect the drip, drip, Karen! Paris was at least a week <laughs> away. Our final destination Paris. within the vastness of the Arabian desert lay even further ahead. We had to make okay. So no that's the order we need to press the button. To perform the ceremony. Just looking at it sent a shit, shit, I should have been paying attention then. <laughs> it should go... Should go yeah, United States, France, ago. Arabia. Yeah, this was all merely an outline for a fictional Arabia. work. work of... So let's try that. Let's see. So United States first, then France. Philippines, India, Arabia. Egypt. France and now Arabia. There we go. The compartment has slid open at the base. There is a key ensconced within. And that key is for the chest. Goes to the chest. I'm. Yep. It fits. The trunk is now open. Howard, are you even still there? No. Multitude of books. Without a single exception, they are all very old editions. A selection thereof consisting of the rarer of occult treatises, the need for which escapes me. Wait, that's a rare and ancient printing of a book I favor greatly. I must procure it. Howard, hurry up! No! A very old edition of the Thousand and One Nights. One Night. Can't wait to read it. Oh, that one's empty too. Shit. I've always had a soft spot for these stories. Oh, don't know where any of my other vapes are. Wonder no! Prince Camaralzaman. So many memories. A bookmark holds the place of a story I've never heard of. A tale of Abdul al Hazred. Oh no! Oh, we've Smith met him! <laughs> oh no! <laughs> Smithy! One of their own. Poor Abdul needed to choose. And choose wisely. Yep, reading about him will cause that. <laughs> yep. We know what happens when you meet Abdul al Hazrat. Such a vivid dream. What does it mean? No. I'm coming, William. Alone. Alone. Great news! Great news! William, slow down. What's happening? Wilmarth got back to me. We have to go to Vermont and find some guy by the name of Acker. From what I've learned, he may prove useful to us. It appears he may be quite the eccentric fellow. He lives like a hermit. No mail can get through and, needless to say, he has no telephone. Scaly Pete? To help us understand your condition better and perhaps... Keep nope, it. but Ikeley was the old man from the Whisper in Darkness movie, so... Oh! What we found last night. We can figure all that out after we get back. So we're gonna... I'm curious as well. Most likely this deal with some Migos. much more important. Yep. What about what we found? We can figure all... I'm curious about this. How will we get there? We I get have it? an automobile. Don't worry. An automobile. An automobile. I've never ridden I've got a flame machine. Can't wait to give it a try. Who is this Ackley? A uh, former Miskatonic professor of anthropology. Uh, apparently, he left the teaching profession due to personal reasons. He seems to be something of a strange character. 
Going by what Wilmarth told me, he may have a dependence on certain substances. Oh. What are we waiting for? Now let's go. I want to ride in my automobile. Nope, to insert redeem, redeemed hydrate. Everyone needs an automobile, even the very tall. <laughs> Let's go into Vermont, trap the wall. Looks like it's not a lot. There's something in here. Containers with strange liquids inside. Drink it. Should take them, William. Drink sure. it. Drink at the very least. Just yes. <laughs> drink them. Drink the liquids. Strange liquids. I want Jars to drink them. Coming liquids. Open yet. Yeah. No answer. A flimsy looking door. Nobody's answering the door. Try knocking again. Still no answer. Still no answer. Mm. Still nothing. We cannot have come this far for nothing. Let's just break it. Seriously? What yes. do we have to lose? I don't see any cops around. Come, William. Fine, let's just break in. Sure, it'll all be fine. Hey, uh. Oh, my. Oh, he's dead. What's wrong with him? He looks <laughs> unconscious. Let me check. Hey. Make him drink hey. the liquid. <laughs> Stuff. Need him away. The youth surrender. God only knows what he injects. I don't want to pick it. I don't want to take it. I doubt there's a safe box. A portrait. Maybe Ackley as he could be. But given the way he looks right now, who can tell? Still. Used to distill substances. Hmm. You still need something to inject the potential antidote with. That syringe the over there on the floor seems up for grabs. Yep. <laughs> so we're just going to inject him with the strange it. liquids. And we need something to pick it up with. Because he won't touch it with his bare hands. Yeah, I exit. Maybe a fire poker or something? Don't want to do anything good for you. Good for nothing, detective. <laughs> he was back at the Kevin crime scene, he, wanted, he was all about touching things. Oh! Strange side of oh! oh. oh. Been on the shrooms. That's not how you take shrooms, you don't inject them. I don't have time to read various books. It's warm enough already in it. A fine place. So what if, what have we got that we can pick up the syringe with? I don't have time to read. Various books on uh, a simple one, a simple one. There's nothing I need. Looks like it was used re still. Still substances. A strange key. Wake up, wake up. Nothing. Pour the liquid right into him. <laughs> it would serve no purpose. Damn it! Oh, damn it! So we need to pick up the syringe, but he won't pick it up with his bare hands. Sorry. Because he's a dick. Wake this guy up, William. Oh. Could have just got out. Sw sw I heard another here. Hmm. Is there anything in the car? No. I 
don't have time. I'll cover it. No time. I better just leave that the window look. Can we? Oh, we need to read the book about mushrooms and then they'll pick up the syringe. No time to read right now. The cover it says. No time yeah, to read. Yeah, we need. Right. To, we no need to, to read, read that right. somehow. Oh, but he... Yeah. <sighs> Is it is it in is it in the inventory? No, nope. he won't he won't no pick it up. Ah, he Akeley's got a notepad in his hand apparently, somewhere. So if we search him, he will have on him some sort of notepad oh. or something in his pocket. There we go. So we read that, and then we read the mushroom book. A handwritten book it looks like some kind of notebook. Go on, Lone. Uh, the induced, induced trance, trance is not, is deep, not enough. deep enough. I cannot not maintain the contact for more than a few seconds. seconds. The shaman of the tribe may know how to solve this. The mixture of these strange mushrooms seems to be very powerful. The mixture is complete, needs to be perfected, however. Alright, now we read the mushroom book. I better take a clue. Hey, look at this, William. Oops. This page was bookmarked. Read it, Lone. Let's hear what it says. It seems there's nothing of interest. It deals with strange mushrooms. Lone, it looks more like a manuscript than a book. Let's have a look. It seem to be some kind of notes. Not very meticulously written by the look of it. Oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> yep. Yeah. All right, off you go. <laughs> you're, you're uh, the... <laughs> yep. Well, we don't need to read it. Just um, pick up the syringe, and we'll figure it out. <laughs> oh my God, this it is okay. To be formula needed to induce a trance. Yes, but how do we wake him up? The necessary equipment is here. We just need to understand the formula. Perhaps we also need to clues pick the up notes. the syringe. So now he'll take the syringe. This disgusts me. See nothing else around. Okay. Now we're going to click on the still and we get a puzzle. <laughs> Alright, here's what we do. Um, Alright, press the... Um, press the third plus. That's the one. Oh, wait, wait. No, no, wait. Press the minus button. All right, all right, let's see. That's it. All right, I'm watching what the person's doing. Um, see what they do. Okay. So there's a big combination here. Yep, yeah, it's the notes. All right, go into the still so I can see what you're doing. All right, all right. Hey, all right. Notes. Okay. All right, press, um, press the fourth plus four times. That's it. Press the first <laughs> plus uh, two times. We're not cheating, Ivy. Press the third plus four, five, six times, seven times, eight times. So there's only uh, one more time, one more time. Now distill. Press the flame. And that should be enough to wake him up. Jam it! Looks like it's working. Huh? What? And you killed him. <laughs> better. What? Better? Yeah. You have no idea what you have done. Saved you from probably dying? Months of studies. Years, even, of studies. My trips. My proofs. I was one step away from Yugoth. Oh dear. I already saw his vibrant colors. Together. With my insectoid friends. What are you doing oh. in my house? William, are we even sure the tip is right? Wait a moment, Lone. You're Henry Ackley, right? Yes. Why? You spoke of Yugoth. That's right. What do you know of Yugoth? Are you an enlightened scholar as I am? I would dare to identify myself. <laughs> you did. What you're saying, oh, you're Ivy. What are we going to do with you? Really make it all the way to Yugoth? Yes. 
Well, because remember at the end of the Whisper of Darkness movie, this mm. guy mm. ended up, the professor ended up, insane, they called me. ended up they removed submitting me to the Miko. So. That's what he did too. I was correct on all counts. On all counts. All we counts. Are truly sorry to have interrupted your experiment. We'll make amends by helping you get it back up and running as soon as possible. And as an added bonus, we're here to relate to you an extraordinary. Yes, Ivy, I know. We all know you're a horny yes, sadist. We sadist. know. <laughs> we know. Hey, you wouldn't be lying to me. Unfortunately, not. You have my guarantee. Very, very interesting. But I'm still not sure how useful I'll be. Any information at all, even the slightest detail, can prove vital. My dear loan, your condition is something I have never heard of before. I am, of course, aware of the creature of which you speak, but this is the first time I've ever heard tell of a survivor. A further encounter involving the taking of samples could help, but I would strongly advise against that. Yeah. Anyone in our group has ever been attacked Possibly. by a shock off to survive. Where the other. But at this point, I cannot but accompany you, you on your journey back. But we did when um. Sorely in need of some Well, you fought Shogun to survive, but if someone yeah. gets attacked easily by Shogun, usually they die. Yeah. <laughs> and perhaps I could also be useful to your investigation. Running is the best option. <laughs> yep. This. <laughs> Achievement <laughs> unlocked. A team. Absolutely agree. Okay, let's get on our way then. Because we have all the three of these Lovecraft protagonists that are from the story, so. You mentioned something about a corpse holding a key during the drive here. That's right. We got the key last night. This all seems so unreal to me. Like I'm just a puppet. Someone led me to that key. Starting with that fake letter, it led to that horrific crime. Everything began with my misadventures in Innsmouth. Yep. I'd love to go there someday. It seems bursting at the <laughs> seams with mysteries. No, you really you don't want to go there. <laughs> advise against it. I value knowledge far more than my skin. It came to our notice, Henry. That mixture would probably have killed you. Gentlemen, is there anything else you require? No thanks. We're fine for now. <laughs> no run. I Kill! Leave them. <laughs> oh, I Ivy. I've been in a better place. Give me a rum. In any religious sense. There's nothing left I'm for sorry, you. sir. Now, there is this it's only the 1920s. It's not, not really enough. widespread yet. Provide Kill! Some satisfaction. Lone Carter? Might be. What do you want? I just ordered myself some food while well, this happens. I'm starving. Look at the altar in the church. <laughs> I had who? some before Where? the stream. Wait, wait, come back here. Who is that? How the hell should I know? This whole thing is driving me crazy. Tastier and tastier. Secrets and subterfuge. Just the way I like it. Yeah, just the way I like it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Exactly what this key is and how to use it. I should head to Miskatonic to look into that. Okay. Yeah, order myself a pizza. Cemetery. Okay. Lovely. I'll meet up with you there later. Uh, I should go turn the um, lights on. Pizza. I do know of this meal known as pizza. Ah, standing on everything. Oh. Whoa. Whoa. No, I mean it's my oh. pizza. Alright. What are we doing? <laughs> I'm assuming the church. Yep, look at the altar in the church, apparently. Oh. Oh. The guy at the cafe told us to have a There's some kind of lock set into the Let me have a closer look at With the key. Yes. It appears to be some sort of mechanism. The magic key. It appears. It appears to. It appears. It appears. It appears. It appears. Um. It seems that after some time, it returns to its original position on its own. Alright, so let's see what I huh. see. Let me see. Hmm. Okay, so what way does it. <laughs> I 
Huh. I don't know what the person is in the video is doing. Um, they're just rotating it randomly like you are. Oh, okay. oh you need to make it face direct. Turn it upside down. It's, you need to make it turn upside down somehow. That's what I did. Oh, okay. So, um... Alright. I'm gonna guess... These are combinations, I think. Uh, I, yes. I think. Um, I'm, I think, I think, I think, I think. So I'm gonna give you the link so you can actually see what the person is doing. The... It has 3-1 engraved on it. So, I'm gonna give you the link, so... On it. That's firmly okay, so, it has seven there's the link. And it will take you to the top. Oh, Jesus Christ! Oh, Kitty, holy shit. Thank you for the one year subscription. Thank you very much. Charles. Thanks, Kitty. Um, Go in Milo's Lucky Dice, and I put a link to the video, and it will take you exactly to where the person's doing the puzzle, and so just follow what they do. <laughs> <laughs> We're not cheating, Ivy. It's it's a necessary evil in these games. Alright, he's turning it back and forth. Yeah, I know, but it ends up unlocking it for him, so <laughs> I be mean, this game this game would have us here all night if we didn't look up. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, okay. I'm gonna get you to watch it and you just tell me which direction he turns it in how many right. times. Alright, let's have a look. Um, let me go to the video and see. Let's work this out. <laughs> let's work it out and see how this happens. Alright. Let's see. Right, right, right. Hold on, wait, uh... Oh, oh, sorry. Right, right, right. And then left, 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 left. That's it. And then and then oh, I've just figured out the puzzle. Okay, and then right until keep going right until I tell you to stop. Stop. No, nope. no, nope. start again. <laughs> it's a clock. That's the fucking hate clock. clocks. God it, damn. It, it's a it's a big hand on a clock. So okay, so let's start again. I'll just go back to the start yep. of the puzzle. So uh right, right, right left 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 Okay and then right and then right again, 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 one more, stop, okay, and then let me see what they do next, okay, left, 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 okay, go left, back the other way, okay, again, 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 stop, okay, and then and then okay, uh, right again, 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 stop. Make sure that's the correct way. <coughs> Is okay, and then back the other way. Okay, and, and then just go back the other way. One, two, Bingo. three. Hey, we did it. There we go. Well, that sucks, Kitty, that you have a toothache. Oh. Oh, Yay, we honey. opened it. <laughs> but finally, we opened it up. I heard a loud rumble. You so should long. have some whiskey on on that toothache. And we are doing Kitty, good. This has been. I a am fine, fantastic. Kitty, except I am covered in sweat right now and. 
having a hot flush. Oh, dirty job. boy. <laughs> Interesting. Hey, okay, Kitty, we have had 16 subs, all thanks to Naruto. These before. Yes. Tell me what they mean then. No, love. I'll need to go to a certain special place to decipher them. Guys, I don't know if there's any connection, but Armitage seems to have dropped off the face of the earth. No one at the university knows where he is. I went to his house, and he hasn't been there for the last two days. Oh, Ivy! Yeah, we're not cheating, we're playing with finesse. We found. Yes, we're speed running, okay? okay. <laughs> <laughs> yes, I need to go somewhere to do so, though. I don't you believe you. know how I get around. <laughs> I'll need certain substances. Do you have access to them? I have a contact that might be of help. Rose. There are surely tons of medicines. Three whiplashes for each of you. What <laughs> kind of place? A madhouse. Yeah, that sounds about right. Good. Let's go. We'll figure out how to get our hands on your substances later. I might have an idea how to do just that. Ooh, that's so. I suppose we're going back to Arkham Asylum then. But I want to go see what's in the crypt thingy. Yeah, but apparently we're not ready to go there. Ah, <sighs> of course. Of course. Hi, William. Jules. How are you, Ben? Everything okay with the family? We'll pull through. My friends and I have to meet with Rose. Will that present any kind of problem? Absolutely not, William. You are always welcome here in our madhouse. Thanks, Ben. See you later. No, no. See you Rose. later. It's been a while. Oh, hello, Rose. Rose. Mm -hmm. Oh, William! No, oh, ravish me! Told me Sorry. Your best wishes. <laughs> and she looks a bit like you, you, Ivy. Just because she's a redhead? Yep. <laughs> well, when the character's face is literally like 20 pixels, Hair color means a lot. <laughs> doesn't seem to be. I think this is what we're gonna take a look and be quick about. It. Oh yes, yeah, have your bloody destruction. Done. We can go. Good. Done. We can go. Yeah, 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 yeah. He's got his drugs. Drugs, drugs. Gonna have the drugs. William. William, get your dick back in your pants. To catch up with Rosa. Head to my house. Sure you do. I'll meet up with you there. Sounds like a plan. See you later. Shouldn't we wait for William? I've done this countless times. No drugs now! Sure you're not taking unnecessary risks? You can't even begin to know how to decipher what is written here. Someone is laying breadcrumbs for us to follow. That much is certain. At this point, I see no other option but to just go for it. Very well. <laughs> just in she jack myself with strange things. Yep. Check Henry. myself with shrooms Thanks. again. You can <gasps> I know shrooms! It's already Hell taking effect. Is. My head is getting light. I beg you. Blech. Blech. I'm unique. <laughs> I'm a unique special snowflake. No one's no. like me. <laughs> oh, Ivy. What are we going to do with you? Oh, hello. How magnificent. I come here, Gee, I this place looks familiar. Yeah, this looks like the place from um, Lost from Beyond, but this is supposed there to be Yago. Oh no, I meant the um, the giant archive archive we went to on the moon. Oh yeah, Selena. Yes, this does look a bit like Selena. Ah, and it's a library. Oh, simply wondrous. So Wait, it must be Selena. Yeah, this must be Selena. Ah, memories. No time for I have to start searching. I wonder if the roof is full of buyer keys. Just oh, like dear the one we uh oh. Who's speaking to me? They are enormous volumes. I would not be able to eat. Who even knows what astounding knowledge? <gasps> this is the same library that you I went to in Days of the Beast. Who even knows to what? I don't rec. They are enormous. What straight? It will not. How can I possibly? Huh? Remember, if you if you get a camera, don't don't use the flash. Don't look up. Don't look up. <laughs> oh, the door's opened. I'm 
been blocked off here. What a view. This is not the first time I've been here, yet every time I see no known constellation. Perhaps I'm very... Or perhaps even in time. Time to find this unknown world creature. A concept that we humans use to explain the sequential unfolding of events. For example, between birth and death, a series of changes and circumstances occur that we identify as time. Death. For us beings of Earth, life is limited. It has a beginning and, after a certain time... This place is filled end. with death. Of course it is. <laughs> what everyone does. <laughs> love me, I'm a lovable person. Well, you've already already got Dale's love just because you're a redhead. <laughs> <laughs> this place is filled with death, Ivy. We went here in one of our campaigns and Smithy nearly died and M1 did die. Oh, shit, went, shit hit the fan because of M1. <laughs> yep. Look. That was only Smithy's second session as well. Well, granted I was going to kill anyone anyway, but Jesus Christ, M1. <laughs> yep. would not be able to even move. Oh, shit. I misclicked out of the screen. I still don't recognize I have to find this. These doors have no locks. It's impossible. Okay, um... Oh. No knowledge need be taken from here without paying the price. You are a significant being. Are you willing to pay it? You may be irrelevant, but the price you pay would not be respawned. M1 does have some bad mojo, <laughs> especially with his dice <laughs> rolls. <laughs> oh, yeah. Doesn't matter what he uses the physical dice, Discord dice spot, or our bear dice spot. Uh oh. Ow! Could Where you don't claw the back of my head? <laughs> Is there anybody there? No, neither fuck. It seems there is no possible exit from this place. No possible exit. What? What is happening? Oh! Oh! Sweet baby Jesus. Oh no! What manner I know who that is. Are you listening to me? Wait. Yep. Yep. No, what we know what that is. But a dream, except for its realism. There isn't always it. There's always an exit. Death is not the end, just the beginning. Don't follow him. No, don't go Learn into there. No. Learn from Smithy. <laughs> no. Learn from Edwards. <laughs> Jesus, no. Please, wait. Learn from Edward Rivers. You have arrived. What it's is too happening? late! What know you of the reason for my abrupt summons? All in due time. Hurry! You must go see the keyholder and then attend the council. Al Hazred, this is the protagonist of the story I was reading. Some protagonist that I live his story. Yeah, Edward Rivers read a story about him, and look what happened. So what's this I got? Pendant that belonged to my father. No, BCG, I... Underground. <laughs> I... Maybe there might be a star vampire. Maybe not. I, I, I don't think so. I don't think so. There might be a star it's vampire. I've one never actually seen one in any Cthulhu game before. I dare... I think they're pretty cool Father, monsters and we've never seen are. one in any game, so. But me. if this is, like, uh... Fully Mountains of Madness, I doubt there will be any star vampires. Yeah, I doubt there will be a star. But Mountains of Madness also doesn't normally have Selino or Yugoth or the Nameless City in it either, so. Yeah, this is also true. Would I ever need them? 
terracotta vases. So many books, some of which are ancient forbidden text. No time for reading. Of course it's a waste of forbidden text. An oil lamp. It's bright enough in here all... No, I have a table with... This has nothing to do. Everything needed for reading. Most likely where the keyholder sits to do his reading. Hello, Mr. Keyholder. So, <laughs> you have finally arrived. Yes. Tell me, Keyholder. How may I serve you? I, oh, in the library, it was by a key. Yep. Actually, BCG, what was on the roof was by a key. challenge lies ahead. Hundreds and hundreds of fire keys, and Can everyone you any snapped the and camera and set them all me. off. That would violate the unbreakable laws of the keepers. As much as I love you, I am forbidden to give you. Any oh, assistance. he rusts me. Finally, I shall become one of the keepers. All your years of <laughs> service will not have been in vain. Yes. I was but a child when my mother brought me to this place. That day is one of my fondest memories. You were a child full of vigor and life. You have always performed with excellence. Much gratitude, Keyholder. You are to me as the father I never knew. Go now, my son. I never you. knew. I shall go then. Until later, Keyholder. My son, Keyholder. I am so sorry, but the grand plan takes precedence yep. over all else. Yep, not good. You know what's gonna happen? Yeah. does not know what awaits them. Nevertheless, all is in readiness. Eh? Eh? Don't speak of me. There you go, buddy. Sacrifice is already incarcerated in the dungeons. Uh -oh. Good. Although I'm quite sacrifice. Ready, sacrifice. What are they talking about? Yep. Sacrifice? Dungeons? What on earth is going on here? We'll leave the dungeon for last. <laughs> yep. Larry was going so smooth up until that BCG. But that was the last thing he ever did. Yep. I've already and taken the hook. Smithy I've lost a leg. The so we've got a hook. We can't take the rope? I've already taken the hook. Fine, okay. No rope for me. No rope. Just a hook. Not up. No, no, no. Not up for you. Not up. Coaching. Stop Father, it. Am I strong enough? Grant me understanding. Give me sight beyond sight. Man. I wish Star Wars 5A had a printed Mother, version. Oh my god, me too! Abdul, my son. I'm so proud of you. What are you talking about? Who locked you up in there? I gave up my that is child just for the key. The voice does you not go with that situation. Yeah, the voice does not go Abdul, with Abdul, my son. You are not my expected son. to understand. This was all decided long ago. My imprisonment is just a final uh, He's Australian, that's Your why. Father yeah. Was a keeper. Alas, his no, I want to play Jedi. Jedi Academy is a good game, so you should do journey. it. Your future oh, I need to find... Yeah, Jedi Academy is a good game, I think. shares a vital role. As Especially you know, the lightsaber fight. absolute devotion and ultimate sacrifice. I only pray that you are strong enough to perform it. I see where this awesome. is going. Mate, you got to write the Necronomicon. I refuse. Oh, you hooked on war. I tried to get into Warframe. I just. I'm getting out of here. Listen, mate. Would you no better get started My cracking mother. on that Necronomicon. An empty cell. Most likely due to the fact that one of the bars maybe will come in. Oh, okay. No. Ah! They fit together. Fortune smiles. Fortune smiles upon me! Psst. Hey, you. You're Abdul, yes? I said that creature. To be caught <laughs> such from a worm chained up in a cell means little to me. True, but in a way, he also stands correct. Speak now. Speak now. Mere words. We owe you nothing. 
Although this is quite entertaining. See, we are in a cell. We are yes. the enemies of the keepers. And we fight against everything they stand for. Despite this, our destiny can never be as miserable as your own. Who are you? Let's just say that every bright side always has a dark one. Look at the moon. It always presents to us one face. But we know that the other is still there, plunged into darkness. This is as irrefutable a fact as any dogma. The light shines equally, in full or as half, <clears throat> or even as a mere slice. You'll see what I mean tonight. We prefer to side with those who are without ambiguity. Yeah, Our no one made it through that, that climax. The key has been down unto nope. for a reason. <laughs> Except for Harkin. That is pure blasphemy. Good old Harkin. Scum. Cease filling my ears with such obscenities. As you wish, my friend. As you wish. Oh, I was so close on destroying the earth. I was so close. If you wish to see your mother escape this prison, we can help you. Why would you do so? Let us just say that seeing the keepers suffer uncomfortable emotions gives us pleasure. Much pleasure. Much pleasure. Yeah, yeah. That would make me a traitor. We couldn't help but overhear your previous conversation over there. You are aware of what awaits you. However, you can ignore us if you so wish. Yes, oh. Abdul. Ignore them and remain true to your duty. Quiet, mother. To your duty. These cells were built with the highest of craftsmanship. They can only be opened with the key. This you is say that, yet I no broke one of the bars off. Yeah, already. <laughs> a small favor in return, assuming you can manage to obtain the key. And what is it you want? There is a certain item in the keyholder's room that we desire. This object can take many forms. It's up to you to distinguish its current one. Such oh a task is impossible. That is your problem. But I can provide you with one small hint. Go on. I know it holds great magical power within it. I'll see what I can do. Okay. Is it a lamp? We'll just wait here. We're not feeling up. <laughs> just wait. I've already. Mother, I should. Abdul, no. Abdul, yes! Don't do it! We know what will happen. Abdul, why have you come back? The council is waiting for you. Forgive me, Keyholder. I was wondering if I could borrow an artifact of yours, one I became aware of through my studies. One with a singular magical power I desire to study fully before my test begins. Abdul, I know that of which you speak. It lies right before your eyes. Anyone other than a keeper would have great difficulty recognizing it. I found out so. Ah, uh, yes, really? great. My father. Your father was the most faithful of the keepers. Endowed your was he father. with great power and dedication, I cannot fathom why you desire that particular item. Regardless, I will not stop one must be, however, as your tutor of many years. I must warn you that every action has... Yeah, 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 yeah. Advice. Abdul. Okay, um... <laughs> An oil lamp. It's bright enough in here. No time for read. So many, some of which are ain't. Everything needed. Uh... But what I ever need to record a video. Most likely were the key holder this. No. A table. Um a table with everything necessary. Okay. That's table. So I've clicked on everything. Remember my make your the keyhole. No time for re That would do no Kill him! That would do no good. Okay, so it's not the lamp. lamp. <laughs> it's in the keyholder's room, but there's... <laughs> good old Robert Morgan.
Uh, oh dear, oh dear, oh dear, oh dear! She's... Oh, oh. That would do no... No, okay. I don't know! No time for... Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear! What does the ancient text say, uh, Dale? Uh, let's see, let's see. This has nothing to do with me. Pass down your father, ba ba de ba ba ba. Tell me that he's oh, no. to give us the damn that lamp. Too funny. No, Abdul, just as I've always known. Uh, okay, so he apparently at some point starts writing the Necronomicon. Oh! Which we haven't seen yet, so let's see what we miss. Some okay, delay no further, King Holder. Shall return as soon as possible. Okay, go back to the cell cell area. And when we get there, keep the key. Oh, we need to take the lamp from the room with Abdul, the other guy I Take the lamp, but how? It won't let me. Um, let's see, take the lamp. Oh, we use something on the lamp? Ah, oh, we use the, 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 um... The hooky? So that lamp there, use the, use the pendant on it. No, use the pendant on it. Oh. And something will happen. And this should put us on the right track. The pendant grows hotter and hotter. This one. So now, I believe now I you can. Excellent, Abdul. Thought, thought it was going to be the lamp. Now you can take it back to the cell block, and we should be able to advance. Yeah, I wouldn't even thought about using the pendant. I, I would have thought of using it, but probably not in that on that, in that specific room, because you'd think... So the lamp goes to the prisoner, because he wanted the Did lamp. Did you recover the key and the artifact? I have the artifact, but I do not have the key yet. Hand over the artifact. Forget it, you filthy sewer rats. You will get it only after I have the key, and you tell me how to use it. We can wait. So where is the key? Um, let's see, Did the person get the key in the video? Don't. First the artifact. Here's the no tricks. Okay, so they got the key. Let me see where they got the key. Have to keep the key. Oh, 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 oh. Idea, idea, idea. Oh, the other you get the key. the key. Yeah, that's it. And you know and you know how to get it from him, don't ya? <laughs> there we go. Hi, so smart! Yo, Shamochi. Hi, Archie. What's the matter, buddy? Hi, so much, eh? Hi, so smirt. I'm smirt. Oh. Did you recover? Yes. Tell me where the hidden lock is. First, the artifact. What need would you have for a lamp in a... That is none of your concern. Do you not wish to see your mother go free? Give us the damn lamp. Here it is. Excellent. Where's the lock? You'll find a small crack in the column to your left. Fare thee well. Fool. Fool. Oh my. Uh oh. Now, it was near Lethotel. <laughs> it was. Small crack in the left. What? It was near Lethotel. What is it, baby? What's the matter? Hmm? It's a man, my precious. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hmm. It was our old pal Louis. You cannot open the lock without <laughs> using its key. <laughs> what? <laughs> my friend was selling a copy of I heard a GTA clip. San Andreas on eBay, just to clear out his shelf. Someone mm. sent him a message saying, does this work in my Samsung? Quickly! Oh Take dear god. No. <laughs> Abdul, move. 
Oh, he's a good boy. My Archie's a good boy. Good Archie. My cat is sleeping. No, he's not. He's got up somewhere. Huh, interesting. We're trapped. Trapped like rats. Come with us. Don't worry, Mother. Everything will be fine. I know that everything will be fine. Just as I've always known. Because I am also near Lethington. Um, hey, Victoria. <clears throat> Can I actually get off? No, mother, no. Frost Glacier. Bongo. <laughs> Trust Bongo. Frost Glacier, thank you so much. Oh my god. Thank you so much for the two bits. Greatly appreciate it. And he did preserve it. <laughs> he passed it on to Edward. Poor Edward. Poor Edward. Eduardo. Oh, hello, Big Daddy Cthulhu. Here he is. Ah, uh, yes. Necronomicon. Starting to write the Necronomicon. Just as he is... destined to do. Henry. Henry, are you alright? What? Oh, I shall be back in a second. Calm yourself, Henry. My food is here, it's not letting me pause it. The keepers of the key. Keepers of the key. Excuse me, I've that name before. Guys, I need coffee. And that's where the vision is. I need coffee. How do you know that what you saw is real? I can demonstrate it so very clearly, Lone. I can now read the engravings on the tablet we found. That's true. It could also be that you already knew how to do that. Maybe the lure of a healthy dose of our approval may have tempted you to lie about it. Hello! How dare you! Do you actually <laughs> think I feel yeah. the need for your approval? God damn, I hate Uber drivers. Leave, leave no. a pizza, pizza box outside in the rain. That's totally smart. Yep. I apologize. And I sometimes they won't even knock, so you know they're there. Anyway, I hate it. The tablet reads, oh, pizza. Less, although extremely powerful, they are pizza. considered lesser gods. They preside over small worlds, and the positions of the stars forces them into oh, good God, that's so good. Why, we do not know. Perhaps certain configurations provide them with energy and nourishment. Great Cthulhu, sleeping in death, at the sunken city of Relay, awaits his reawakening. Ayataqua lurks in the cold Arctic region, worshipped by ancient forgotten races. Beyond the known universe exists countless other entities named the Outer Gods. Ah! <laughs> Neither alive nor dead. Multidimensional, infinitely powerful and insane. The most powerful and insane of them all, Azathoth, gurgles and God damn Azathoth! A thousand pipers at the center of the universe. Yep. Oh, fate forbid that the cacophony should ever cease. What does all that stuff even mean? These it are means you fucked. That are often found in very rare occult texts. Yes, and I can assure you that they are much more real than you can imagine. Unfortunately, I cannot prove that. Not yet. The truth of the matter is, the first concrete proof is you. Me? Your so-called... condition. Cthulhu. Now that you mention it, in the time of the Low Innsmouth, Elliot kept on repeating the chain with that word in it. That's extremely bad. That means the town is in some way involved with these. And we guys. all know how that chain goes, don't we? <laughs> yep. Now, let's just concentrate on understanding what this passage means. A passage from the Necronomicon, which was written, it is said, by the mad Arab Abdul Al Hazred. He was in my vision. I shudder still. Night is falling. 
Back to the cemetery. Need some kind of. Oh uh, yeah. Okay. Well, we're gonna get light source. <clears throat> hmm. Well, let's see. The uh, okay, we need a compass and a lantern. Uh, near your office, there is a man who will sell you both. Ah, oh, what is it, Mickey? I waited for you to show up. There we go. Some kid left something for you. He said it was urgent. He did. A compass, a strange compass that does not point north. Did he say anything else? No, Lone. Nothing at all. Thanks a bunch. Nothing at all. Do you have anything, perchance, that might light our way? Sure. I have a lantern. I'll buy it. It's two dollars. Oh, damn! Here you go. No problem, Lone. See you around. See you real soon, buddy. See you real soon. The compass. It does not work in the conventional way. It marks no specific direction. Listen, this could be extremely dangerous. But it seems that hurting me could be extremely difficult. Wait here for me. But no, there shall be no further discussion about this, William. Yeah, William, well, you this is my dick. problem, and mine alone to deal with. I don't want you risking anything more than you need to. I'll keep you informed on everything that happens. If that's the way you want it, Lone. It's not the way I choose, but the decision is yours. Perfect. See you later. A vibration in my pocket. Now it's doing something. The plot thickens. The plot does thicken indeed. Ackley has translated it something like this. Although extremely powerful, they are considered lesser gods. They preside over small worlds, and the position of the stars forces them into long lethargic periods. Why? I do not know. Perhaps certain configurations provide them with energy and nourishment. Great Cthulhu, sleeping in death, at the sunken city of Vile beyond the known universe, exist countless other entities. Uh, yeah. Okay. <clears throat> oh yeah, that's what I was gonna save. Can you see that's up here? Oh, this pizza's good. Pizza! Oh, here are. Oh, oh, that's not good. Well. This grandeur is most that unexpected. Does the yep. cemetery's renovation have anything to do with that? Well, we finally get to explore underneath. Can't budge it. A representation of a strange tentacled creature. I saw this kind of stuff back at Innsmouth. Looks fresh. Fresh. Whoa! It's closed. No way I can force that open. Hmm. It marks no specific direction. Does it have to do with the panels I saw? saw this kind of representation saw this kind of um, outside. Maybe, let me check. So far, they've just gone into the same place as you. Compass helped us find it. Serve no purpose. Compass. Victoria, this is my food. And yes, boss, I do know, um, Sabaton got the, uh, golden button. Ah! 
It does have to do with the panel we found before. Ah, thought so. So we go to that panel. No, no we have to find it. <laughs> Compass should help you, apparently. That's enough pizza for now. Pete Saar. Oh, yes. I'm Pete of House Saar. Ah, oh, there it is. I'd very much like this to meet this Pete Saar. Yes. Now, now we have to use the, if we the, use the tablet. We use the tablet. The stone yeah. tablet will tell us how to solve it, apparently. We have to exit out, and then we look at the stone tablet that we've got. That's the one. And apparently that will tell us how to open it. Ackley has translated to... it some, although extremely powerful. They are considered lesser gods. Aha, uh -huh. so those things represent... Worlds, ...and the position of the stars forces them into long, lethargic <laughs> periods. Why? We do not know. Perhaps certain configurations provide them with energy and nourishment. Aha. Uh -huh. Cthulhu, sleeping in death, at the sunken city of Valais. Awaits his reawakening. Ayatakwa lurks in the cold Arctic region, worshipped by ancient forgotten races. The Suppress the water smoke. one, because I because the god we're talking about is Cthulhu, and he rests in the water. Uh, let me see. Let me make sure there's a uh, panel. Let's see. Do they go in any order? Water. Should stay pressed down after you. Huh. No. Oh, hold it down. Hold it down, maybe. Because the person in the video, they press the water one, and it stays. No, it won't down. let me hold it down. Huh. Let me see. Then I'm just gonna check again. So there it. The compass. The compass is spinning. Yeah. They. There can't be more. That more of these. I don't think. Hmm. Alright, well, I assume go back to the. Because I don't think. And let's. I'm just gonna check and make sure that they didn't do anything in the. It's closed. Door. Compass. Say so leave. They go. Compass leads to a strange entrance. So we go. Let's translate it to something like this. Yeah, that's what we did. Okay, forbid that cacophony should ever cease. And then they go into the panel, and is it the same panel as. No, I found another panel. And out of the panels, are uh, the. Nah, they must all have different. Okay, so try pressing the water on this one. Yep, okay, there we go. Alright, All right. now go back to the place. Go back to the place? Go back to the underground place. Oh, okay. Oh, another identical... Oh, wait, no, not yet. There are, we got to find all the other ones, so... Apparently. So let's find... So there should be... Another identical one. So if we find... Oh, I see, yep. It's the one on the left. So there's one on the left somewhere, and that one we have to press the snow mountains. Alright, this one. Uh, try pressing the mountains. Nope. Try pressing the other the stars. Try pressing that. Nope. Okay, so we have to do them in order then. So we have to find the one that's the snow one first. There we go. <clears throat> All right, this where is where it it's going to st start getting tedious. <laughs> yep, this is when it starts doing stuff like this. I think it would have just been fine to have one panel and you press the buttons in a certain order. Any ideas? 
Alright. Let's see. Take their spawn, welcome back, buddy! How the fudge are you going, my son? Do we have one here? No, no, no! Fuck. Go back. Let's go to the west. To the west. Ah, yes, the west. Whoa, Ooh. okay, yep, we found one. Okay. Oh, there's the left. So this one should be. Jesus! This... Holy shit, we've been raided! Again? <laughs> An 18 party raid, holy fuck! Davy Dorky, how oh my fucking god! Holy shit! Welcome, raiders! Thank you so very much, holy shit! Got um Davy Dorky, Bell the female go Golk, <laughs> Zimmy thirteen. God, we've got a holy shit MD Helen. Holy shit! Thank you so fucking much, my God! Holy crap! Ahoy! <laughs> Welcome to the Metal Crew. Um, wow! Holy shit! Wow! Uh, Seeker of the Rings, ahoy! A big fan ahoy to everyone! I am your host, Sabaton Liam. Seeker, you are not late at all. You are just on time, mate. My fucking god, Davey, holy shit, thank you. Wow! Through the gates of hell! As you may cut away to heaven! Vander Forge, thank you so much for the follow, buddy, and welcome. To the Twitch side of the metal crew, buddy. Please enjoy your stay. I am your host, Sabaton Liam, and the disembodied voice is known it's as me. Da otherwise known as Dale. All right, so yes. this. Yep. Okay. The mountain. Ma mountains yep. are down. Yep. Now we need to find a third one, which, which is, if I recall, uh, south from here. Because I saw them go south. I do need an e, e hug. That's. Holy shit, people. Thank you so very much. Davey, what were you streaming, mate? That's it, an east. Oh, uh, I think, yeah, we go east. There we go. Holy shit. Today's been... Oh, oh yeah, we got it. Today's been got it. fucking right, this amazing. This one is stars. 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 And the other one would we've be got one, one more. We've got yeah, we've got one more, and it's going to be the one wind. we always find. Yeah, the one we always find, the one we found and didn't, the one we found originally that we couldn't do anything with. Yeah. Yelling at Fandal, fucking wall elf dumbasses. Oh, oh my. So sounds like you had a successful time then. <laughs> Punching nerds in the face with swords and fire. Yep, okay, very successful time. Oh, and here it is. No, wait, no, no, no. No, mind. no, it's not. It just cracked it itself. To the north. Ah, yep. There it is. Alright, so this one should be the wind. Yay! Now you just have to head back to the underground area. Ta da! We did that tedious puzzle. Anymore. It didn't work anymore. I can't believe I'm out of vapes already. This is ridiculous. I tell ya. We've got three raids today. Holy shit. Three raids. 16 subs. Uh, about probably se seven follows. Holy shit. This. Fuck me. <laughs> <laughs> Rather not. <laughs> to each his own. At least buy me a drink first. I like to be yes. wined and done before I get fucked. Through that door. Ugh, Jesus. Twenty-one people watching. Holy shit! 
That is really good. Oh. Armitage. Oh, hi there, buddy. Hi, hi, hi. Lone. All has gone according to plan. Yes, quite. Buy you a drink, you say? Yes. Do you take me for a drink? Do it. All in due time. Actually, can I? I can't pause. I'll, 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 otherwise, I would get a Captain Morgan. Nearly been assisting me so far. I knew you would do it. Seriously, thank you so fucking much, Mess Hearts. My God. What do you hope to accomplish by all this? Don't you know the magnitude of the powers you're playing with? You're insane. A madman. A madman. Mad. Whoa. Has spent numerous <laughs> lifetimes to attain it. But a stupid human. Well, I'm thinking you, Davy, and Techno. Big hearts to both of you. But now, all that shall be undone. Can't tell you guys enough how. Oh, oh. oh. Hi there, Coltus. Can't tell you enough how much. I need a, need a day like this. Who are you? Streaming and talking to all you fine fellows, it's 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 amazing. And I'm sorry, I'm still talking over this. The power incarnated in that mere mortal will bring my to life. Oh bread, you could spread me any day. Even Father Dagon will bow to our Dagon? Father Dagon! Dagons. The wisdom of my master is profound and powerful. I'm Dagon. <laughs> Dagon. Dagon from Darkwater. Stop you lunatic. <laughs> what do you think you're doing? This is not a power you can hope to control. Let's find out. Katla. Oh dear. Katla. Oh dear. Here we go. He's just a boy. Stop the lunatic. Katla, Besha, Katla, La, he clacked on. What's happening? Brad, you are amazing. Just in general, buddy. <clears throat> Oh no. He lost his senses, his mind hazy. The pain was unbearable, but now he was finally better. As long as he was better. Like a hungry wolf now satiated. Hungry like the wolf. Wolf. Where was the London? Ah, woo. Are you back with us? Yeah. Oh my God! He's doing okay. He's just unconscious. What happened? To you? Right. We I'll be back in a second. We're getting a drink. <laughs> but just focus on pulling well. yourself together for now. My men will transport you and Armitage to a safe place. Uh, it's all so muddled in my head. I don't Deuce believe men you, that Agent Armitage. Sure, they were a threat to us, but that gruesome scene will scar my mind forever. Luckily, we managed to save Armitage. Three days had passed, and I felt much better. We have to meet up at Miskatonic University. Take stock of the situation. Whoa! From Upton, horrible monster. Once again, this is all to you, all you 21 crazy, beautiful motherfuckers that are watching. Chained down. It's absurd to suggest that this was planned from the start. It's absurd as you think. Dissidents of the Hunter. Who are you? I'd also like to know who that madman in the catacombs was. The spell he unleashed was beyond any known power. Yep. I could answer the latter with Oh, Davy Bundy? Really? If it's rum, come on, at least Morgan, Kraken, or Sally Jerry's. It has to be spiced rum. I like the Kraken. Everyone loves the Kraken. As a catalyst. Is that Skull. possible? I mean, bringing the dead back to life? Under all the circumstances, 
No, but with Ephraim's knowledge and given Loam's condition, <sighs> we believe it is at least plausible. We may never know. <laughs> Oi, you're drinking captain out of a can! Straight into the lion's den. Well, to be fair, right. these have been in, fri uh, in my fridge since. But there was something we needed to verify. For about a month. Have allowed anything to happen to My friend brought them over, and I just haven't been bothered to drink them. Gentlemen, please calm down. So hey, free booze. <laughs> what cause? What are you talking about? Armitage, you can't mean that. All in due time. Time that we. No, tell me now, not this due time danger. bullshit. They know of your yeah, mutation. If, they, if this is gonna keep me alive, all of his then tell me. They will hunt you down. I was there all alone in the caves under Innsmouth. No, Davy, not the it's best like rum. Bundy should not be touched by anyone. Elliot. Do I need to fight yeah. you? I know, I know nothing about rum. But Kraken, I like. You. Spice rum Spice all the way. Thanks a bunch for letting me live. Besides, after having now just seen you in action, that may have been a more troublesome operation than we expected. <laughs> Stop right quiet. there. We don't kill people. We are the good guys. Armitage, I must disagree with you on that. So you can you find a cheap try. To preserve the I have race. not heard of that one. Oh, another good spice rum, uh, Baron Semity. The important thing is that's a good one. Oh, Baron Semity's all right. Is yes, it's, it's, at why you were never it's a nice drop. We have no use for your morals. We are dealing with I should really be paying attention. Motivations. But I'm talking As to people and this is amazing. Noticed. This the is the best stream I've had in god knows how long. Makes us no better than them. I agree. Well, mm. Spice Rum doesn't leave me dusty. Spice Rum makes me feel Stop amazing. Me. Maybe it's just alcohol in general. <laughs> if anyone had heard the story disclosed in that tiny room by that small group of people, they would have thought them insane. It turned out that the group to which... Oh yeah, we've got uh, Bundaberg... Um, you heard right. Uh, root beer as well. Right, is it root beer? Or ginger beer? Yeah, we have that. We have that. Is it uh, root beer or ginger beer that we have? The keepers of no, it's root beer. Root beer, okay. Cool sounding name. Very evocative. But without... Oh yes, the key of the keepers. So they thought at that time. Blanco was fascinated. Akeley seemed to understand a lot more than the rest of them. But there was so much... That the man kept to himself. They said they could help Lone. Apparently, <sighs> ginger root diet, their fruit stuff had made a sensation. Hey, subject. Bunny just has everything. Professor Lee had discovered unnatural tunnels in a place where man has set foot. Have I tried the lemon? Oh, I didn't even know Bundy had a lemonade. Keepers, to be honest, based on their secular wisdom, were convinced that if a solution could be found, they would find it there. The final That's solution. Easy. Uh, 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 oh, no. <laughs> Do you want to get your Twitch banned? <laughs> At this point, it was a leap of faith. But what other choice did they have? Lone could tell himself that this was mere madness. But he had seen this madness in action. He could no longer deny the evidence. The only help could come from this strange cult. He couldn't continue to pretend nothing was wrong. <laughs> oh shit, pardon me. <laughs> oh god, a mixture of rum and pizza. Yeah. Yep. <laughs> Drinking streams can go sideways. That they can, Brad. Should have seen me a few years ago. I was doing um a New Year's drinking streaming. Oh boy, that went sideways. But it was fun. Hey, um. What it would be like to face such extreme temperatures. I think it was last year, me and my mate were um, doing shots for per donations and we got silly. <laughs> the greatest adventure of their lives silly. Was already underway. Silly. We got silly! So any minutes they had me down in a leader and a half of straight scotch. Oh my god! And to you, William. And you, Henry. Wait, is this you the sure. one I was in? That I kept giving you money? Is that the one? And you bought a bottle of booze or something? Hello. 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 Frank Walker, National Times. He's just back from Antarctica to attend to some business here. Got up, threw up, and passed the fuck out. All of you on board. Akeley, good to see you again. Nice. Sentiment is mutual, Lake. The discovery we made is unprecedented in all of human history. I expect that your great depth of knowledge can help us learn. Alright, I have no idea who that old guy is, but he has beard like Colonel Sanders, so 
His name's Colonel Sanders now. <laughs> I funded you a new keyboard and a bottle. That's what I do, buddy. That's what I do. Mr. Palpatine! Are you Mr. Palpatine? Go for Papa Palpatine! Much quicker, even if we must take landings at airports here and there. Correct, Mr. Baron. That's right, Professor. So I'm assuming I'm going to the Arctic now. Yep. For this journey. And that enters the second half of the game, I think. Pump the brakes on your enthusiasm, Lewis. There will be no call for fighting. Excuse me. How, how long does this actually go for? Veteran and an excellent pilot. But let's Seems to be about. Plenty of time to get everyone on the same page. Five, six hours uh, altogether, assuming like you know what you're doing. So we're about halfway through, apparently. Bad, not bad. <gasps> oh shit! Pardon me. <laughs> but how the fuck is everyone in the chat going anyway? How are you, beautiful bastards? <gasps> they left Arkham on October second. Fuck you, Arkham. Honduras. And from there, the crossing of the Pacific began. They replenished their food and fuel supplies in Tasmania. Oh, fucking Tasmania, Mike! Nah. And a chill ran down I'm gonna go fuck my cousin because I'm in an Okay, I'm just gonna stop. Davey, <laughs> <laughs> some fuck storm a stubby holder. Oh. Unless if you're being serious, then that sucks. Yeah, then. <laughs> it was me! I stole it! I was the turkey all alone! It me. was me! <sighs> Fuck. 20 viewers, I still can't fucking believe that. I have not fallen below 10 viewers or stream. This is fucking crazy. It's good. All in all, it was quite the pleasant flight. Allow me to introduce you to my student, and dear friend Danforth. A pleasure to meet you. I am uh, Danforth. At your disposal. Nice to meet you, Danforth. Let me introduce you to my friends, William Blanco. This is my friend, fuckhead one, it's fuckhead two. To meet you, Danforth. We have met before. <laughs> Welcome, Professor. They're probably both gonna oh, die. If I see a tank, yes. Don't I mind mean, the red shirts they're wearing, the Professor. Speak then, Danforth. You know how I hate subterfuge. As you wish. Do you remember the two men who fell sick just before he left the site? They stole the ash. They saw an ashtray that was super glued to the table. Holy fuck! They're dead. Good fucking god! What kind of people do you hate around with to steal an ashtray? And why? Why was it needed to be super glued to the table? Good oh, luck. Wow. And to get to know our colleagues. Jesus. I have to deal with this matter. I'll see you all later. Of course, Professor. I'll try not to get in your way any further. I'm dealing with this unfortunate situation. Actually, on second thought, would you mind accompanying me? No. Fuck you. On this whole affair. New South Wales, enough said. <laughs> Professor of Geology at Miskatonic. Good morning, gentlemen. Mm, yeah, oh, good morning. <laughs> me? Of course. Impatient as always, I see, my friend. This stream started off being serious as fuck, then it just went downhill. Meet you, gentlemen. The honor belongs to us. Forgive me, but a problem has arisen, and not an insignificant one. And it's in my pants. Yes, a great tragedy. That it has occurred now is most unfortunate. It has spoiled the euphoria of such a landmark moment in human history. Professor Lake filled us in during the flight. Stupendous, but also terribly frightening. Absolutely, my friend. As much as any other discovery that has changed the destiny... Oh, okay, that's a dog in the game. I thought there was dogs in the background. We'll see with your own eyes soon enough. For now, there are those poor guys to deal with. No objection in any respect. I hope we can get to the bottom of all this. I wouldn't want to die from some disease before my adventure here concludes. Very black and inappropriate humor. Hey, I black and inappropriate humor is the best humor. I'll be in touch. <laughs> We're headed to the mess hall for a hot drink. Please feel free to join us. Here. Screw you, hot drink or have rum. Follow me. After you. <sighs> after you. No, no, after me. The 
Good morning, Professor. Good morning, gentlemen. Good, Good morning. morning, my friend. This should be the infirmary. Rather, the morgue, it seems. Lone? <laughs> Lone? <laughs> I like people with a sense of humor. Yeah, apparently not dark, though. No, not. Nah, nah. 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 Can't do dark humor here. Too. It's just not allowed. Just now not right? allowed anymore. Right. Name's Long Carter, private investigator. Unfortunately. We're here at the yeah. express request of the professor. There are matters here that require our services. You've come at a terrible time for us. It seems that way. Bring us up to speed, Doctor. Oh, yes. These two gentlemen passed without any known cause. Quick, poke them with a stick. I can't any valid reason for them to have died. Can we help out somehow? I don't know how they know. died, sir. We will be departing immediately. It takes at least a day for such preparations to be made. If Lake doesn't mind, you're more than welcome. But I don't imagine you have any medical expertise. Did you just they assume? Don't. But I could probably help you. Henry? <laughs> Is that really you? Apparently. Okay. Huh. Let's get to work. <laughs> but, when you find out your mum received the first dose of vaccine expect. and try to figure out which high risk group she's in. I'll be with you as soon as I'm done here. You to 60. I want my vaccination. But welcome back, Mel. I want one too. Of course. After you. We take our leave, gentlemen. Let us know if you find anything further. <coughs> oh, Jesus. No. Look, I am still honestly waiting for you to use that voice in D&D or Call of Cthulhu. I'm sure I can figure out why not. Oh, you know, this is kind of how I am not working I spent too much time. I still love um the holiday clip um of me going, you're not a fucking Macy's blimp. <laughs> Disguise yourself as one. A yeah, Macy's blimp. <laughs> No, that was they glorious. look like physiological salute. I don't need that. These must be their medical. Let's have a better look at it. Sven Ustela and Jean Paul ah, yes. Greco. Jean Paul uh, Greco. Both of them were working. Jean Paul. It says it's impossible to determine the time of death. Strange. All internal organs are in. Holy shit! We're up to twenty-two people now. Holy fuck! Holy fuck! Tests for known toxins have excluded all as causative factors. Recommended Mwah. quarantine of all crew due to possible contamination by unknown pathogen. This is where the doctors. So we'll put to citrus in my beer. To an end. And oh, on closer oh, inspection, if this data is correct, then these men should still be alive. Someone's working in the camper. Working the to propane in a beer, and then the I'm going to back off. They would all be dead already. <laughs> Besides, medical counsel is limited only to what physical examination can observe. I'll take care of the rest. Oh, okay, blah, blah, blah. Wait, what's that? Oh, magic powder. <laughs> oh, that's good shit. Magic. Not necessary. A rag of some. A rag. Contains something, but nothing of interest to me. Right? Looks pretty. Weird. I don't know what it contains, and I don't have time to check. How's the adventure? The adventure goes amazing, Mel. This is a fantastic game. It is. Sometimes it's a bit tedious, but a we're first liking aid it. Kit. Some diluent. I don't need that. I have no some idea what medicine. diluent is. What is diluent? Tell me about this diluent. He appears to almost be alive. It sends a shiver down my spine. Okay, buddy. I'll try. Okay, to buddy. Too much. Please buddy. don't wake up on me. Tales of Pesh, ahoy, buddy. Welcome to the stream, my friend. Just comes in. Oh shit, mountains of madness. How would I use that? The eyes of a corpse are one of the few things that still sends a shiver down my spine. Which seems absurd, given all I've witnessed. I can't wait till Chaosium gets off no their need butt to do and that. actually releases that Mountains of no Madness to touch that. campaign book. Which at least like we know. At least we know they're doing it. I don't feel like doing it. Yes, that. at least we know they're doing look, it. But the sternum looks intact. And hairy. The sternum look. The sternum. Hard to tell. The flesh still has a semblance. How would I use that? I see nothing out of the order. It's unlikely his forehead could tell me much, unless it had a hole right through the middle of it. Can I put a hole in it? Can I spread some dust? Some it's magic dust? His forehead could... Unless it had a... Does it have a hole in it? <laughs> Does it have a horn? It had a hole in it. Eh? He appears it to almost be alive. 
Kickstarter, Kickstarter stalker. Oh, oh, these faces are Kickstarter, Kickstarter people. Oh, backers. Oh, that makes sense. How would I use that? No need to do. Surely he wasn't a boxer. Fleshy and pinkish. Most incredible. Fleshy and pinkish. I observe no damage. Okay, please don't, please don't say it like that again. That was way too sexual. I observe no damage. No reason to touch that. Oh, yay, more bots. Nothing of interest. All right, uh, let's, let's kill them all. Dead bodies, mmm, free fun time. God damn it, Mel. The oh, it's okay, Mel's here. Doctor. Mel could kill them. According to yay. his yay. we should all be in quarantine. Bah. All right. What am I meant to do with these corpses? Apparently, we are supposed to be. That looks like a mole. There's something strange about it. Molly, 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 Molly. Well. Oh. I think we're supposed to just look at them. Like, there's not really. God a damn it, Mel! <laughs> oh, there's another mole. This confirms yep. my theory. A transmigration ritual. Some religions might interpret it as the tearing out of a soul. <laughs> There's a fish, it's a mole! Strange moles! I thought a ritual could be used this way. <laughs> for murder. Oh, I hope you're doing good, buddy. Almost faded away. Cheers. I might be able to learn something more from Jean-Paul. Who knows where this poor fellow might be now. I imagine hell would be more pleasant. Floating aimlessly through time and space. Most likely for eternity. Sounds fun. Oh, barbaric. No, nah, fun. Some of the powder I have on me, I might be able to learn more from him, but not from Sven. There's not enough left of what he once was. His essence. Oh, you do have the magic now. powder. Case, I do. I mention. Definitely melanoma. <laughs> so you use, use the magic powder on him, so he can do the ritual. An extract of mushrooms that I brought with me. It helps me relax. Just wait. No, he said he couldn't do it on Sven. No, so you need to do it on the other guy that has enough of him left. What? It must be diluted. And besides, it needs to be poured into the mouth. Alright, how, yeah, so how, how, how do so I So we dilute? dilute it by using um, the tools on the, the jar, I believe. The jars. Because oh. I see them in the video doing something over there. With um, putting the shamanic extract in. They look like physiological solutions. I don't need. Right. Them. They Try like the other jar. Yeah, you gotta, you gotta do something with those things there. That's what they're doing. They look like. The... They look see. like. Hmm. Let's see what the person is doing. Ah. Uh, let's be the medical records. Spend all the they look like physicians. The medical record compiled by the doctor. According to his prognosis, we should all be in quarantine. Bah. 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 Oh, dilution. Uh, there, we there we go. Yes, we go. That's what diluted, that is. Dilutant, and then put it in the. There is just now. what I need. Some diluent. That's just what we need. Mm, magic mushroom powder. This should do the job. Perfect. Mm. Kids, you're gonna see some fucked up shit now. <laughs> Don't forget the gum powder! <laughs> no, you don't put gum powder in there. Gun powder don't go in the mold. Where am I? I am cold. Can't see. I'm scared. Tell me what you see. Tell me what you see. Everything's pitch black. I can't see anything. My legs. My oh, legs. Wow. My legs. Can't feel my legs. I can't feel, I can't feel my legs. Oh, no. Lieutenant Dan, they soon. ain't there. What will be over soon? What's happening to me? Stay calm. It's just a dream. That's a dream. I still hope I wake up soon. I'm sure you will. Who are you? <laughs> You're not going to. <laughs> I'm Henry Akeley, a professor at Miskatonic University. I don't know you. Why are I you in my dreams? 
Je suis croissant. You don't understand. Omelette au fromage. You must have fallen asleep. Jean Paul, was there anyone who wished you harm? Anyone who bore a grudge against you? No. I may not exactly have led a blameless life, but the people I know have always been fond of me. What a strange question to be asked in a dream. Jean Paul, I cannot continue lying to you. I'm very sorry you're dead. to tell you this, but you're dead. You're Somebody de murdered you. You're, you're dead! Friend. Everyone around you is dying! To be a mere dream. Sadly, there is nothing I can do to fix this. But I can help you take revenge on the culprit. A small consolation. But at least it's something. Hmm, yes, indeed. God knows how poor Mary would take the news. I have not been the best of husbands. If you could maybe Of course, because you're French. Of course. Yeah. <laughs> we'll do that. I still can't. I take on multiple levels. Unless would it have been because of that thing? Anything you can tell us could prove vital. It's something Sven and I found. What? What is that thing? Jean Paul! Stay with me! Help! Oh my god! Immediate! Calm down! Oh, Help! Oh. Jean Paul? Jean Paul! He's dead, Jim. Oh, poor soul. But we'll find that bastard for you. That's a promise. I must inform. And away we go. So, we found out. You really can die from the cold out here. As no, I expected. You no, no need to go into more detail. They seem to have found some artifact, but I lost connection before I could find out what it is. Excuse me, Henry. How do you know they found something? What the hell were you up to in there? Yep. Gentlemen, they were killed by ritual magic. Pardon me? Extremely cruel ritual magic. I'm quite familiar Is with Is there any things, other ritual magic? As you probably know by now. I had no idea. <laughs> Not in Call of Cthulhu, it's so all bad. You and I should <laughs> chat, if that's all right with you. William, you are still but an infant compared to myself. Are you certain you want to pay the price for such knowledge? Gentlemen. This talk of yours about necromancy is most entertaining, but if there really is a killer on the loose around here, you're all in immediate danger. We must investigate further. Agreed. There'll be time for small talk later. So that we don't appear to be completely insane, we should avoid speaking of how we came to know all this. I can deceive them by telling them it was some kind of poison unknown to modern medicine. The doctor may have objections, but he will believe me in the end. He has followed my studies closely and knows that I don't make idle claims. We should avoid mentioning that they found some. At least until hard evidence comes to light. Yeah, they would hard. question how we knew all this. That goes without saying. Ah, <sighs> uh, What is in here? Oh, hurrah! Do that, gentlemen. Gentlemen, <laughs> tell us, Lom. Ackley. After careful consideration, I have come to the conclusion that this is murder. Murder most foul. Murder most foul. Murder. As you should well know, <clears throat> I have found no trace of violent death or poisoning. Actually, I didn't find any cause of death at all. But that is simply absurd. We all know each other here, and we're all decent people. Shush, Are Francis. you there? Let's see what they have uh, to say. But do you I'm do? sorry, Professor. Shush. I'm sorry, I'm Professor. I traces of a substance that, I know for sure, is capable of killing any adult man. Something not found in medical But he is more than a man. He is more than a fish. <laughs> really never happy unless you can stick in some esotericism, are you, Henry? Stop your bickering. Like, ask for our help. And that's what we're going to give him. It's true that Ackley's methods thing. aren't exactly orthodox. They've never let us down in the past. So, I'm of the opinion that there could be a killer on the loose among us. Would you rather risk that? Among us? I love the game! If Armitage <laughs> sent you to me, who is the imposter? Good reason for doing so. I want to trust you. But, Lake, this seems absurd to me. Doctor, there will be no further discussion. Also, in light of this new evidence, any danger of contagion seems now to be moved. <laughs> Danger zone! documentation necessary to send the remains of those poor souls back to their families. Sure. Lone, you have complete authority over this matter. At least complete until tomorrow. Authority. The airlift is scheduled for early morning and we cannot postpone it. 
We'll manage. Is there anything else we can do? I have a few questions for you. Ask away. Ask Ben you know Sven. Not very well, to tell you the truth. Neither did I. I knew him somewhat. Can you think of any reason someone would want to hurt him? I can't think of any. He was always nice to everyone. I remember this one time. He was time. always nice Dan to everyone. point. Why are so people so impressive. unkind? What can you tell me about Jean Paul? We chatted a few times. A fairly cheerful fellow. Perhaps even a bit too much. Oh my. But a really good guy. Dan Ford. How dare you interrupt <laughs> me? Oh, God damn fault! You already forgot the bastard! You fucked things up for the last time! You bastard! I'm done. Can you think of any reason someone. Oh, poor Dan Fort. Go ahead. If there were women involved, then yes, perhaps. In this wasteland, though, I doubt it. We are without female companionship. He was really nice to everyone. I see. Really nice. <laughs> Can you tell us anything more about the expedition? Nothing I didn't already tell you on the plane. Tomorrow, after the excavation, we will all excavation. know much more. Abadi's drill should allow us to extract yeah, still taking up that without city. damaging their contents. Their I'm just more, more amazed. Excavation, not excavation. Excavation. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. a true wonder of technology. Well, we've heard some strange words in the strange way. Dagen! 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 Dagen from Dagwater! <laughs> Danforth, where were you at the time of the murder? Surely in my quarters. Am I a suspect? Yes. Nobody is a suspect. Yes, you're a suspect. Because you, you interrupted the professor for the last time! I'm convinced it was even a murder. Fortunately, we have people with us who stop it. Is to yeah, moida. Moida. Yes, Professor, of course. What's a murder? Tell me about Atwood and Dyer. What can I tell you, Lone? They are both luminaries in their field, and I am fortunate to have them here with me. I am quite certain they are above suspicion. I would wager good money on that, actually. What do we know about Baron? A rough guy. Very that is flying high. He oh. <laughs> was busy piloting the very aircraft you were on. Good point, Mike. <sighs> Doctor, uh, where were you when the bodies were discovered? Yeah, I was in the infirmary, as always. I was catching up on some paperwork at the time. Can anyone confirm this? People stop by the infirmary all the time for one reason or another. I think pretty much anyone in the camp can vouch for me. I can confirm that. I God damn it, Dan Wolf! No one asked you! Yes! You stop anything else? Stop nothing giving else input when you haven't been asked for it. Can you tell me anything? nothing else? I See you later. Well, this really helps. I can't fucking see anything. It's too dark. Okay, it's not gonna let me go out there. Any ideas? Let's ask around. I agree. What? Any ideas? Let's ask. I agree. But I already did ask around. Already did. Hmm. <laughs> Is anybody there? Come on in. Well, Still hey there, friend. Time? Sure, I'm on a break. Hi there. Name's Lone Carter. This is William Blanco and Henry Ackley. A pleasure to meet you. I'm Johnson. What can I do for you? I have a few questions. I'll That's only take a moment really of your time. Silly. Very well. There's not much else for me to do right now. The drill was leaking oil left, right, and center. But I got all that plugged up, thank God. Yeah, you did. What can That's you tell really me silly. Stuff? There's a... And this is a Star Wars tabletop RPG, but you can't be a Jedi. Know anything about oh, exactly bonded, the fuck! The Was he the Frenchie or the German? They're coming the in German. an expansion that's going to come out like next. Nice guy to me. <laughs> they seem to have been murdered. Very far, hard pass. No Jedi. Yes, that's what you're insinuating. I wasn't insinuating anything. You're merely after the truth. We were investigating at the bequest of Lake. I'm really sorry, but I don't know anything about those two guys. Thanks anyway. 
What can you tell me about this groundbreaking discovery? Nothing. This is just another job for me. I can work and get some peace. For the most part, at least. I can't deny that going into the mountain had me shaken up at first, but I tend to find myself bored by most things fairly quickly. Let's hope the drill rekindles my yeah. enthusiasm. <laughs> Understood. I, I feel Thank that. You. <laughs> What's your job here? I'm head of maintenance and in charge of the explosives. What was the problem with the Sorry, I got too excited about that. <laughs> Some kind of minor mechanical fault that caused an oil leak. It's all fixed now, though. It's a miracle of technology, but tends to break down easily. It tends to break Fine. down. I'm gonna turn off your fire. From the stove. Okay. No, I'm gonna turn it off. No, your fire is dangerous. Warm one's hands up. Turns off. It bothers me a great deal. Why does it bother him if I go near it though? Because clearly he must be using it for something. Okay. Get away from the stove. Even if I just look at it, holy shit! Yeah, he gets upset. He's he's One clearly. Can you tell me it? many apologies, but clearly something is going on here. Yeah? You cheeky dick waffle. Is anybody there? Come in. Ah uh, yes, come in, Conrad. Come in. Mind if we ask you a few questions? Shoot. Shoot. What can you tell me about Sven Ostjoy? What do you want to know? Anything that might help with our investigation. He was pretty much a complete idiot. <laughs> to tolerate it. Yes. I see. He was a can fucking tell me idiot. Anything about okay. John Paul? A total creepy. Always <laughs> Okay. On and on and on. Right. Gotcha. Tell me about yourself. What do you want to know? I was in the army, a soldier, and now I fly airplanes for old duffers. I could snap them in half with one arm. All right, his accent's ah, just gone. He's just gone out the window now. Like <laughs> yep, he's, he gave it an honest attempt, and then he just gave up. You can say that again, bud. See you later. Got you later. I'll cut you later. I don't want to turn it up. Still. It's already showing the right month. I don't want to take them. They stink. Take them. Take them! I don't want to move a bunk. No time to read right. On the spine it reads, 20,000 leagues under the sea. Hey! Confirm. A bunk. I don't want to move I speak with you for just a moment. <sighs> sure. Go, go, go ahead. Name's Lone Carter. I'm investigating the death of your colleagues at Lake's request. Nice to meet you. I'm Monroe. <sighs> Feeling a bit cold? Yeah. I'm trying to warm up a little over here. Why don't you just go into one of the tents? I uh, wish I could, but I'm out here guarding the d drill. I see. Damn weather has, has taken a turn for the worse here. And my teammate doesn't like keeping the stove burning. Because he's a dick. I convinced him to warm up the room a little for the night. Hopefully he doesn't so change he gets his gets angry mind. whenever you turn it off. I, I don't know. He's not, not exactly your normal human being. You c can't find him in the second ten on the left there. His name is Johnson. We already met him. And I can assure you that the stove is lit. Oh, great. Uh, what can I help you w with? Tell me about Sven. Uh, I'm so sad. He was a great friend to me. I'm sorry to hear that. Can you think of any reason someone might have wanted to harm him? Not that, that I know of. <laughs> he was always so nice to everyone. There's something I must tell you. I fear that your colleagues may have been murdered. Dun dun dun! What have you done that? And why? That's what we're trying to find out. Did you notice anything odd about him? There was one thing. I'm listening. In the days preceding his death, Sven was hanging out more and more often with Greco. Interesting. Greco? But that's not all. Go on, oh, please. He appeared wary, as if he feared something. 
I have no idea why. <laughs> His eyes were white and red, something. as if he wasn't sleeping well. Did you notice any of these same symptoms in Braco? I can't say I noticed anything like that with him. Thanks anyway. Tell me about Johnson. He seems like a rather lonely fellow. Oh, he is. Even though strange is more like it. Mm -hmm. Tell me what you know about him. I didn't, didn't know him all that well. Is there anyone who might have had a grudge against him? He w w was a little outspoken, but all in all, a pretty d decent guy. So, no, no. I don't think so. I hope you g get to the bottom. Oh, don't worry. Why are you out here guarding? It's a very delicate machine. Danforth insisted on keeping an eye on it. Motherfucking doesn't Danforth. doesn't make much sense out here in the m middle of nowhere, but orders out or orders. Johnson mentioned there was a problem. Yes, the oil w was leaking. Nothing that couldn't be... F Johnson has, has already taken care of that. Is there anything you can tell? Not much. Weird to just can't. Always forget. Ahoy, my friend, and welcome to the stream of madness. As we speak. See you later. Bye, ass. Let's go look at the drill. Let's go and do it. Why not? It's very See what we get. <laughs> Complex machine, my ass. <gasps> Take your puppies. Could always come in handy. Oh, yeah, it can. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I picked up the the cooking oil. It's a metal can. Can could always come in handy. Can. Oh, Archie, can. what is it, buddy? Come here. Come here. Oh, Archie is such a such a sock. Archie. Oh, Antwood. You came after all. Gentlemen, make yourself a Gentlemen. Home. Would you like a drink? No, I thanks. would. But love. William, we have pressing matters at hand. The odds are stacked decidedly against us. We must keep our minds lucid. Isn't that right, Henry? It is as you say, Lone. Yet you, Lone, so you I'll have take the face of a man to whom the bottle is no stranger. Never while on duty. <laughs> you agree, Atwood? Of course. As you all may recall, this is Dyer over here. Nice to see you all again. New company is a rare thing in these parts. How can we help you? Ask about Sven. What can you tell me about Sven Osterley? Poor guy. Kept to himself mostly. But when he drank, he became the life of the party. That was such a Remember Sagachi. that stopover we made in Peru? Yeah, you are. That woman went totally crazy over him. Yeah, poor boy. If I'm not mistaken, he was from Germany originally, but his family had settled in America some time ago. I believe they immigrated shortly before the Great War. Good for them. Things weren't looking good in those parts. And yet, what will his parents think if they're still alive? This I don't know. To escape that hell only to lose their son in this land at the edge of the world. It's part of the game, Atwood. It's a risky business. Of course. But it usually involves death from shipwreck, plane crash, or other work-related hazards. You're actually pretty sure. Dear gentlemen, this is now a case of murder. What? Murder? murder? Are you sure? Murder most Blink? foul! Absolutely. This changes everything. Furthermore, the killer is still among us. Could be anyone who was here at the time of the crime. Therefore, only us, Baron, and Professor Lake can be counted out. As we were in Arkham together, along with the crew of the plane. I see. So we are all suspects? Yes. We still have no clue as to the identity of the culprit. Oh, no, we'll assist you in any way possible, Lone. Absolutely, yes. Arf. Professor Lake told us of the incredible discovery. Incredible to say the least. Gentlemen, there are creatures frozen in there, probably from an era before humans even existed. At least yeah, that's sure the only findings we have made. We cannot fully discern their shape without exhuming them from the ice. Yes. Yet they already seem like nothing terrestrial. Can you give us a rough description? You taught at Miskatonic, didn't you, Akeley? Sure. Unless I'm mistaken, you had access to restricted tomes. Dyer. Easy, Atwood. 
It seems my fame precedes me. Precisely. And that's something you should be proud of. These creatures look like they sprang directly from the pages oh of the Necronomicon. As the man Everyone knows about it. <laughs> Everyone, Everyone knows like about it. Most interesting. I can't wait to get to the site. We share your enthusiasm. Hopefully this investigation will not cause too much delay. Shouldn't be a huge hurdle, Dyer. Or at least I hope not. I intend to solve this case as soon as possible. Heading out with a murder hot on my trail doesn't sit well with me. I agree. Top Kiwi streamer has a cat, Nani. Wait, what? Who's Kiwi? I'm certainly not Kiwi. I have the cat here. Don't tell me anything else about Sven. We already told you everything we know about that unfortunate fellow. Can you tell me anything else about the expedition? Tomorrow you will see for yourself. See you later. Catch you later. Whenever you. I don't want to. Okay, anything else around here? I already have one. Good morning. Good morning. If you say so. Not a need. If you say so. so. Not particularly. It's pretty if much 24 hours so. of daylight every day. Can't get any sleep, and my little guys here aren't the happiest either. As you can see. Yeah, all this can't exactly be easy on them either. Can I inquire as to your name? I'm Larson. I tend these poor dogs and take care of the sleds. Mind if I okay. ask you about a couple of things? Go ahead. Things can't get any worse today. What can you tell me about Why Sven Are you trying to make me cry, Lone? It's not my intention. I'm just after any information you might have. Honestly, I don't want to talk about it. I'm depressed enough already. If you don't want to, you don't have to. I'd rather not, if it's all the same to you. Thanks all the same. Do you know Johnson well? No, just barely. He ain't exactly the most open person I ever met. I think he may have fallen into depression, even more so than me. I see. Oh, no. Always forget, Kiwis are New Zealanders, not Australians. Yes, we are not Tell Kiwis. Expedition. And many of us can get offended if you call us Kiwis. Hear that? They are not happy, and neither am I. Doesn't the discovery excite you at all? The remnants of a pre-human civilization. Not in the slightest. A few things I thought I knew for sure are gone, and now I feel even more insignificant. I see. What can you tell me about Dyer and Atwood? They mostly keep to themselves, but seem like decent enough guys. Very cultured and distinguished. I wonder if that's meant to be a little um, tongue-in-cheek joke for the band Dyer and Atwood. Talk about with them. The only time yeah, I wonder. It was when the discovery was made. They drank and celebrated. They seemed like regular folk then. Ah, if only I had studied too. Tell me about Danforth. He's Lake's assistant. He coordinates everything. A decent guy. What can you tell me about the doctor? He's not a head doctor, but oh, I do feel I can talk about my feelings with him. He's very sympathetic. Tell me about Baron. A real reactionary. Stupid as a you not Kiwis and you hate fosses, I don't even know My what's real anymore. <laughs> <here to reason. laughs> what can you tell me about Monroe? A great guy. Always does his share of the labor. Always willing to listen to me when life seems... Do you even have kangaroos? Is Australia even real? Countless times. But just paid actors. No, actor. I can say. Tell me anything more about the expedition. I hope it's over I'm soon. an actor. I want to go home. Y'all getting paid? Nope. See you later. I'm not getting Hopefully. paid, but... Oh, I can't pet the puppies. Hi, <laughs> name's Lone Carter. <sighs> I'm on duty here. Make it fast. Yeah. I've got a few questions duty. for you. Ask them when I'm not on duty. Blake is appointed. Oh, I'm sure he... I cannot... Get... Five, you, you know? Cannot... I'd like to have a look around the... I'm investigating some... Oh, I'm sure he has. But if any problems crop up later, I'll be the one paying the price. I'll need to see the proper papers before I can let you in. I see. Oh, fuck you. Oh, okay. There's now cooking oil in the container. Hmm. Hmm. 
would serve no purpose. Okay, what do we do now? We've talked to everyone. Right, Archie. I know you're comfy and you want to cuddle, but I'm going to have to get you. <laughs> get off. Come on. I forget. I forget. Good boy. Ugh. Get away from the stove. Okay. Fine. Bug you. Okay. Hmm. Any ideas? We could ask Lake if he noticed something strange with those. Any ideas? We could ask Lake. Which one's Lake? I have a few questions. Ask away. Ask away. What can you tell me about John? Have you gotten to meet him yet? Yes. He no, was tense a short while ago. Withdrawn type. Absolutely trustworthy, in my opinion. Sure, sure. Concur. God damn it, Dan was. How would I get by without your approval? Guard won't let us pass. He's a somewhat <laughs> over enthusiastic type. He has to see our papers. I can't help you out with this one though. It would take forever to prepare the proper paperwork to grant access to their personal effects. Gentlemen, excuse me for a moment. I have to confer with Lone in private. Come over here. Okay. Use your investigative skills. Come on. Are you giving us carte blanche? I don't know what you're talking about. Do whatever you need to. This discussion never happened. The last thing I need is to get tangled up in some stupid legal mess. All right. See you later. Can you tell me nothing else? On road did as if you were afraid of something. And that he hung around more often than not with Jean-Paul. I didn't notice anything myself. Then pay more attention, Danforth. You know where the God damn it, Danforth! And correspondence? We usually keep such things in our quarters. But we also have trunks kept in storage. Do you have any idea where the victim's correspondence has gone to? We turned up nothing in Sven and Jean-Paul's quarters. The mail goes out once a month. It's usually not sorted until a few days ahead of time. And there are still a few days to go. Thanks for interrupting me, <laughs> 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 oh. find anything unusual. Danforth, the real MVP of the game. Sven's trunk in the storage tent was practically empty. We haven't been able to get Jean-Paul's trunk open. We can't find the key. And it would be most indelicate to return it to the family after it's been broken open. Understandable. But we absolutely must find out what's inside it. Where were they staying? Danforth? They were in the same tent, along with Baron. Thanks. Where were they staying? Mm -hmm. They were in along with Baron. Thanks. Do you have no any other idea? No. Danforth. Any idea? We can't find the key. It could be anywhere. Any ideas about how to get Jean-Paul's trunk open? We can't find the key. It could be anywhere. Mm. See you later. Whenever you need us, we'll be right here for you. Uh, I can't... I have a few... I school it? No, okay. See you later. Whenever you... Huh. Okay. Any ideas? We should check the personal belongings of the victim. So where is the person belongs then? Hmm. We are in these mountains. They are driving us to madness. Madness? Madness! Madness? What is this madness?
I don't want to turn it off. No, I don't want to turn it off. I don't want to move that. A bunk. A bunk. But I don't want to move that. No time to. I don't want to. Yeah. Would serve no. Okay. Uh, huh. I speak with you. Sure. See you later. All right. We may need to um, consult the ancient texts. Okay, very well. Let us consult the ancient texts. Let's just see. And would you know? Unfortunately, we're out of luck. Because the person whose video I'm using, they ended their stream here. And they haven't played the rest of the game. God damn it! <laughs> uh, Do we have to use our brains? Where's the personal belongings? William Blanc. William. William Blanco, you're in trouble. Any ideas? We should check the personal belongings of the victim. Any where ideas? Would they we should check. So where would they be kept? Huh. I'm assuming they would be in a tent, but... Like, they wouldn't just leave them out here. I assume they... Yeah, they'd probably be in the crew quarters. Well, I've been in all the crew quarters. Yeah, I know, but, like, there's nowhere else they could... They could where they could be, so... <laughs> Always forget. Also, why does this game make me think of the movie The Thing? One last God, thing is fine. Because the thing is inspired the by. Um, fine. The thing is inspired by. Mountain of Madness, so. Yeah, that's that stove that we can't do anything with. Yeah, there's nothing in here except this guy and this stove. This guy and this stove. Mind if we have shoot? These York. Yes. Yeah. This must also have been Sven and John. Okay. Yes. So this is their quarters. Not the best roommates I've ever had. But yeah. Could you tell me where they? In the bunk beds to your left. Uh, so okay. there's yeah. John Paul on the bottom. We're looking for the key to open. Anything about that? Check under his mattress. He was always stashing stuff under. At work, there we go. Find some decent whiskey. There we go. Okay. So now we See need to find that. To check under his mattress, and we'll be able to get a key. I have to climb the ladder. My knees are stiffening up from the damn cold. Oh, seriously? Oh, no fucking stop! Oh, I can't climb the ladder. It's I don't want too to cold. Some old boot. Looks like there's something. In Some old boot. Yep. Some old boot. What did we? What did Let's we get though? Here. What's in there? Wait, is it? Shoe polish. It could come in handy. Yep. Um. Polish. It would serve no purpose. Oh, okay. Oh, well, we can do that. Don't know what purpose that that'll serve. But... Mixed with cooking oil in the container. Now drink it. There's now shoe polish mixed. I suppose if we Find want to poison something. Sven's bunk. Up. Yeah, that's how we get and up there, but. Any ideas? We should check. Yeah, we're, that's what we're trying to do, except um, apparently we we can't climb a ladder because we're... And... <sighs> Let's find out if Baron was right. Oh, there we go. Ah, oh, there we go, okay. Oh, we got the key. Give me a sec. Got something. Bingo. A key. Huzzah! Probably it's the one we're after. Now we just have to find a way to get into the storage tent. Well, I'm assuming that's where there's some um, frying pan full of gunk. Scaly Pete Gumbo! <laughs> Put it in the bonfire. I think the answer that's... Let's, let's, let's see what happens. No. Can we not... Oh, nope. It doesn't look like we can even do anything with the bonfire. So what have we got around here that we can interact with? Drill. Put it in the drill? Hmm. 
would serve no purpose. No. Okay, so... Any ideas? We need to make sure the guard gets out of Yep. So how do we get him out of the way? How about... Make him drink the... Make him drink the shoe polish. What's in that tent? In the storage tent contains all the prisons as well as the bulk of the universe. See you later. Oh, please. Just feed it to the dog. Perhaps I have not made my view. See you later. Okay. It would serve no. It's got something to do with. Hold this. tab so we can see. Hold tab and. Okay, sorry, nothing there. The drill. Examine the drill and see if it says anything. So I'm thinking getting that to. Make a noise as well. us. I've heard that it's the cutting edge of technology. Maybe the food is for the guard. Wait, what food? What food? Or not. It's not. That's not food. That's that's shoe polish mixed with cooking oil. You don't want to eat that. That would be very bad. <sighs> okay. Yep. Anything in here? It's just him and the stove. One last sure. time. See you later. Fine. Uh, nope. What about go back in the medical tent? Get away from this. Ooh, okay. Okay, fine. All right. I won't put cooking oil and shoe polish in there. Go in the medical tent. We might be able to do something with it in the where the bodies are. Unless. Hmm. Yeah. See if we can do something in the infirmary. We'll, we'll check all the tents and see. Alright, what do we got in here? Uh, I don't think... Nah. Alright, let's try the other tents. Oh, maybe the cloth? Come in handy. Oh! <gasps> Are we making chloroform? It would serve no purpose. Flame retardant cloth. There's now shoe polish mix. So, we have to set... Do oh, something... I wonder if we... I should ask Ackley. Henry, can you tell me what's in this jar? Let me see. Hmm. Looks like a laxative to me. Oh! Ooh, we need that. that. Sounds good. Yeah. Some. It might help us yeah. out. We will need that. Alright, let's find the kitchen. It would serve no purpose. I don't need any. We, we could, if we put the laxative in, in the food or something, then... Let's see what we've got, so... Oh, oh shit. Close the game. Oops. Uh, I'm thinking, I'm thinking, I'm thinking, I'm thinking. Maybe throw the flame retardant thing on the, on the guy that goes, Don't touch the stove because I'm a little wanker! Oh, maybe, yes. But otherwise, I think we can use the laxative to spike someone's food. Get away from the stove. Okay. Nah. Alright, fine, you won't let us put a flame retarded cloth in there. <laughs> the laxative on your face then. <laughs> yeah. Okay, what about that? We'll go in the mess hall, that's where we want to go, that's where the food is. Alright. Um so let's see what's in here. Containers, stove. Don't touch it! Turn it off. It's cold in here. But we can Let's see what happens. Oh! <laughs> My God, what a stench load! Almost done. <laughs> here, it's turned all black and slimy. Okay. Container. It serve no purpose. Oh, we've got a container now. So I don't know what we do with it. What about the flame retardant cloth? Would serve no. What if we put that in the stove? It would serve no. All right. What else have we got what in here? What do you? Uh, we don't need to know any. You ask know the about the guard. The storage tent. Sure. He's a somewhat overzealous type. You can say that. It won't let us in. Actually, it contains property of the university. Gentlemen, may I remind you that this? Perhaps we can help. Take this flask. It's full ah. of something Paris finds irresistible. Hopefully this will be enough to persuade him. And we'll put the laxatives in It will in be after we put laxatives in it. 
Thank you so much. See you later. Catch you later, gentlemen. Whenever you need. It will. <laughs> it will be enough once we put Lex. This could it. just. We're gonna give him the shits. Yep. I would call this explosive cocktail. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, let's go give it to him. Yeah, I'll always forget. Uh, it's always um, some some reason Twitch is now a lot more faster on you than YouTube. Yeah, I've noticed that too. Is this catch your fancy? I hear it's something you're quite. Let me see it then. Thanks. I'll gladly take a pull on that. Oh my. Yes. Now go to the toilet. You can keep it. Thanks. Now that we're a bit better acquainted. Could... I already told you. Have a great day. Three, in a moment, though. two, oh my one. God. There we go. Oh my God! Go, son, go! <laughs> go to the toilet. Fantastic. Now I have access to the. God, pick that back up. Suppose we don't need that anymore. I don't need to. I don't want to move. It's locked. I can't reach it. There's nothing inside. You remember, we do have the key for the one that's locked. So we I do. I just um looking around first. No, that's my dice. You can't have that. No. Well. It fits. There are random odds and ends inside. And a letter. There's no trace of any sort of valuable artifact. A letter? It might hold some vital clues. Mary, our worries are over. In addition to the lavish paycheck from this expedition, I think I found, on our last outing, an object of immense value. It should make us a lot of money. Tell your brother to get in touch with that certain person. Unfortunately, we will have to share the spoils. Jean-Paul. P.S. A bit worried, because that weirdo Johnson, whom I mentioned previously, seems to be breathing down our necks, as if he suspects something. I'll just leave the key here. Hmm. To recap. John Paul and Sven found someone probably saw them taking it and killed them for it. Considering the manner in which they were killed, I would say the object is not something that possesses mere monetary value. But they couldn't have known that. Johnson appears to be the prime suspect. Can it really be that easy? Let's have another. Yeah. Don't touch that stove. Yeah, that's not sus at all. <laughs> nope. Clearly doing something with that stove. We can smack him over the head with that Yes that we made. <laughs> Let's do that. Oh Johnson confront him with what we found. Hello there. We what found some interesting find? things about you. What can you tell me about Jean Paul? He was I'm sorry he's dead, but I'm That's not very the truth is it might be nicer if it includes if you say so. Thanks anyway. Can you tell me many apologies? See you later. Fine. Do we have the letter? Mary, I'll tell you about John Paul. Use the letter on him. John Paul's letter found oh. in his trunk. There we go. Let's use it on Mary, him and see if tell we your brother can. Jean -Paul. What? Oh, we can't. Okay, so we have to. You have ideas? no choice you but to. Figure this thing out, John. Any idea? Yep. All right. Well. Get away from. Okay. Hmm. It would serve me. Use it on the stove, maybe? See if he... No, he still won't let me go... Go in here. Actually, wait, wait, wait. Let's talk to Monroe. Monroe. See what Monroe wants. No. Go to Monroe. Sure. I suspect it may have been Johnson who killed John Paul and Sven. Johnson? Yeah. This letter pretty much says it all. Strange. He <laughs> did... They didn't seem to me to be the m murdering type. The strangest thing he has done so far. 
is to go loopy every time loopy. someone goes near the stove in his quarters. Yeah. He'd be hiding something in there. We have to get him out of his quarters then. There's oh, only one thing that will get him out of there. If there was uh, some problem with the drill. Good idea. We'll see what we can fix. Let's put that black sludge in the drill. <laughs> oh, yeah. Ta da! Bingo. That yeah. Alright, Johnson, out of your quarters. So we can look at your stove. <gasps> and we and use the, the fire retardant blanket to put out the stove. Yep. Let's see what the hell he's got burning in there. Because he's clearly got something suspicious burning in there. Drill has another that couldn't have happened. It seems it could. There's black stuff spewing out everywhere. I have to get this under control immediately. Oh my god. Please don't touch anything while I'm. Oh, I'm gonna touch everything! Don't touch, especially my stove. Don't touch that. We all know what happened last time I was in a tent. Fucking gypsies. <laughs> I have no reason to turn it yep. off. I have no reason. <laughs> we have gonna just check what it. What do you mean you have no reason to turn it off? I could serve it. Oh yeah. Just check it and see what's in it. Then we'll turn it off. I have no reason. There seems to be something incandescent inside. Now we have a reason to turn it off. I better turn off this. Let's give this. How a do we turn it off? There we go. Okay. I turned it off. Oh, now we use the, the cloth yeah. to get the thing out. Perfect. Some time in the what snow has cooled it off. Looks like a key. It must be for Johnson's trunk. Oh, the other trunk. Which yep, the other oh, locked well. one. Let's check before the guard <laughs> Come on. He's still having an explosive time in the toilet. <laughs> yeah. Let's see what Johnson has hidden away in there. I hope it's the right key. I'll give it a try. It's empty. There's nothing in here. Well, well, well. Oh, dear. No, Kuching. Ah. If it is death you wish for, I can grant that. But first, I go. can't believe I revealed myself all for nothing. You were so far off track. I expected better from you, Akali, and you two damned yokels. So you are the one who killed those two men so brutally. Brutally? I never even spilled one single drop of blood. I was doing the cleanest job of it until you all showed up. Prepare yourself. You will be with them soon enough. And don't you dare take even a single step. I could always say that you attacked me and I had to defend myself. Blood drinker. Uh oh. Itona. Itona. Glean noto. Blood drinker. Itona. Itona. Haha! Was close. Oh my God, Johnson! You saved us all. Did you really think the keepers had no one in place to keep an eye on all this? This explains everything. Why you were stalking those guys? I was sure they had something to hide. They seemed nervous and furtive. I overheard them arguing inside their tent hmm. over an object they found during the last expedition up the mountain. It seems the dissidents got to them before I could. There was nothing I could do to save them. At least now we know who's behind the murders. Let's take all this to Professor Lake. He needs to know the truth. When this scum wakes up. I'll make sure he spills the beans. He's waking up. What? We found this in your trunk, Danforth. How could you? I trusted you. <laughs> Goddamn Danforth. Danforth. Kill for profit. Profit? Oh, you, Lake. You tiny man being so full of himself. You don't know anything. How dare you? I took you under my wing all these years. <laughs> I'm sorry, Lake, but you won't be pulling this ball out of his hole. Stop him! Oh dear. Sorry, now. Ah, he's dead. There's nothing we can do. He's dead. But how? They couldn't tell Lake all the details of what had happened. It seemed, as Johnson warned them later, he was with the dissidents. That same group of men who tried to capture Lone in Arkham. The mystery had deepened in its intensity. 
Not even Johnson could explain their presence Fucking there. Fucking Danforth. But everything led it's to that him gigantic this whole time. and the secrets it contained. The goddamn Danforth! The were made as fast as the mood around the camp fell. That's they why he kept on the talking. The following day, some of them carrying the drill, the rest bearing a platoon of men. The journey was exhausting. The three men could now hey, nod along cheap. whenever the topic of the terrifying Antarctic climate came up. Finally, they arrived at the entrance. They were overwhelmed with amazement. Hewn out of the mountainside was a doorway, not of any natural formation. Oh, here we go. The biggest surprise yep. was still waiting for here them. Here we go. Uh, yeah, I'm a and I'm digging a hole. Digging a hole. <laughs> Oh, da no. no! No, don't, don't let them out! Why you fool! You fool, you fool! For how to be of any help. Patience, oh, patience. We'll figure it out eventually. If you say so. Ah, oh, Archie. Okay, you can be on me, just a Grisbestic. I don't want to disturb him. I don't want to disturb it. What are you doing, Henry? I have already seen these creatures. I don't remember when. And surely not from this short distance. Interesting. I'll inform you if something should come back to me. Back to you later, then. I don't want to disturb it. He's hard at work. He's Damn, coaching. Why do you have to have Zumi? I don't want to disturb it. <laughs> You taking photos of the what are you cat? Doing, William? Yeah, me, because he's, he's climbed up on somewhere he rarely goes. Extraordinary discovery. Thank you later, then. He's clearly busy. Strange. Oh. God, God damn it, people! Dug, dug too deep. God damn it! I can't get closer. This discovery is astonishing. It's incredible that I'm still able to surprise myself. Europe. Yeah, that oh, well. Fuck. Here they are. The elder things. Creature attacked as the echo of screams pierced his eardrums. Time stopped for Lone. Had he died? He couldn't know that. He felt strangely wonderful. He began to see gigantic, colossal creatures which flailed in suffering as they were violently tormented by a fighting swarm. Where had Lone seen those creatures before? Then came an enormous black sea. Dense, alive, gigantic, that consumed what remained of the unfortunate demons. And then he woke up. Well, oh, shit. And everyone's been torn to pieces. And we have one dead el elder thing. Yep, only How one. Save the one that attacked you. That thing attacked me. And that vivid vision came to me. Did I do all this? Henry? William? Professor Lake? Oh, I can't bear it. Don't let that be Lake. It's as I feared. And over there, poor Paris and Atwood. At least. Were I those like Paris. lily hit. Such brutal ends. No, th 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 those were elder things. things. Come on, yeah, Archie. Sure get off. Were. Archie, get off. Good boy. Are you trying to get my dice? Oh, God, it's not even, even letting me save. I wonder if it still works. This object. It's not letting you save. Hmm. Yeah, it's not. It must be. Oh, God. Poor. It's not it's giving me a drop down menu. They were good people. Let me check if Link still has that strange artifact on. It may prove useful yet. Oh, my God. 
So horrible. Or Lake. Ugh, he has it. Not okay. Now yet. we get the strange key. Why would I want to touch? Well, you just did. Incredible. Also, dis I don't want to touch that. I'm too bad you're gonna touch it. Touch the elder thing. Lick it. Sabaton and Amanamath do in Twilight of the Thunder Gods during a heavy thunderstorm that would go down in history. Yes, it would, boss. Yes, it would. The pictogram. There's no way I could take that one. Unless I could somehow detach it. Well, good luck. We only have it's this. No purpose. It seems to represent some sort. There's no sign of life. Archie, shh. There's no way I can. Unless I could... Mine is making no noise. He's just attacking the back of my head. <laughs> I no bad cat. Some kind of dark mass is attacking and absorbing the polypoid figures. It brings horrible recollections to mind of the creature I encountered in the caves under Innsmouth, and which has taken up lodging within me. The Shogoth. Hmm. Archie, you have food. I'm not picking you up again. I would not. Uh, ain't it always that way with cats? It fits in the key. It has no handle. And in we go. Oh my. The key is needed. Um. Oh, oh okay. we have a key. You do have the strange key, but. No. Nope. Oh, not anymore. You don't. You've used it. Okay, well. Um. He's not moving. He's not moving. Nope, there we go. Ah, okay. okay. So he just can't move in that room. Well, what are we supposed to do in there? Did he just bug out in there? Oh, there we go. Now he's moving. Hmm. Strange. Maybe if I go outside, if I can. I have a feeling you can't, because I think this is the end of the game, or this is like the last area of the game, so... Hmm. We'll try and go outside, see if we can. This doesn't seem to be... Yeah, he won't even walk that way. Um, okay then. Why would I want to... Oh, God, these poor people. I don't want to touch... Incredible. I don't want to... don't want to touch the older thing. Doesn't look like there's anything here. What the hell am I meant to do then? I wonder if it still works. This, this object bro. What else have we got in here? Let's see. Tab's not doing it, anything. Tab's not doing anything. Okay, so... Yeah, looks like we have no choice but to do something in there, because he won't go outside. Hmm. Can't remove those. It seems to represent no sign of life. Stars and plants, no configurations that I'm familiar. There's a certain huge mass in the center that feels very ominous. 
Yeah, that's a thought. I recognize dinosaurs. But they are infinitely larger than Gives me the chills. Some of these figures are horribly reminiscent of those that were trapped in the ice. Others have similar features, but have a larger mass at the base of the head. It looks like an exposed brain. Megar! Yeah. Yeah, that's Megar. Oh, oh, yeah, yeah. Some kind of battle fought by winged creatures against gigantic beings. Some of these remind me of the image of the tentacular being I have often encountered in my investigations. Akali said it was known as Cthulhu or something like that. Not all of them are the same size. And one of them seems to dominate the others. Well, the Shoggoths did have a war with the Elder Things, because the Elder Things created Shoggoths. And then we can't... And if we go in there, there's nothing, so... It's door lock. We've already... I can pull the key back out without having to rotate the Ah! Door. Ah! Oh! Take the key. Awesome! Ah, lovely! We get to keep the key! Put it in there. There we go. Put it in. Lovely. Ah! ah. Like... Ah! <laughs> You're getting ah, close ah. to zero stand now! Yeah! Strange creature. You are unlike anything we know of. One part of you we know all too well. The splitted part is calling out, screeching, gurgling. Yep, they know all about the Shoggoth. They don't know what humans are. Oh shit, my arm. Yep, your arm is turning into Shoggoth arm. I have it under control again. There's no time right now to try figuring out the deeper meaning behind all this. You're it's slowly turning into a Shoggoth. Fun! Alive and in danger. Incredible. I can easily control it. Well, actually, you'd be a Shogoth Lord. Shogoth Lord? Yeah, they're, they're not as big as normal Shogoths, but they're smarter, and they're the ones that are more human-like, so... The one from Lovecraft Country is a Shogoth Lord. Oh, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Huh. Okay, so we got a weird puzzle here. So that's down. It goes up. Okay. Up. Up again. Up again. Nope, nope, down. Okay. Huh? Ah, so when we press that, the one on the left goes down. We go up. So then... Now... But we can't do anything from here, because if we press that, we'll go down, so... Press one of these. There we go. Step on the one. That's it. Press that. Go up. See what happens. And again. Nothing. Okay. All right. Let's ride the. Yeah. Let's ride the one on the left. Ah, there we go. So now we've got all three of them on the same level. So now what do we do? Uh, no, that made them go back down. Uh, God damn it. <laughs> Let's see. 
before it's come down. And then that goes up. And then and then we can't go any further, so we need to get them all on the same level somehow. Okay, press the one in the middle. Alright, step on the one in the middle and press the button in the middle. And we'll see. Yeah, pr pr no, no, press, press the one in the middle and then you can go on the, um... Mm. Yeah, I have, I have an idea. I just want to see if it works. So you go on the one in the middle, press up. Now, move on to the one next to it. See what happens. Now move on to the left. Oh, okay. Well, I thought that would do something, but... Alright. Wink. Okay, so that makes them... Because that's what I think you've got to do. You've got to keep swapping between them. Can you maybe use your tentacle to hit the other button? If that'll work. No. Ah, oh, you'd think you'd think that would work, mm. but God damn it! Oh, all right. Save, save in a new slot because I think this is all right. Now we just need to get them up onto the next level. Alright. No, oh. no, 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 stay, stay, stay. Now move on to the middle one and see what happens. No, alright, alright, load, try again. So I think we're making progress, so I don't know how to do I don't know what's happening, but. Alright, that makes it go back down. Alright, so uh... it has to be the middle then. Uh... It's gonna be one of these. Alright, press... No, 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 press the one on the right again, see what happens. No. Nope. Alright, load, and then press the middle button. Alright, now move... Move to the left and press that one. Oh, we thank Christ! <laughs> oh, oh that was a trial. That was that was tedious. How far up it goes. Damn you elder things, why can't you just build an elevator that works like a normal elevator? That was completely unnecessary. Simply wondrous. I have no idea what this city's called. No, nor do I. Incredible. It's just the elder thick city. Huh? That doesn't sound friendly. These guys again. Oh, okay, cultists. Ah, it's the cultists. Sweep the entire My god! There are so many of life. them! Eliminate them. Well, we've got a Shoggoth arm Most we can use to kill him. Go back to your guard posts. <sighs> Escaped my hair's wit. What's all that over there? My eyes are still adjusting to the sudden light. Oh, hi there. Hi, hi. it's William. Henry and William. It Guys, can you hear me? Round. Chestburster. You're alive. Yes, but don't strain yourself. 
We've no, seen, no. we've all seen no, aliens. We know not to no, get them out fine. of there. Wish I could see the same from you. William, did William make it? Alone. It's horrible. He was screaming. These cocoons are digesting us. Mmm, I mean, William. He doesn't sound too fussed about it. No, he, he doesn't care. Henry, take it easy. Just give me time to figure out how to get you out of this. Long. Don't worry. I, I, I just need keep fighting. William, can you hear me? Long, my friend. He's in terrible shape. <laughs> Kill him with the shock off the heart. Unfortunately, <laughs> it's no good pulling him out of there. It would serve no. Okay, bye. See you guys. Have a beautiful Can't time. Really do anything for you. Uh, use the mouse wheel. So you can increase. increase or decrease the game speed. Oh. Ah, oh, because we're gonna be moving. Ah, oh, I see. Because look how fucking tiny you are. That would have been amazing to know earlier, or it could just be for this bit. I think it's just for this bit because of how big it is. Looks like yeah. Wraith cartoon, ca cartoons, cartoons from Stargate Atlantis says the deceptive underscore one. <laughs> I have not seen Stargate Atlantis. I'm not, not a big fan of the latest Stargate series, but I'll take your word for it. I can't take that. An S-shaped spiral. Well, Stargate has a lot of elements that are drawn from Lovecraft, so that's probably intentional that it looks a bit like that. One of the offshoots looks like a leg. Okay, so we've got a leg, a spiral. We are in the yellow city. The city of yellow. Oh, apparently, apparently we can use the Shogoth arm on those, on these things. Ah! Uh, they will say stuff. Some kind of giant. They called it the Great Ancient One. Somehow know the symbols mean. Big Daddy Cthulhu. I have access to memories that were never mine. Do they come from the creature within me? Yeah, you got access to the Shogoth's memory. Okay, so now we can try the other one. Do, 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 do. Come on, little loon. Do your loony thing. Loony. Do your loony thing, little loon. <laughs> Looks like a command to conquer red alert. It Soldier when he's out. Cthigna shall be aligned, and the great old one shall be awakened. That Never heard of be Cthigna. Our we shall hear the piping of the pipers, and the insane god at the center of our universe shall swirl, gurgling, for all eternity. Mm. Gurgling Swim forever. <laughs> Interesting. Alright, so we try all the other buildings we can get into. So I think that's the one we came out of, so... Where do we go from here? No, no, no. It's all... up there. What about, is that door right above you? Can you go in there? Oh, uh, that, that's the door to the cocoons. Oh, it's cocoon building. Yeah, that's right. But we've already been in... Gotta be more than two. I would. I would think there would be more than two yeah. buildings. Oh, there we go. Shit. Oh. Kill him. I didn't. What? I didn't know that they could. Okay, so uh, we don't go there. Oh shit. Ah, there is a third building. It's off to the bottom right. Yeah, that's it. You're heading towards it now. Ah, there we go. There we go. So, okay, what's in here? Stone. 
it could prove useful. To ah, distract the guards, I'm guessing? Can, yeah, I assume we can use that to distract the guards. Oh, hello. Oh, we can use the stone to get them out of the cocoons. Our friends. Oh! Did you find an, a walkthrough? I found someone who, who I weapon. found someone else who played the whole thing. Enormous. Gigantic. Can thickness a weapon? Continue doing it. You must stay focused. I, I don't know what it is. I never heard of it. Cthigna. No, they must have invented it for this game because it's not um How dare they? It's not actually anything that exists in Lovecraft. Alright, friends, we shall rescue you from the cocoon. Using my rock. Yep. Because it's a sharp rock. Wait. I'll get you out of this war. Kill me. Oh, he's fucked. Yeah, he's dead. William, no. Williams, Williams done. We still have Aikley, but... Oh, William. How do you feel? <sighs> Alone. Alone. My friend, hang in there. I beg of you. We've come so far together, but... Stop struggling, William. I'll find a way to get back and help you. Alone. Listen to what he has to say. Alone. Alone. You have been a true friend. Thanks for this adventure. Thank you for everything. Uh, you slap him in the face William. with the uh, sugar thumb. Yep. Uh, Finish you off. Crush your neck with my sugar thumb. William! No! It's okay. We've entered the climax of the scenario. This is when people will start dying. Alone, calm yourself. This is no time Oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> Naruto, thank you for gifting yet another you. sub. I'll deal with the rest of this. You insane <laughs> madman. <laughs> that makes 18 <laughs> subs uh, is being given to this channel. Well done. Thank you. needs to be done. Now I think so the yes, guards will be gone. Tw just 12 for today. Well, 12 today, but it says 18 all up for the channel. You insane madman. Love ya. <laughs> nope, nope, no, nope, no. Nope. Oh, it's still there. It's still there. Okay. Let's see. Oh, hi there. Let's have a look. Alright, so let's see. Um, I've got... Ah! We have to make them... Um, I'll show you what they're supposed to look like. We have to make them look... How... Oh, wait. Um, just seeing what the person's doing. That's a sewing machine right there. It is. That's a sewing machine. Let's have a look. Alright. Okay. Um, take that one and make the, the one you're using now and make the long part of it face right up. That, no, no, no. Keep going, keep going. That one more. A little bit more. Keep going, keep going. Make it so it points straight up. Yeah, one bit at a time. 
So the You're other going. way up? Okay. Yes, yeah, so the other way up. Okay, that's it. Now that one, take the, that one and make it... Okay, keep turning it and I'll tell you when to stop. Like that. Like that? So keep, you know, keep, keep going, keep going. So we missed it. Oh. Keep turning it all around. But, yeah, like that, I think. Um, oh, no, a little bit more to the left it was. No, no, oh. keep, keep turning it around. We just, we, we, oh. we were a bit too late. Keep going, keep going. We've got to have it, see where your cursor is? That's where we want it pointing. Oh, here, up here. Keep going, I'll tell you when to stop. Keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going. Keep going, keep going. Keep going, now a little more. One more, that's it. Perfect. Now that one, we just spin around. Um, until we get it right, because that's what the first time. You did it! Yeah! And it will make a passage! Into the motherland, the German army march. Huh? Oh, no! <laughs> that's... That, no, it's shock off. He's gone. Well, we're not gonna follow him. <laughs> yeah, we are. Oh, no. He's gonna see. Ah, oh, he's hiding there. He's doing his own thing. We'll just leave him alone, because... Hmm. God, I believe that would go down in history if Metallica's have a both played during the belt holes. Yeah. Yeah. Not. Well, kill him with the shock offer. <laughs> hey! Uh. Vitus Venus, haha, yeah, I had trouble figuring out some of the puzzles too. Ah. So I could see my scenes. <laughs> well, welcome to the channel. Won't be needing these anymore. <laughs> Won't be needing this! Nope. We'll dress up as one of them. Oh, not, not Vita's Venus. Vita's Varnus. Sorry, mi miss saw your name, bud. You must be Lone Carter. Aquila, don't you recognize me? Mm, I've never seen Sabaton you. Sabaton of Mars, Cloud. Let's go Even Sabaton Man of War. Or Sabaton Lordy. This would not be possible. Alchemy? The Keepers have used this science for centuries, to never run short of men, or have the most loyal of followers anyway. We share, in part, the memories and thoughts of our fathers, even if the exact memories of our founders may have blurred over time. A very nice man once dubbed us automatons. Automatons? But I would argue that we are quite oh, human in every respect. Okay. So I would say. Oh. Well, I didn't expect you to charge straight into the lion's den. I had enough time to send a message to the, the keepers of my before head. I was captured. Your cat's weird, Dale. He is, he keeps licking and attacking the back no of my head. <laughs> we should have seen Archie the other night, I thought he wanted to be really cute and cuddling because I was really sad. No, he just wanted to start licking and making out with my armpit. came here through some kind of ritual? Yes, that was his way of comforting you. Yeah. But doing so, to him, that's comforting. Yeah. And to do so, Mm, salty, this, sweaty goodness. The, oh, 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 oh. the price was high indeed, but it is ingrained in us to make any sacrifice needed for the cause. Why did the keepers lead me here? The ancient ones are not a secret to us, but we did not know where to find them. They created the creature that merged with you, and it still dwells here to this day. It appears the dissidents are having a hard time controlling it. Maybe that's why they were hunting you, and why this is the last place on earth they should have led you to, but they couldn't have known. The dissidents hold sway over the last remaining ancient ones. From what I understand from the pictograms and the tunnels, they all abandoned this place long ago. Indeed, but they would never Indeed. have left the city unattended. The ones we encountered were not exactly friendly. It's full of Those are little more than things. mindless beasts. No. The society of the ancient no. ones is very much like a beehive. They left a multitude of warriors here to protect the city and the Shogoth. They can do nothing but attack. They cannot think for themselves. What you have said makes everything a lot clearer. What name can I call you? You may Bob. call me Falco. 
My cat liked to take my socks off while I sleep. <laughs> oh. <laughs> well then. I got nothing to ask. That's an interesting cat. Yeah. Victoria used to steal my, um, cats. She used to steal my socks. My cat steals everything, just not, not socks. He's never done that, but he steals everything else. Your cat is a filthy dice goblin. He is. He steals dice, he hides them in places I can't get to. Oh, let's go to the Grand Temple. Or oh, do I want to have a walk around here first? See what, see what's just around. I used to sleep with my socks on, like, when I was, like, seven. Now it's naked or nothing. Can't, <laughs> can't do clothes. So uncomfortable. But then, then everyone says, Oh, but what if there's a fire? What? No, it's not. Bitch, do you know how fast I can put on clothes? <laughs> They're usually my pants are, at the, at, at, like, right at the end, end of the bed. All I need to do is put them on. Hey, you. Yeah, yes. What are you doing, slave? Hmm. I've been waiting I've for been you. waiting for you. No need for that kind of pleasantry here. You must be new. I've only been here for a few days. Very well, let's go. The prophet is about to arrive. I well, I can't believe they fell for that. <laughs> the prophet. Oh, it's Tokalana. Oh, Tokalana. Kazma Kurt. He's my big scene in the game. Oh, is it now? I've never heard any of these chants. Oh, it's Koi Tanakal. Koi Tanaklu. Koi Genitalia? <laughs> The time is almost upon us. Wayfarer of the plan, bless us. We invoke thee. Yeah, yeah. Bring death to the keepers. Yeah, the game's desires sent me audio clips of him saying them so Begin I could pronounce them properly. Wait, 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 wait. Vitas, this, this is you? Holy shit! Dale, we wow. have we have someone. For, holy shit! I uh, I saw his Facebook post Plus, earlier today where he was telling off this character that he voiced. And the hybrid. you're the oh 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 no! Is anyway. the cult leader? Now I feel really bad about what I was doing. <laughs> oh shit! <laughs> Uh, that is really cool. So yeah, that is. Wow. Well, thank you for joining this tiny stream. It's him. Get him. <laughs> He's run out of MP. <laughs> one D ones, one D one hundred cellos. Are in alignment. Yep. Master, and apparently the final ingredient was delivered directly to our front doorstep. Bring him here. It's a great performance, Peter. Um, Sounds also, very okay. sinister throughout the whole game. He sounded. Quite wait, 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 wait. Uh, Dale. They just said, yep. happy to be here, I'm also a recurring character in a Call of Cthulhu RPG series. Hmm. You do know we run that every Master. second Friday, right? <laughs> we do. <laughs> you do the honors. But if you would like to drop a link to that, I would love to give you a follow and check you out. Because uh, me and Dale, massive Lovecraft fans, we do... Call of Cthulhu every second Thursday on our sister's channel, Dungeons and Dagons. Yes. 
At the moment, we are running Delta Green. Well, Dale's running Delta Green. Well, yeah. Green so at the, the moment, we're doing Delta Green, but next campaign, we're doing Escape from Innsmouth. Ah! Oh, my God. It's working. The Boss, Shoggoth is coming from within you. The Shoggoth was in you all along. <laughs> Master. Yeah, yeah, control of there we go, sorry, just um, stopping that to open a link. Ah, so the character you're named after may be an avatar of the Elephant. Well, ain't that just a coincidence? <laughs> So am I. What's happening? It's not working, Master. Get to safety. Yes. <laughs> and what was that, Neil Athertep? Neil Athertep. If I'm gonna show it off, I gotta show it off. I'm facing the right way. Long. Yeah. <laughs> I have to go back. Sure did, Venus, and I'm seriously considering pledging to that. I did not, but Dale did apparently. Oh my God, long. Loan. Basically, it's a book full of uh, Halloween-themed scenarios. You son of a bitch, I'm in. I'm still waiting for you to do Blood Brothers. Yeah, I know, I know. I know, <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. The thing is that he's still alive. Next one shot we do, I've got a bro Blood Brothers one planned. Yay! One of the one of the Romero ones. <gasps> yes, I would have been good with the Evil Dead one, but Romero. Yes. Alone in that unknown and desolate wilderness, Lone and Akeley had fuzzy memories of how they managed to get back to Arkham. Both agreed on the fact that it was the imprisoned keeper who made. Uh, Dale, do you want to put uh the links for uh Dungeon Dagons in the uh, Twitch chat? Sure can. Met with Armitage several times before the We're also on Spotify and nine other podcasting yep, platforms. Well, I've, just put a, I've put a link to our website, which has links to everything else on it, so... Smart man. Surely their idolized deities would again find a way to breach the human soul, evoked by that fearsome creature that must once have been a man. Lone made his decision. He would protect the world and avenge William. The battle had just begun, and he was ready to face them. The end? Question mark? That was a very typical Cthulhu ending. Like... That was... Like, almost didn't stop the cult, and, you know, may not have stopped the cult? We don't know. Yeah, that, yeah, that was very typical Call of Cthulhu ending. No, I liked it. I I enjoyed oh, it. Oh, that was a yeah, that was a good game. I enjoyed that. I'm gonna have to. We've got an original song here for the end credits, and we are going to love it. Well, actually, first off, first off, I need to change my stream info because I thought I'll, this would be in more parts. <laughs> yes, but no, it's a reason. It was reasonable length for the type of game it was. So. Yeah, I, I just like really enjoyed it. Enjoyed it. Like so. when you think of like Prisoner of Ice, that was only like three hours long. Yeah, it was. There we go. Uh, no, I thoroughly enjoyed that. That was really good. It was. No, I haven't played the first Chronicle of Innsmouth, but I am gonna buy it. Yes, I've made him aware of it that it exists. Because we did not realise this was a sequel, yeah. <laughs> and I found out that it was, so I've made Liam aware that there is a game before this one. Because I just found out about this game from a Call of Cthulhu Facebook group a few days ago. Oh, my god, the music. Uh, um, besides some of the um, voice acting, like uh, the... The groundskeeper just sounded like one of those stereotypical 90s pony click things. I think that was the point, but yeah. the important thing was that 
the main characters found the main characters were done well. Like the character you play as and his friends and the cult leader, they were all done well and that's what counts. The the oh, NPCs yeah. and stuff, we don't really care that that he sounds, yeah. you know, a little bit flat. Must have been huge. This is this was made in Adventure Game Studio. Interesting. I had a feeling it might have been. I have no idea what that is. Oh, uh, the engine that the game is made in. It's an engine I've tinkered with before. Uh, Vitas so, is um, the group called Call of Cthulhu role-playing game game and players. Because uh, he just said he he may have been the um, one who shared the trailer. Yeah, I I saw your post in that group, Vitas. Um, I saw your post in that. Oh, group it is. It is. Were, yep. Uh, showing off. <laughs> The scene from near the start of the game where you were saying that you have to detect him. That. Yeah, that, that's where I uh, found out about this game. <laughs> <laughs> well, I mean, we don't blame you, Vetus. If, if, um, you know, if you did voice acting in a game and, and you've done a good job, then yeah, you should be proud of it and share it around. So. You really should, mate. That was. No, it was really good. I. I... Enjoyed it. I recommend this game, Hidden Gem. Yes, definitely. By uh, Rainey's recommended games. We'll uh, definitely be trying the first um, Chronicle of Insight. Yeah. But wel welcome to the end of the stream, buddy. <laughs> yep. Now time to play the other games. I do uh, voices over Zim. Well, Vetus, if I ever need someone to do voice for my games, I make text-based games mostly, I will definitely remember you, because that was a cool performance you had as the cult leader. Gee, thanks, Dale. <laughs> <laughs> Just replace me like that. Oh, you could be a different character. But no, uh... It's been v a while since I've actually made a Cthulhu game, and I've only made one Cthulhu game, so... You should do it. And I just voiced all the characters myself <laughs> in that. And, um, Vetus, good performance, and that was a really, really good game. I had a lot of fun playing it. Yes. Very faithful to the, um, to the old point-and-click games, and it kind of feels like what a sequel to, like, Prisoner of Ice or Shadow of the Comet would have been. Hey, Cap Survivor, ahoy. 21 likes on uh, YouTube. Nice! I voiced an alien in an upcoming comedic P PNC game. PNC? Point and click. Oh, point and click. Okay, I've ne yeah. never heard it. Heard it. Um, done that. In an upcoming point and click game. Nice. Well, you had me at point and click game. You had me at point and <laughs> click. I hey, Naruto, love. One time, I'm gonna run D and D, and I'm gonna have everyone beat King of the Hill characters. <laughs> Whoa. So We'll have Dale, and we'll have Dale throwing his fucking fan. I don't know you, that's my purse! Oh, man, there's traps in there, get your thieves pulled out and make the deck check to unlock the traps there, Bobby. Well, uh, Vetus, if you would like to uh, join my Discord and drop a lot of point-and-click games that I should play, do it, because... I do really love point and click games ever since growing up in the 90s, playing point and click games with my sister, like the old Sierra games, Kings Quest and Space Quest and whatnot. I love point and click games. So, yeah. yeah, it's a genre that I sort of missed out on, but I still enjoy them. Uh, another point and click made by one dev and voice all characters by himself is Detective World Hard Case File. Death of the Space Donor Hunter. I've heard of that one. Hmm. <laughs> Naruto, I have a feeling you'll be very welcome. <laughs> um, and yeah, I've heard of that one. Um, we need you. Armitage, when I hear your voice. Oh, uh, Naruto, there's no Discord command on Twitch. It's pretty much all on the YouTubes, but I will just... Drop my uh, YouTube, my Discord link in the, what do you call it, chat. Uh, Not sure I will ever, ever voice all the characters in a game I make again, because... I don't know why, but my leg shake. Uh -huh. 
so, shoot the messenger alone. I thought he died. Given your current position, I thought he did too. I be the one to worry. Remember Innsmouth. Oh my god. Innsmouth. A joint operation between the government and the FBI is underway. Already? Things seem to have taken a turn that requires immediate action. You will be in charge of the operation. Hmm. Understood. I'll be there by this evening. Loan. What is it now? I recommend you take the greatest care. So the government and the FBI, would they be talking about Delta Green? Yes. Or well, awesome. they were talking about what will become Delta Green. Yes, because... they're going to make a raid on Innsmouth. Yes. And then after the raid of Innsmouth, we have Delta Green. Well, that was just amazing right there. <laughs> Yes, that was. I really liked that. Vetus, well, well done on the voice acting and pass my um. Uh, yeah, if you speak to the devs, tell them we really enjoyed yeah. it. Thoroughly enjoyed the game. It was so good. As a fellow game dev, it has inspired me to go and make a Cthulhu game of my own. And as a game player, um. Okay, I didn't get, haven't gotten this far. <laughs> well, you, you just enjoyed it. You just enjoyed it. Yep, just enjoy it. <laughs> <laughs> Holy shit, we've been going for six hours. This has got to be my longest streaming in a very long time. Yeah, well, we enjoyed the game, so... We did, and six hours, indie game. That's, that's yeah, pretty decent bad. length. Pretty decent length. Yeah, especially, like, imagine if we didn't look up the solutions to the puzzles. We could have easily gotten another two or three hours out of it. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit alright I'm going to head off my dear friends um, I'd like to say a whole, first off a massive massive thank you to Naruto for so many subs and all the biddies today you sir you are fucking awesome thank you for the 22 likes on YouTube thank you for all the biddies by Technospawn and th three raids tonight yeah. holy fuck Everyone who's come to YouTube and Twitch tonight, you guys are fucking awesome. And to Dale, of course. Thank you for joining yes, me. of course. Well, I mean, I've got D&D &D all ready to go, so <laughs> it's not like I was in any rush to <laughs> yeah. get out of here. Well, we, uh, we actually ended pretty early, I think. Yeah, we did. But if you would like to just... If you would like to stay up to date of when I'm streaming, or if you just want to come hang chill... Uh, feel free to join my Discord to stay up to date. Or, oh, I'm just repeating myself now. Uh, and if yeah. you want to hear more of my voice, come and join us tomorrow on Dungeons and Dagons for some D and D. On which streaming services are they? Oh, let's see. Now we've got YouTube, Facebook, D Live, Twitch, Spotify, iTunes, Google <laughs> Podcasts, and like five, six, or seven more. <laughs> Where you'll be hearing this lo lovely voice, because I'm not doing the Tibetan. You'll be hearing that tomorrow. Yep. And then, then on Friday, you'll be hearing Detective Ambrose, who may be revealing a few secrets or not. We don't know. We'll see what happens on Friday. As we enter into the final half of our Delta Green campaign. Oh, yeah. Uh, thank you so very much. Um... Yeah, check out my sister channel, Dungeons and Dagons, if you if you love D and D and Call of Cthulhu as much as me and Dale do. And I just want to keep saying, you guys are fucking amazing. Yeah, that was a fantastic stream. Thank you so very much. Uh, and I'm blown away. I have had someone in the stream who actually voice uh, done a vo voice act job voice in the game. Acting in the game. That's holy shit. <laughs> Thank you, Vetus, and everyone else for making Liam's stream very good and making Liam happy tonight. You guys are awesome. And also, I did not fall be below 10 viewers, which is, holy shit, amazing. Yeah. <laughs> you guys... are going to be partners soon. Oh, God, that's that's going to be a long way away. <laughs> anyway, you guys are awesome. I'm going to go and have another drinky. I will see you guys next time. Hopefully, I'll see you guys for D&D. &D. Until then, rock on and have a good one. Say bye, Dale.